Hello? Is this working? It says excellent connection. Okay, if you can see and hear me, please say... Meet Larichelle, my staff-locked ultimate Iron Man. Today, we're going to be taking on one of Magpel's greatest challenges. Wh who did we meet? Meet... Meet Larichelle. Can, can you hear me? Meet Larichelle, okay. And I am recording. Okay, it is working. Good morning, everyone. Meet Larichelle. My staff locked Ultimate Iron Man. Today, we're going to be taking on one of Magvel's greatest challenges. Not the greatest challenge, because that was Ghost, ghost Ship, which, or Phantom Ship, which we already finished yesterday. Today, we are going to be doing the Grotto Keep level, which is also pretty difficult. <laughs> Look at this guy. Creatures of great strength and speed. Eight strength, seven speed. Lab Rochelle's Mythbusters. Look at all these monsters. One-eyed giants. Inhuman strength. Eight strength. Houndoom. Might be Houndour. Four strength. We do have an Adiosa mode, but they won't be on the next map. Skeletons infused with tremendous magical strength. They can wield many weapons. We got the monster crawl. Maybe we'll see Adios. Corpses animated by evil power. The undead Lulger. They're so bad. Sniper! <laughs> How could I replace Lab Man with a diversity of inclusion hire? It's the climate we live in, okay? Why do you assume she was a diversity hire? She was fully qualified. How dare you? Mm. Thank you for the $5 microtransaction, Silver. Hey, Dancer! We will be... maybe meeting them today. Pupil. Uh-oh. One magic, one speed. <laughs> uh oh. Soldier. Average foot soldiers. Hey, better stats than you and. A great knight? Who are they gonna use for this sprite? There he is. There he is. High defense and mobility. They do have high defense. Troubadour? One magic. Mounted maidens whose sacred staves. Eight uh, sacred staves for the GBA. Alright. Let's go. Chapter 14. Father and Son. I think the first thing we need to do... Manager inventory, right? Ephraim looking okay? Franz looking okay? Hold this barrier staff. Can we give it to... Not Amelia? Not Ford. Lab Rochelle. Can she use this? She can, that's good. So Barrier is really good, because Barrier gives you a lot of XP. Staff XP. Uh, and you don't have... The target doesn't need to be injured. You can use it on anyone. That's really good. Also, it increases your res. We love res. It's actually going to be pretty important on this next map, because this next map has a bunch of winding corridors where enemies are going to be hitting you with long-range, incredibly dangerous status stabs. So Barrier... Unironically, going to be very useful. So 
the fronds looking okay. We definitely... I think we have to memorialize Hatchet by Gary Paulson. Just put it in the convoy. My two-use Iron Axe. Let's just sell that. Take an Iron Axe, and then... I think we'll just take two Hand Axes, right? We have literally zero. Okay, we gotta go buy Hand Axes. Hey, Dad. Nothing but a small loan of an 18-use Hand Axe from my dad. We definitely have to buy Hand Axes. Man, why is Ford's inventory so packed? I guess this is fine. You gotta give him all these options because he sucks. Tana's probably fine with that. Does Amelia need two Iron Lances? Probably not. I think she needs two Hand Axes. Let's get her another Hand Axe. Lab Rochelle looking good. Calm. I don't think we're going to deploy because we get Renak next map. Molder looking good. Definitely needs Restore. Restore we need on both of our staff users. We can give Dusel a Javelin, I guess. Okay, our Javelin supply looks okay. Our Hand Axe supply does not. So we gotta go buy Hand Axes. I think we have to go all the way back to Eid. There's an Ariados in the way. Good thing we have the Ariados emote. Skirmish! Fun fact, in the Japanese version, instead of Skirmish, it says... Start of a battle. Like, the full text. It, it looks ridiculous. I did press record this time. Fog of War. Can't hope to beat Aridos. We're out of here. Adios! We take a quick peek at Amelia's stats? Sure, after I buy these, uh... Buy these items. Welcome to the armory. I'll take a... Javelin. Okay. And a... Hand Axe! Daring today, aren't we? How about... Ten? Welcome to Fire Emblem 8, by the way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wonder how long those will last. Imagine adding the option to buy in bulk. I think it's okay not to do that in this game because... Well, I don't know if they anticipated people just using javelins and hand axes. <laughs> Let's make sure everyone actually has a javelin and hand axe. That wanted one. Ross with two. We don't need a halberd. I'll take two. We can train our axe rank. This one only has six uses. Welcome to GBA. <laughs> HU's, your birthday is tomorrow. Happy birthday. What did you miss? You can't get me. All right, we have three stat items to distribute. One of them's not very contested at all. We can just do this. Yes. Is it really alright if I have this? It's so beautiful. It's, it's, it's as if it's whispering to me. It's saying... shall not save you.
We updated the voice line. <laughs> Since it's such an important graphic, because we always have rest. Now your magic will not save you. I also added the counter spell sound. Everyone's favorite stat. Thanks. Okay, that was easy. Thanks, Protoman113, for finding the... Uh, your magic shall not save you. You like Foul Sorcery? I didn't delete Foul Sorcery. They're both there, but... If I had a choice, I actually would have used... Your magic shall not save you. We have an energy ring, and we have a speed wing. So those are the two best stat boosters in the game. Who do we give them to? Let's talk about the energy ring first. So who actually needs the energy ring? This also, I think, is our last map on... Ephraim Root. So we're going to flip to Erika Root after this. Which means that... We could also give them to somebody on Erika's Root. Oh yeah, boots are better. Ford needs help? Yeah, but I hate Ford. Like, I don't think I want to use him if I can help it. It also works for magic. Franz? I don't think Franz needs it either. So Ephraim's totally fine. Franz has 15 strength. Level 3 promoted. Ross has 24 strength. I think he's okay. Oh, Ford has 10. Tana has 12 and she hits twice. Dusil has 17 strength. He's fine. I think we should give it to Tana. Because these... These enemies are no joke. I think we kind of have to be serious. These enemies are just so strong. So we should give it to Tana. Well done on those last few battles, Tana. Where would we be without your wings? Here, a symbol of my appreciation for your efforts. A gift from Prince Ephraim himself. I'll treasure it forever. I wonder what this means. It means you get plus two attack. Okay, so Speedwing, probably the best stat booster in the game. Ephraim doesn't need it. Franz doesn't need it. Ross doesn't need it. He has 17 speed. I hate Ford. Tana doesn't need it. Amelia doesn't need it. Lavershell doesn't need it. We're not using the other units. Molder doesn't need it. What's Ross's speed cap? There's no way he's reaching that, right? Give it to Dussel? I don't know if we're going to use Dussel the entire time. Ross already doubles, but maybe he won't double for the entire game because enemies are really fast. This might let him double like gargoyles. Dazzla? Dazzla's hopeless. Dazzla's hopeless. Nine speed. What is it going to eleven do? Save it for Ewan. Ewan probably will need it. The issue is that we're not going to use Ewan until basically the end of Erika Root, 
To the end of Eric Root, we get an item that increases your growth by 5%. And of course, we can't train our trainee without that. So we would have the best stat booster in the game just sitting in the convoy for the entirety of Eric Root. That would be such a tragedy. Use it on Lab Rochelle. She's good speed, though. I don't think she needs it. I think we give it to Ross. He doesn't, like, need it, need it, but... He fights a lot, so it's always going to be four avoid, even if he... Even if it doesn't matter for him doubling. And there's no way he reaches his, his speed cap. Lightning Legs Ross. I think we give it to Ross. Could also give it to Garrick on Eric Arud, who joins pretty soon. Or Cormag. A lot of people need this. But I think Lunatic sca stat scaling is so intense that... Ross needs it. Eventually. Save it? Hoarding is a pitfall. Hoarding is a pitfall. If I got a resource, I'm using it right now. We're fast. There we go. Okay, stat boosters used. Inventory managed. I think we're ready to go. There's a big difference between almost always doubling and always doubling. I don't think we're going to be doing either. We'll see. Boston. Okay, Grotto Keep. Here we go. Major story battle. Mur returns safely to Ephraim's side. A noble warrior to the end. Selena fought with great honor. I think we crit her and killed her, right? Never once using Mur as a hostage. Ephraim renews his vow to pierce the veil of mystery surrounding the Grotto Empire. Spears are piercing weapons. Selina is added to the list of innocents who Grotto must account for. Very dramatic. The center of the Grotto Empire. Emperor Vigard should have been here. But... but Chapter 14. Grotto capital. It looks like it hasn't changed at all since the last time I was here. Eric and I came here once long ago with our father. Dussel taught me the lands, and I studied history with... Ly... Lion? That's what it looks like. They spelled it with a Y. That's Leon. That's Leon. I never imagined I'd come back here armed for battle. Memories? Memories. Two years ago. I gotta make sure we we're accurate here. There we go. And so, the hero Grotto and his companions used the five sacred stones to steal away. The evil of the Demon King, and his wicked soul was locked within the Stone of Grotto. The Stone of Grotto came to be known as the Fire Emblem. To this day, it's kept safe and honored as a national treasure of the Empire. I think that's about it. For more on Grotto's life, read Founding Emperor Grotto. Comprehensive. It's so big. Talking about the book, of course. And the letters are so small. 
Ugh. How can you read this? There's no pictures! But you have to read it. You don't want Father McGregor to discipline you again. I'm no good with books. The problem is they don't move. I get bored silly. I understand so much better when you explain it to me, Leon. Yes, but... Kinda weird to be helping you all the time. It's just that I admire you, Ephraim. I want to be strong, like you. Brave. And handsome. This isn't ominous at all. I've got an idea. Why don't you teach me to wield a lance, Ephraim? I can't let my defeat to Erica go unchallenged. I look foolish. Oh, I think Leon even, or Leon, even back then, was a dark magic user. Which is pretty cool. Isn't that cooler than using a stick? It's a deal. We practice tomorrow, though. If you want to beat Erica, you have to take this seriously. Just go easy on me, alright? Great memories of Leon. Ephraim. Ah! Earthquake 100 base power? Another tremor. They happen a lot, don't they? Are you alright, Mer? I mean, she literally flies. Yes, I was startled. Ephraim, this place. Did it always shake like this? Yeah. Grotto's been prone to earthquakes for a long time. Tiny tremors like that happen all the time. Don't worry. Really? Um, Ephraim? What is it? I can feel it. From inside the castle. I can feel... Darkness. I feel a broad pool of darkness. Deep within its walls. Perhaps it's coming from the throne room. That's where Emperor Vigard, the man who started this, is. Let's go. Let's go, Mirror! This country was vibrating with motion. That's that ridiculous elevator line from Yik, right? Father. Vigard. The Silent Emperor. Father, have we been foolish? When you died, I couldn't accept the loss. I... When you died? But he's not dead. He's right there. Isn't he? Uh-oh. I remember when I was a kid playing this, I was like, what? When you die, but he's right there. Hmm. <laughs> a bolt of brilliance. What a twist. If only I'd been stronger. <laughs> What's the erg? Why is he erging? Your Majesty, enemy soldiers are headed this way. Oh, Prince. Hi. What's wrong? Why such an unusual expression on your face? I'd rather you didn't look upon me as though I were some horrid beast. I... I, I beg your pardon. Did you say we were under attack? I want all of you to strike the foe. Bring your weapons to bear on Ephraim. Is that acceptable, father? Do... Do as he says. Understood! Right away, your majesty! Leon the... Leon the Silent? Command Grotto, Emperor Vigard. Destroy Ephraim. The Silent Emperor. Yeah. 
Oh boy. Check map. Alright, where are the status staves? Where are the... St okay, there's a chest. The druids. Man is 29 magic. I'm pretty scared. Berserk staff. Okay, I can't check their range. It's magic power divided by two. So they're gonna have like 15 range status stabs. So just have to assume we're going to press A on them twice. I am. It's not working because they don't have it equipped, I don't think. This guy has... They both have berserks. I think we're just gonna have to run them out of berserk uses. Just have to assume that their attack is gonna hit, because 29 magic is crazy. And range increases with your magic level. What do these guys have? Silent staves. They have 20 magic. So our healers have to be near each other. And they have to be ready to cure each other. Even on vanilla, this is really hard. Bring a restore staff? I already have both. Well, this guy is still a lolger. Any stealables? The door key that drops. Armor slayer. Chest key, door key, red gem. A longbow! That guy, okay. Oh, Sword Reaver. It's just a Sword Reaver, though, not a Sword Slayer. Oh! Steal of a Body Ring. Increases Constitution! That guy, okay. It's an Archer. So how fast is he? Nine speed. We get Renak this level, so Renak can do it. We don't have to field Colm. Okay. Can somebody remind me, where does Renak spawn from? Maybe it's Renak. Top right? Okay. So I think our strategy is... We're just gonna ignore... Are we gonna get any pressure to get this chest? I don't think so, right? Are there enemy thieves? Aside from Renak. I think what we want to do is just forget, although our army starts off split, we're just going to forget about the left side. Because these status abs are too dangerous. We need our healers together so they can heal each other. So we're just going to mob everybody and then go up the right. That's what we're going to do. We also have to go to the right to recruit Renak. I think we're just going to have to bank on... The enemy status is just breaking. I don't think we can dodge them. We're just going to have to have restores ready. And we have to make sure that both of our healers don't get status because if that happens i think we just like lose so that's our strategy and then we can just have renak go get all the chests we don't have to worry about door keys or anything we'll leave it all to renak after we recruit him why is this guy deployed why is this guy deployed? We'll keep the others. Why is this guy deployed? 
Fernac comes in this map, doesn't he have the silver card, meaning there's a secret shop here? You are correct, there's a secret shop here, but you need the member's card. Which is a pretty big mistake that you just made. So I'm afraid that this is the end for you. Although I believe everyone will agree that it is justified. What a shame. I'm glad you are taking responsibility. Sorry that it has to be this way. You have failed me, in turn. It is you who should suffer. Be content that your death is a quick one. I cast this member! Cost zero if an intern deceived you this stream. Strip target intern of their channel membership. Then they die. Horribly. <laughs> Let this one's gruesome fate serve as a warning to the rest of you. It's the member's card that lets you access the secret shop, not silver. A mistake you won't be making twice. I wish it was the silver card. We need at least one door key, which step we can just get from drops, and we can just give it to someone. We have the pocket dimension, right? I need two hand axes. I guess we can give it to Tana? She's really mobile. We got chest keys, we got door keys. You did miss a feeding. If you see a bunch of ghoul emotes. I think after this map, there's gonna be a really... It's gonna be a lot more chill, because we're gonna flip to Erica's route. And it's gonna be a lot easier. But Ephraim's route is no joke. Wreck it, Ross. And then we'll have these high mobility units over here. Because they can just run and join us. Here's our crew. Get ready for status staff gaming. Our convoy is actually shared with Erica Root. Let's just make sure that like, none of our items are that valuable, right? May as well put these in the convoy. I don't know if we have any axe users on Erica Root. Ah, oh, Garrick, yeah. Let's see the staff range. It's only 10 for this guy. Silenced. Eric is a bow user? What are you talking about? There's no... Why would you ever go ranger? I mean, it's very reasonable, but I would never do it. Berserk. Berserked! <laughs> Ridic... I think they went a little too far with this. He's the best archer in the game? I can't argue with that. Okay, that guy doesn't have it. Okay, he's just sitting there. Alright. How is Amelia doing? Okay, 
is your answer. Gotta quit the hand axe. I'm not scared of magic. I use the I use the talisman. All right, so we're currently level two. That means there's a two percent chance each battle to activate Great Shield, which negates all damage. And that's why you go general, for Great Shield. Let's support him. If we fly up there... Too far. We don't even double, okay. Bronze definitely does, right? does. It's kind of scary. I mean, let's just do this. Let me get the kill with Tana. Maybe I should have moved forward first so we got a support. I should have done that. Ouch. Hit rate's terrible. You think you can set up the Tana the Talented? 2% chance to activate Great Shield, 2% chance to crit. I want this guy to attack us. I also want to move my units up. I guess I can just do that. Mulder has weapon triangle advantage. If I do this, that's probably as far as I can go. That's fine. 15 damage is a lot. We can heal it, though. It's actually zero damage. Oh, level 19 Ephraim? Pretty good. Who's this guy? <laughs> the spectacular capital of Grotta, the richest city on the continent. With my expert eye, I judge this card to be an incomparable treasure. Once this is all done, I think I'll just scamper off on my own. All right, so what do we got? We got strength, we got luck, and we got the best stat, right? Pretty good level. Pretty good level. Your magic shall not save you. Don't worry, the final boss is a mage, okay? And where is sleep range? It's huge. It's huge. I think we can go into sleep range, though. I don't know when the bishop acts. Hopefully it's not first. I want to get rid of this guy. Can we show him the light? Shine? 17 times 2. The shine. This guy's toast. Just do it for melee. <laughs> it, <laughs> nice hit rate, pal. You think you can stand up to Ross the Ripped? Alright, here's our strategy. We use Amelia. Looks good. The unfortunate thing about using the hand axe is we don't get the really cool uh, melee axe animation for generals. All right, we're probably gonna get slept. I hope they sleep us last. Oh, barrier, oh. I should have barriered Amelia. Can I still do that? I can. Here comes the XP. It's the caffeine! They can't put us to sleep now! The barrier! Your 
magic shall not save you. So this guy has 20 magic, and our armored unit, Amelia, has 20 res! What, what are they gonna do to us? <laughs> they may as well just surrender. We're just gonna ignore this side of the map, just forget it. Did these guys even attack me? I guess we can attack this dude. I don't really have to though. Somebody need did somebody take damage? No, nobody took damage. I guess we'll just move everyone up. Just gotta make sure I wish you could keep that active. As long as we don't enter sleep range. Gonna have to do it next turn anyway though. So our goal is to get up there and recruit Renak. Now here comes... Okay. <laughs> this is why we got a general. We're waiting for... You think you can stand up to Amelia the Armored? We're waiting for... Great Shield. We need Great Shield, otherwise... Oh, you think you can stand up to Amelia the Armored? We got the crit from our support chance. Nice sword. You think you could stand up to Ephraim the Eviscerator? With my sword reaver, I'll attack this lance unit. That'll show him. Expert tactics from Grotto. <laughs> Actually, Grotto's finest. Those guys can follow us, that's fine. What's this guy doing? He's having damage. We're gonna have to kill those guys eventually, but we'll do all the time sensitive stuff first. A spear! They didn't even try to sleep us. <laughs> Or si oh, it's silence. I don't know if these guys move. It's a general's responsibility to lead the army in war. That's why Amelia's at the front. We don't even kill him. Alright, we should move Ross first. What are we gonna do without Ross against this Steel Lance? You think you can stand up to Ross the... Okay, now that we're supported, this guy's toast, I think. Well, he's probably toast. Not toasted. Not toasted. Franz does need to be healed. We can get in support range. We can have Franz do this. Good unit, by the way. You know what they say! Old toasters! Toast toast! Someone's gonna get slept this turn, but that's fine, we have both of our healers. Definitely need healing here. They can reach there. They just put... I can't put Tana there. Can't reach, but... Can we put Ephraim there? With the Iron Lance. Probably need to mend, because our magic sucks. The Healing Salve! Mold are very good against these Armor Knights up there. And Emotional Support Dusel. 
Oh, oh. Oh, no, it's fine. Door key. Just send it to the convoy, right? It's fine. Oh, no. What are we going to do about these infantry units closing in on us from the rear? It's actually a lot of damage. Does, do we double this guy? We're so fast. We do not. We do not double this guy. It's lunatic mode. That's crazy. We have, I think we have 18 speed. We didn't double him. Giving up on the Hamurn guiding ring and 10,000 gold? What do you mean? Uh oh. Molder the bold. No problem. No problem. You think you can silence the. Uh oh. 100 hit chance. What? Dussel the deranged! Of the deranged. Berserk four. Do so. Come to your senses. When I was a kid playing this map, I was like, status stabs, what are those? And I just totally ignored them and I kept getting wrecked. You can't ignore them. <laughs> you cannot. You 100% have to deal with them. If you don't have restore stabs, this map is... I'm not going to say it's impossible, but someone's going to die. A brave leader. Opens the convoy and takes out a door key. Alright. Say goodbye to the clergy. Oh no, we have the resistance though. Say goodbye to the clergy. <laughs> That's a terrible hit rate. Why is he so fast? Why are our hit rates so bad? That does kill him, right? Yes. You think you can stand up to wreck it, Ross? And now we're supported? We maybe have to actually attack this guy in melee. One short. We're so weak. Okay, that hit rate's much better. Alright, no hand axe gaming this time. What if they deal seven damage to us, though? Shown. Lots of experience from that powerful promoted unit. Okay, so I think our goal is we're just gonna go up here, right? Rescue tactics. Tana can be part of the wall. What about Hermern? What are you talking about? What about Hermern? I think Dussel might actually get doubled. Uh, we can kill this guy, right? We can't shine him! It's in the southern vault? Like, I, I don't- I actually don't know what you're talking about. There's no way she gets 16 strength. Oh, with the steel lance. Uh-oh. Might not have been the best rescue drop. <laughs> yeah, I'll just have her not get it later. Like, I don't understand what the issue is there. 
She'll dodge. She's in support range of Ephraim. I want to get damage there. If we do this, then we can shine him, right? Do we get doubled by this mercenary? I doubt it. No, the steel sword. And they have bad hit anyway. You think you can stand up to Ford the Flash? That's kind of good, because now it means that... Beginning to look a lot like Lindis. Oh, oh, horrible! <laughs> Ford the Flaccid. Horrible! Well, now it means that we don't actually have to. double with Molder. We do, but like, we will double? It just means that we don't have to take a counter. I guess we'll just shine them. Okay, we just need La Rochelle to not get hit by this Steel Lance. Don't tell Kaga. have our lightest weapon equipped. Hey, we don't even get one shot! What a tank! My steel lab coat! We didn't even need RNG! We just have good stats. And then Renak comes right to us. I think as long as we only have to deal with one Berserk Staff, we can just cure that each time. Uh-oh. We're getting chopped. That's a lot of damage. We have so much HP, though. Shown! <laughs> yes. Uh, that other mercenary can't even reach us. There's no way we get doubled, right? There's no way. Okay. There's no way. Myrmidon, kind of scary. The longbow! The longbow! We're fine. The longbow! We're fine. Okay, I didn't realize there were longbows there. I guess we should just back up our... The longbow? The longbow! We're fine. I guess that was lucky, but I don't think it mattered. Oh my god, they actually move. Oh no. Berserked! I guess we just have to... Do so the deranged! Okay, I guess we just have to wall off Renak. Because we can't actually... Recruit him? With La Rochelle. Because she has to heal. <laughs> Amelia the Angry. Man, good thing I didn't put my Pegasus Knight on either of these spaces, right? I totally didn't realize these guys had longbows. Alright, well, we don't want Amelia to solo our army. Don't tell Kaga. 
Okay. If I restore from this tile, the enemy cannot hit me. So let's think about how to do this. I think all of our actions are going to be important. We do get to move after getting Berserk cured. We probably want Lara Shell or Labra Shell to heal from the safer spot. I think this is the safer spot. Is it? <laughs> so we have to wall off the bottom? And we have to wall off the left. So five... Five units need to be in position to wall something. Amelia can both kill this and wall a spot. But this guy's weakened already. This guy's kind of scary. Yeah, he's got a killing edge. This guy has to die. I think we sword slayer him. Because with sword slayer, we can just one shot him. One damage, 99 Slayer. <laughs> you guys know the Sword Slayer is a good weapon. If we if we heal from this spot, and if we put Amelia here, then this guy can't reach. Let's actually do that. 99 wood cutting. You think you'd stand up to Amelia the Angry? No great shield procs yet. Okay. We gotta kill the- wait, no. Well, he can move up there, that's fine. Okay, Mulder... Has to- has to restore Dussel, so that's his turn. Guaranteed. He can't do anything else. Which means that our line of three, I guess... If Mulder is exposed, that's kind of scary, because he got hit. And the archers reach... reach these tiles. So I don't want to wall there if I can, I want to pull back one. I think this guy... I think we Regileaf him, right? Yeah, we Regileaf this guy. Wow, he has 36 HP, but we deal 37 damage! Regileafed! <laughs> Perfect. Restore Dussel. And I think we can rescue drop and back up. Yeah. We definitely have Dussel as part of our wall, right? That's no problem. Do I have any swords? I don't. Oh, I do have a lance, though. Why did I say swords? The boulder. The boulder! I can't pick him up! I only have 10 aid! The boulder! I, mean, I I can pick him up with four. I can go 
here. Yeah, because we, we can't let Lara Shell be exposed. And then I can take and drop him back one. Yes. Okay, and Renak. I don't think he attacks. I think he just tries to steal. I hope he doesn't attack. Let's just put Dusel in a corner. And hopefully he chooses, if he does attack, he like attacks Dusel, which is fine. Can Franz just sit here? Because that way we can finish this guy off, which would be nice. Sure. I think we did it. I think we did it. This is a lot of strategizing. Renak, please don't attack me. The issue is we've got to deal with these incoming Berserk stabs. That's fine. The Steel Sword! We're okay. I don't think we double, but even if we, even if we get doubled, it doesn't matter. Oh, the Franz level! Franz the Fit?! Ron's the fast. He's de Isn't that the exact same level his brother just got? This is fine. Oh no! 16 damage! We probably have to wait for the Berserk Stabs to break before we can actually recruit Renak. Because we have to cure- Oh, the door key! What happened to door keys? They got sent to the convoy. Uh-oh. I didn't know that guy could reach us. It's over. Unless we dodge this. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over! It's over! Okay, we have to be cognizant of that berserk- of that- Wait, why do you do this? Molder, Molder the Mad, not Molder the Mad. It's not two RN. Stabs are one RN. So that was actually a ninety-three percent chance. It wasn't like ninety-seven. I will bring honor to my father and my kingdom. Saved by Molder, And actually, we can... I think we can kill that... That bishop. If we kill that bishop, then we don't have to worry. We gotta go kill that bishop. I think one berserk is broken. Yeah. We're safe, we're safe. Molder. A man of faith! If not for Mulder dodging that, that would have been a reset. Saved by Mulder! Reputation restored! I, I gotta make sure to use the correct staff. Oh. Almost leveled up. We need a ten dollar macro transaction for Perilous Paradigm. Hi, cheese. What's a good Effie game to play for a first time? I deal and GBA. So I... you can't get me, man. You can't get me. You're doing this on purpose, right? You're doing this on purpose, but I could, I couldn't deny you. Give me a second here. Uh, uh, minor errors? Uh, hang on. 
Maybe I changed the place on my computer. It's it's my fault. It's not your fault. I found it. Okay. Hello, and thank you for calling the Automated Imported Cheese Content Pipeline. Your inquiry is important to us. For frequently asked Fire Emblem questions, press 8. Please hold while we connect you with a representative. This call may be recorded for quality assurance purposes. Thank you for your patience. The answer to your inquiry is... For first-time Fire Emblem players, I recommend Fire Emblem 8, The Sacred Stones for the Game Boy Advance. It's incredibly easy, and you have some freedom, but not too much freedom. <laughs> my favorite Fire Emblem game is Echoes, my favorite character is Kanas, and my favorite class is the Swordmaster. Thank you, and we look forward to any future inquiries. That's your question? What are you doing this turn? A million enemies are right there. We're gonna kill every last one of them. What do you think our plan is? You're welcome! Why is it called Telefang Get the Telehaft, but what about the Fang? Like, why is the game called Telefang? I have no idea. Oh, it was, a, it was an actual question? Oh, okay. In that case, I'm sorry I was so condescending, but... You can see that I get asked that question a lot. That's why I decided I'll never have to answer it again. I'll answer it once. This is also decided. We have to do this. Doozle the deranged. Okay, it wasn't bait. Okay. Oh! Lab level! Can I have magic, please? Okay. Oh! Those status steps can't do anything to us. Your magic shall not save you. And the final boss is a mage. He has a Shine Tome. We definitely double him. Can we Iron Axe? Ooh, Iron Axe does kill him. It has been a long time since a pipeline was last played. If Amelia goes here, if she gets berserked, Molder can reach. So it's okay. That's bad. Oh! I mean, we missed both hits, but we got the great shield. Break yourselves upon my body! Best skill in the game. We did we did nothing. <laughs> He's in full health. It's fine. Break yourself upon my body. New graphic. Okay, so mission not accomplished, but we did get <laughs> we did get great shields. Okay, this bottom area we still need to wall off. I can move down one. I don't really know why I would do that, though. I can just throw a javelin from here? Sure. Okay, this... This turn is... <laughs> I, I can't be that mad, because we dodged the 93 with Molder, but I, I'm a little miffed. Just a bit. Is this FE6? Well, we've got the wall. I think we're okay. One issue is that we can't actually heal. Because all of our healers are busy. We only have to contend with... This is the last Berserk. And this is a Sleep Staff, not a Silent Staff. 
We just need... There's no way they target both of our healers, right? As long as they don't target both of our healers, we're okay. I guess I'd rather put Ephraim there than Ford, right? So Ford can wall this spot. Oh no, but if he walls there, he doesn't support his bro. His brother doesn't need the support, but his brother's fine. Okay, emotional support forward. Dusel can wall there. And we can just equip our iron lines here. And we're supporting Tana. This is fine. Uh, and a, a knight versus a general? What do you do? What, what's your plan here? You think you can stand up to Amelia the Armored? Easy. And we get a level. Here's our strength. Here's our speed. Here's our defense. We're a general. Well, we got strength. That's good. We get speed next level, guys. Don't worry. Uh, Reeved? Start, just start general doubling the enemy, Myrmidon. Nothing to see here. Why did I play slow start? A steel sword? Hey, it's a two-hit KO. I don't think Franz is weighed down by javelins. Sorry, I'm like, YouTube ads don't play if the tab is active. That's a lot of damage. Hey, we do a KO. We are weighed down by the ja Oh, yeah, we're weighed down by the javelin. Oof. Okay. Sleeping Dusel is fine. Dusel the dozing. Mold of the Mad. Whoa! Our conviction in the light cannot be broken. I will bring honor to my father and my kingdom. It didn't actually matter, but... <laughs> Are we sure this guy's four stars? So focused. We can actually recruit Renak. Because we don't have to use both of our status status stabs. And that's it. That was the hardest part of the map. Those insane berserk stabs. And they're both broken. So we're actually... We can play somewhat normally now. Oh no. Lunatomes. What are we going to do? Got to make sure that... Uh, Lab Rochelle is not in range of these guys. Which she would be. Just talking to him. Can you canto after talking? I don't know if you can. If you can't, we can just heal her with Molder. You can't, okay. You can. I guess we'll find out. It doesn't matter because we can just heal anyway. We can we can leave Dusel dozing. It, it, that that's fine. Berserk is what we really care about. All right, a familiar face behind enemy lines. Aha! So this is where you wandered off to, Renak. Princess Larachelle. Oh, ah. Uh... Come with me. Wait, hold on now. G go with you where? Look, I'm sorry, but I've been hired by the Grotto Empire and... Hello? I'm talking to you. Renak, whatever is the matter. I promise to listen to your story later, but now we must be going. No, I'm no servant like that Dazla. I'm a mercenary. I escorted you to Rene like I was hired to do, didn't I? You have no right to drag me across creation without any pay whatsoever! Is this about wages? I believe you've received ample compensation. Ample? You even know what that word means? 
Do, do lab troubadours knew, know what ample means? You're the princess of Roston! I thought working for you would pay well! Yet your purse strings are knotted tight, and I've almost been killed so many- The joy that comes from doing good is not something that can be purchased. There. All better? Let's go. Let's go, Renak. No! <laughs> I said I don't want to! Riding with you is... And there she goes. Oh, by the stones. Why did I ever take that job in the first place? We must hurry, Renak! Right, right. I'm coming. Doesn't really sound like he wants to fight with us. He really doesn't sound convinced at all. But... Like, are we sure we can trust this guy? Look how shifty he is! He's literally shifting in place. Are we sure we can trust this guy? Well, he is a blue unit now. I trust you. Wow, incredible graphics for the GBA. They got Renak's hair color wrong, though. Hilarious recruitment conversation. Lab Rochelle definitely embodies the YTC Institute energy. We don't have to pay you in money. We're paying you in the glory of working for us. Paid in exposure. That's not abusive at all. On an unrelated note. smash that like button to help increase the reach of the stream. And although we pay our our interns in exposure, the Patreons don't pay me in exposure. They, they pay them. Mm. Thanks to all of the uh, mighty Patreons for all of your contributions. And on an unrelated note... You call this a salad? It's raw! You haven't cooked it! It really is unrelated. But I do have that graphic and I never get to use it. Gotta open FE wiki. Yeah, apparently it's Renak. You haven't seen that graphic? I only played it during RuneScape. <laughs> Who's this roguish figure? It's Renak! One of the reasons I really dislike... One of the reasons I really dislike Modern Fire Emblem, but more specifically reclassing, is that it just kills unit personality. Look at this guy's portrait, the one in the upper left. Look at that smug little grin. How could this guy be any class other than rogue? Well, I guess we'll do this. Renak the Reluctance. One of the reasons I dislike Modern Fire Emblem, if you could even call it Fire Emblem, more specifically the reclassing system, is that it totally kills unit feeling. Look at this guy's portrait, the one in the upper left, and tell me what class this guy is. You could probably guess, without ever playing the game, if I just showed you that photo, what class would that guy be? He's a rogue! How could he be anything else? Rogue is one of the new classes from Sacred Sons. I think it's actually the only... 
Rogue is one of the new classes in Sacred Stones. It does appear again in Tellius. Rogue is one of the new classes in Sacred Stones. It does appear again in Radiant Dawn, although its functionality is a little different. Rogue's gimmick in Sacred Stones is that they're thieves that can open locks without the use of a lockpick. And later on in Fire Emblem, that would just become a baseline skill for all thieving classes. But in Sacred Stones, it's a unique perk in a game with viable chest keys, so it's actually not that valuable. Usually the best way to open doors and chests is not to send your wimpy little thief there, it's to send your giga buff mounted unit or flying unit with a chest or door key because they can then open the door or chest and you don't have to babysit them because they can just fight their way there themselves. One thing that... One thing that... One thing that door or chest keys cannot accomplish is getting that five finger discount. <laughs> Come here, body ring! Which is on this archer over in a corner. Rogues, unlike assassins, do retain the ability to steal. So Renak can get you that five finger discount, even though I'm showing you ten fingers on whatever stealables remain in the game, which is kind of nice. Despite having had his stats screen up this entire time, I didn't say anything about his stats. I mean, what do you want me to say? He's a rogue, okay? He's really fast, and that's about it. <laughs> Six moves, swords, you should never use the attack command with this guy, but doors and chests don't fight back. He has 11 res, that's really high. It's also nice, it's nice gameplay story integration, ludo narrative harmony if you will, that he has terrible luck, only five luck. And he's definitely portrayed as quite unlucky in the story, being dragged into this circumstance. This guy just wants loot, and they're making him fight the great- <laughs> This guy just wants loot, and they're making him fight the greatest threat that Magvel has ever faced. Leave this guy alone. They don't even pay him. I should be more specific. We didn't pay him. <laughs> if you talk to him with La Rochelle, then he joins you for free. But unfortunately, that means you have to use La Rochelle, who kinda sucks. And it's, it's very dangerous to use her on... But even though La Rochelle kinda sucks in general, she's actually very, very useful on this map, known as Status Staff Purgatory, where you definitely need to restore users, so she's actually pretty good on this map. If you don't talk to Renak with La Rochelle, then you actually have to pay him. Yep, you you'd have to talk to him with your lord, and then you have to pay him almost 10,000 gold. You'd have to talk to him with your lord, either Erica or Ephraim, and then you'd have to pay him his asking cost. You'd have to... <clears throat> you'd have to talk to him with your lord, either Erica or Ephraim, and you'd have to pay him his asking rate of 10,000 gold, which... I mean, he is a thief, and that is highway robbery. He's definitely not worth that. Growth rates? He's a thief. 25% strength. What did you ex- Growth rates. 
He's a thief. 25% strength, 60% speed. What did you expect? <laughs> B swords. This member card in his inventory... This member card in his inventory allows you to access the secret shop, which is nice, but I don't know if that counts as utility for Renak, because you can also just steal it from him if your Colm is fast enough. But most people, I think, recruit this guy. Why would you not recruit him? I guess because you don't want to pay. Look at, look at this guy. Fire Emblem Heroes! <laughs> What is this skin? Hilarious, hang on. Renak, rich merchant. <laughs> the quotes are part of the title. Oh no, he's hot. Uh, why is he holding a key if he doesn't need any? Did the Fire Emblem Heroes team do their research? What is this? Not gonna lie, this support list is pretty terrible. Pretty much nobody that's actually worth supporting with, because Renek doesn't actually need to be near any of these guys to do his job. He just has to be off on... His support list is pretty terrible, it's really small, and none of these supports are useful at all. You can see he has a darkness affinity, and that's because he's best off in the shadows doing his own thing. You do need, you do need, you, you do need equal or higher speed than an enemy to steal from them. And 17 base speed Renak, I think, could just steal everything that's left in the game. So if you didn't train Colm, and why would you? Colm kind of sucks. Then hey, this rogue is here to help you fill your pockets and maybe his own pockets as well if he has the spare time. <laughs> Your microtransaction was for- give me a second, guy. I, I gotta talk through it first. Mm. Your microtransaction from Brood Man. S owed that one guy who likes greedy characters. It, what's S.O.? Significant others? A supports? Thank you for the microtransaction. Oh, it's shout out. I've, do people type SO? I've never seen that. Maybe I'm too old. Soft oranges? I think his coat is more of like a burgundy or like a burnt orange. You do need equal to or higher speed than an enemy to be able to steal from them. And Renak's base speed of 17 is... I think high enough to lift every item left in the game. So if you didn't train Calm, and why would you? Calm kind of sucks. Then Renak can do all of your. Hmm. Thirty is older than Pokemon. True. By the way, if people, I assume most of you by now know 
But for any new viewers, I doubt there's any of you, but welcome if you're new. The reason why I keep repeating stuff is because eventually this all gets edited together, and if I don't get a good take, it's gonna be a disaster. Oh, Shadows of Valencia, that makes sense. Great game, by the way. Renax, you do need equal to or higher speed than enemies to be able to relieve them of their items. And Renax base speed of 70, I believe, is enough to filch every item remaining in the game. So if you didn't train Calm, and why would you? Calm kind of sucks. Then Renak can fulfill all of your subterfuge needs. If he does it for free, that's probably worth it. If you have to pay him 10k, it's probably not worth it. Two stars? Okay, Utility. You're almost certainly not going to be running out of lockpicks during the main game, but if you do the post-game, perhaps delving into the Tower of Volny or the Lagdu Ruins, there's a lot of chests, and at that point, maybe you'll run out of lockpicks? I think you can steal them from enemy thieves, but you're just gonna have a dedicated thief. Just use Renak the Rogue. Doesn't need lockpicks. Two stars. I am recording this time, thank you. Everybody okay with two star Renak? He's like three stars? Nah. He'd be higher if door and chest keys weren't, weren't available. But thieves kind of suck in Magvel. I did mention earlier that you can just use combat slash high mobility units with chest and door keys. I think we all- did we give Colm three or two stars? I think we gave Colm two stars as well. Very unfortunate. What chapter is this? What chapter is this? You must be new here. You must be new here. What chapter is this? Well, it said what chapter was at the very start of the stream. Were you not there? Well, you're here now. Perfect. Because this is the end for you. I tapped three Patreons. Do these, do these eruptions happen a lot in Grotto? And I cast the Crux of Fate. Choose one. Destroy all viewers or destroy all YouTubers. Either way, I can finally rest. Why is it my job to answer all of your inane questions? Why don't you just watch the video and think for yourself for once? I think this is chapter 14. Yeah, it's chapter 14. So his availability also isn't great. Man, Dussel slept through all of that. He's, he's really old. Is this Hector hard mode? <laughs> it's an Iron Man. What's Renak's name? I forgot. Okay, don't tell Kaga. Alright, let's... Let's play the map, right? <laughs> We're back. He's a two-star unit. His utility was more valuable, but he'd be three stars. Yeah. This chapter makes him look really good because there's a bunch of loot. But I think this is actually the most treasure-heavy chapter in the game, so... Don't, don't get swindled. <laughs> okay, we still have Molder's action. We still have... There's a... Sleep Staff Bishop here. We can train our sword rank. <laughs> he doesn't die! We can train our axe. Okay, well, that didn't work so well last time. Take a lot of damage from this. If we're in support range of Ross, 
then we can chop him with our sword, right? We're training our sword rank, okay? I know this is not optimal. I know this is not optimal. You don't have to tell me it's not optimal, okay? We're using Amelia and Ross. He doesn't even die. I should have used an axe. Oh, they missed. <laughs> Chopped. It's extra sword rank, okay? We get to attack him one more time. Alright, what do we do here? Does Tana need the... Javelin? No, she can just Iron Lance this dude. It's a 100% chance. Does anybody need healing? Not urgently. We can Javelin this dude. Armor Slayer! Okay. Yeah, but we, had, we do have an Iron Sword. Surely... Okay, let's make sure this guy doesn't have a... Okay, he has an Iron Axe. Surely... We can deal 14 damage, right? We can! Armor Slayer! Come on, oh, but now I have a... Ooh, that's bad. Now I have a Lance equipped against this Iron Axe. You... think? Incorrectly. That's not what I meant to say. This is fine. I think we're okay here. I'm clocking out, boss. Good luck for the rest of the stream. Who do you think you are? You're clocking out. Yeah, you are. Not out of work, though. Out of this world, pal! Damn it! If my interns abandon me, I'll never complete my research. The beds must be burned before the interns fall asleep. Isn't that a bit much, sir? Burn down to their frames! No one goes to sleep until our research is complete. The Demon King is at large, and you lots are out here having a picnic! Good night, thanks for watching. Let's just restore Dussel. Restored. Molder level? Molder the maxed! Molder the maxed! <laughs> really good! Really good! Oh, and we even got nine defense. I guess we have mana shield. Molder popping off this map. Molder saved our lives. Molder dodging madness actually saved the entire map. Okay, Renak needs to get out of here. <laughs> oh, we killed all these enemies. Cool. I don't think this map has infinite reinforcements or anything, so we should be okay. What is this? <laughs> Renak the napping. I guess Renak the resting. Are we sure this guy's two stars? Good dodge. You think you can send up to four the focus? I think that might mean we get attacked by a sword reaver. If he can reach us. That last guy can. Maybe it's a hammer. One of those guys is a hammer. But that's that's fine. <laughs> Renak is woke. More reinforcements. We 
He does kill. I never mentioned it. I never mentioned it during the review, and it doesn't affect his rating. But GBA Fire Emblem is known for its. I didn't mention it during the review, and it doesn't affect his rating. But GBA Fire Emblem is known for having intricate sprite work that is beloved even decades after its release. An exception to that is the Rogue, which, in my opinion, looks kinda doofy. You'd think that Rogue animations would be really cool, because Thief and Assassin animations are both great. Look at this! Uh, I just think the idle post is kinda dumb. Why is he so sassy? Nice dodge, by the way. Do rogues get an XP bonus? <laughs> Maybe. Not a huge. I'm not a huge rogue fan, but I mean, it's okay. Alright, we're gonna show them the holy light. We'll look at that. They can't do anything to us. They can crit us, though. What if we make... Okay, so we could either... It's Might 13. gonna do now what are they gonna do now twenty three res twenty three res yes Luna ignores resistance I don't know why I did that Shown. <laughs> We're out of there. Can that guy reach Dusel? He can, right? He probably actually doubles Dusel now, which is... Right, this is overall maybe not the greatest plan. We can do this. 24 HP. These guys also, this one has Flux, this one has Luna. We're almost certainly fine. Ton of the Talented? Strength would be very nice, that's the main thing we want. get speed next level strength too distrust I think we're still actually above average but yeah that that hurt <laughs> this guy's got a steel axe and this guy's a hammer okay we're not scared of these guys at all they, there's no way they can even hit us Pray for resin, you'll get strength? Okay. Just make sure we have a sword equipped. And then I think we'll just back Ephraim up. They're just gonna attack our cavaliers, we don't actually have to wall off. If we do this, we even support Tana. Oh yeah, these guys are here. <laughs> Amelia's not scared of mages. The whole point of doing this is to train my sword rank. Those guys reach almost nowhere. I guess we'll just chop this dude. 100% hit rate! When are you promoting forward? I don't think we have a Knight's Crest. 
We can give that to Molder. Just put Wreck-It Ross here, we can kill both of them. Sure, right? The boss has one? Okay. Well, Ford's also not level 20. If you promote before level 20, you miss out on important stat gains. So you should never promote before level 20. You think you could stand up to Ford the Focused? The Ford Focus. The Hammer! Great against the Black Knight. Ouch. You think you'd stand up to Ford the Focused? Gotta save our Iron Sword uses. I don't think we suffer from success, right? I don't think anyone can reach us. It was close, though. That's a lot of damage. The L Fire. Nice spells, nerd. Give me only like, the long sword for plus one range. I can trip all of my allies. Okay. We, we could die to crits here, but we didn't, which is nice. You think you can stand up to Molder the Magician? Nice 9% crit rate. I have a 12% crit rate, though. Uh oh. You think you'd send up to Town of the Talented? It's because we got plus one luck. Luck doesn't affect crit rate. I don't think. Maybe it does. Okay, there's a couple enemy reinforcements here. Very unfortunate that we can't train our sword. So, the key example here of why swords suck. How much damage do we take from that? Nine. But this guy's Elfire. These guys... They all have Elfire. Move six. Move six! I want a barrier, but I can't because I have move six. How big's Amelia? Con 11? At least they nerfed paladins, yeah. We'll get him next turn, okay? Can we get attacked from there? I don't think so. We're fine. Now we're not scared of magic. And we get the XP from Barrier. Barrier, really useful here. Your magic shall not save you. What are they gonna do to us? What are they gonna do? Oh, Board Kim with the five gifted memberships. Thank you, Board Kim, for the. Nice five hit pin missile. I'll equip the hand axe. There we go. What are we carrying? We're carrying Renak. I guess we'll just drop him here. Lalger's here. Steel Lance and Javelin. Ooh. This guy's an elixir, right? Yeah, let's just use the elixir. Chinokoin, unfortunately, was replaced by a couple units. Sorry. They'll return someday. This guy does literally zero damage. 
think we just let them attack us, right? I'm not that scared. How will we pay the interns in exposure, bro? Don't worry, your Tsuchinokoin investments are safe, okay? Your Tsuchinokoin encrypted currency wallets are still there? You don't have to worry. They'll be restored in due time, okay? Just trust the blockchain. The blockchain is eternal. I think we just wait. It's a lot of damage. I wish we had one more strength. That would be nice. Then this enemy would be dead. Shot, that's nice. Okay. Big dodge. That's pretty scary, but we don't die. We definitely double. Luna's crazy heavy. Yeah, Luna sucks. <laughs> So sad. So sad. Okay, we would have died if we got hit by both. This is no way, right? There's no way. Ouch. My javelin break? No, I just didn't double him. Hello? Oh. We have five con. And this weighs 11, that's why. Okay, mystery solved. I knew we got weighed down, I didn't know it was that bad. <laughs> That's horrible, minus six speed. Healed. Okay, our magic is still a little lackluster, but it's okay. Right, these guys can't reach us. It's just the javelin guy. My XP! I also has a javelin. If I go there, I get longbowed. Alright, big tactics. Brotherly bond. Now we both have javelins, which means they're gonna attack forward. I don't think Ford can die there. We are resistant. What are they going to do to us? Four damage. Four damage! Nice spells, nerd! Oh! D-axes! May as well just one shot this guy. Oh, one shot. Hello? If only we had one more strength. Why can't we forge our hand axes? Can't believe we only have 24 strength. This guy's so weak. Okay, I think we can finally start healing our units. <laughs> Almost all of our units are either dead or dying, including our healer. And that's been the case for quite a while, because we've had to keep using status stabs. But now I think we're finally okay. So who needs healing the most urgently? Probably Ford. So let's move to heal Ford next turn. Can we heal anyone on the way? I guess we can heal Renak. And we have six move. One. One, two, three, four, five. We do reach him. Does this guy have a javelin? He does not. Does this guy have a javelin? He does not, so we're okay. Let's just heal Renak. Lab Rochelle needs healing, just target yourself. That is one of the annoying things about healers, for those who don't know. Healers can't heal themselves, which I guess does make sense, because they have to, like, 
be actively healing the other person. How can they do it to themselves? Could doctors heal themselves? They, it does feel kind of terrible though, from a quality of life perspective. So eventually they change it, where often either healing others heals you, or they just passively heal themselves. I guess we'll build a support. How can you heal yourself? Healing takes your HP. Is that you, Micaiah? We got hit, what? My hand axe! They know that they deal more damage to this guy. If only we had two more strength. Why is Ross so weak? It's kind of a lot of damage. Okay, is that level 20? Level 19. There. I feel a wave of darkness emanating from the heart of the grotto capital. It's not fair. We're level 19. We're the speedy cavalier. It's fine, we'll get speed next level. Level 19 with 10 strength. Level 19 with 10 strength. Ho ho ho! It's beginning to look a lot like Lindis. Ho ho horrible! <laughs> What what are his averages? What are his averages? How bad is this? I feel like this is really bad. What's not bad is this five dollar microtransaction from Godman mm. Brutus. Hey, it's Brutus. You are a sex god. Thank you for making that f emblem and character tier list. I watch referred to it all the time. All your memes and vid editing are hilarious. Thank you. Those are really long videos. They're like three hours each. Thanks for watching, true fan. Miki... I never say her name right, I'm sorry. Miti... Miti Kozuki. Remember for eight months, thank you. He's... This is only minus two strength. This is so bad. The only solace we have is that on average, Ford is not this bad. He's bad, but not this bad. I do say right, I just hesitate every time, sorry. We know those guys don't actually have two range, which is very useful. Yet Ford is four stars somehow? Look, I don't have to listen to a single thing you say. You're always wrong. He is four stars. He's a cavalier. We're just really unlucky. I guess we have to abandon the Hamern staff, huh? People say I have contempt for my viewers. I don't know where they get that idea from. Healed. <laughs> Finally, we're healing. Gotta build that support. How do we do this? The main thing that Franz has been doing is just babysitting his older brother. Look at this, look at this! We're gonna take the heavy spear. And we're gonna equip it on our brother. Look at this! Greatest tactician in Magvel, okay? Okay, the coast is clear over here. 
We gotta steal his body ring. To steal, you need an empty inventory slot, which we do have. He could kill an archer, right? Like, he doesn't need an escort for this. And he has an elixir. He's fine. Okay. I guess we should kill these enemies, right? If we open that door, we can then wall with these three units so Renak doesn't die. That seems good. Finally, a character who embodies the opposite end of the movement problem in order to do something, you have to be there. Well, Ford can't can't do anything now, so his speed is worthless. There's no way we suffer from success. We double this guy, right? Okay, we do. Even with a heavy spear. When do we recruit Garrick? Uh, he's on Erica route in this. But if we were playing vanilla, we would have recruited Garrick last chapter. Okay, big dodges from... You think you can set up to Ford the Focused? Saved a heavy spear use. What a great weapon. Okay, let's deal with these longbow enemies that have just been here. This one just drops. We, can we kill him in one round? With someone? Maybe, uh... That doesn't do it. Can Ephraim do it? Ephraim with the javelin does not even double. Franz definitely doubles, right? Franz is really fast. Yeah, Franz does double. Could kill with a crit. Why is Ford bad on average? Just bad stats. But he's not bad on average. He's perfectly fine on average. Well, not perfectly fine. He's just a little underwhelming. His stats are just kind of lame. Ours has ours is really lame, but that's an exception. You probably want to heal them first, right? I think we can do this. We can javelin him, and then we can rescue him, I think, right? We can rescue our bro, we can. Put a horse on a horse. Ouch. My longbow uses. We deal 14 damage, right? I Maybe I should have checked that. We do. Let's get more accuracy. Could have take dropped there, that would have been a good idea. Look at this! Wow, we're almost level 20. The longbow! That guy also has a longbow. Wait, does this work? No, it doesn't. <laughs> I thought we could take. We could take drop with Molder. He's not that big. So we're talking about bad units, who would say the worst Cavaliers and Flyers are across the game. There's some that are actually just trash. A lot of units in the very first games, like the Arach uh, Ar Arcanea games, some of them are like just the like one star, like horrible. <laughs> But starting in the GBA era, most of them are kind of good. I don't really think there are any that are just straight up bad from GBA onwards. But what I could actually do is I could open the door, and then rescue and retreat with Dusel. I think I'll do that. And that way, Amelia can fight them all. I guess we'll just do that next turn. Not actually in a rush, though. 
Six move Doosel. Trek's okay. I guess Trek's kind of bad. He's like three stars. Noah's fine. Oh, the... There's some bad ones in Radiant Dawn. Fiona's really bad. Yeah, Fiona's one star. She's like standout terrible. If Vika counts, then Vika's also pretty bad. He does fly. FE10 Astrid also bad. Time to plan who gets the body ring. Okay, here we go. Rogue tactics. Pick. Picked. All right, Dusel deliveries. Strength 13. Oh no. Don't even kill with the hand axe. Excuse me. Straight it. You think you can stand up to a melee of the Annihilator? That was easy. We might see Great Shield next turn. Door key. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, we can kill this guy. He's been kind of annoying. Heal there. Can Molder kill this guy? Time to shine the light. Seven damage. More XP for... <laughs> more XP for our healer. We got him. And let's get this guy all the way to the right so he shoots us. Then we can clear out these guards here. What's Tana doing? I guess she can eventually help Renak catch up, right? So we'll just send her to go fetch Renak. Oh no, my hit raid! I might have to switch to... switch to Lances to get that guy. Ouch. Let's get this guy. Oh well, maybe we can get him with Ford. For the XP? So bad. So bad! Let's just get him with Molder. What if he crits us? Shown! Who do we give body ring to? Somebody who struggles with constitution. Our Pegasus Knights currently do, but upon promotion, they get a lot better. Do we give it to Tana? Tana's con's horrible. Just give everything to Tana. All items for Amelia. Amelia only has 11 con, right? I think she loses some speed to axes. Steel. Amelia low con is good for the Amelia airdrops? That's actually kind of true. Lab level? Magic? Oh! Oh! The Princess of Rouston! We've got to fund her training! Speed's actually pretty good. Evil stands no chance. You're too Wild slow. speed. These stats are actually okay. Rest well? 
What are the evildoers gonna do? These guys didn't even move. <laughs> I guess they're just too scared. Iron Lance hit rate? Wow. Get doubled. You think you can stand up to Amelia the Annihilator? You guys know that generals are a popular class? That's why. <laughs> we'll steal the body ring next turn. I guess we'll move down to get this treasure. We'll just... Oh, support? I almost got tricked. I should have moved. I should have moved my Pegasus Knight. That was a mistake. Oh, they have a steel sword, so they get weighed down. Just casually doubling the enemy Myrmidon with our general. The longbow, that's a pretty good hit rate. But we don't even die to a crit, so that's good. We do die to a crit next turn, though. We only have five luck. I wonder if he's wearing the body ring. I get XP as well. Yay! Let's chop this dude. Let's doubled by the silver axe. Doubled by the steel lance! The obsidian! The obsidian! Stabbed! Excellent. Okay, these guys are just really scared. We are in support range if we do this. We definitely kill them. Oh yeah, we do for sure. I gotta train my sword rank. I don't think these guys move. Where's my great shield proc? Look at all this weapon XP. Do have the heavy spear. Who are we carrying? Molder, right? We're fine on HP. Does Ephraim need to go down there? Yes, because we're building supports. Is that all of our actions? Oh, we have to move this lady. Riveting gameplay. Obviously, there's far more efficient ways to do this, but whatever. We're using Swords General Amelia, so... It doesn't really matter. <laughs> Chopped. Maybe we'll switch to Steel Sword once we can use it, since... I don't... Oh! The Great Shield! You're just a knight, I'm a general! Break yourselves upon my body! Break yourself upon my body! And a crit. We're showing them who's boss. This guy have a javelin? Oh, that guy oh right, we weaken that guy. This guy does have a javelin. So does that guy, but they don't move, so we only have to take this one javelin attack. Do we need the heavy spear? Yes, we do. Supports. This is so sad. It's gonna be a lot of healer XP, because we're definitely gonna get hit. We can heal Molder. Looks we can move Molder up first. Six moves, by the way. Why did they nerf Troubadours so much? Twenty-two HP, by the way. At least we didn't get one shot by that knight earlier. Can't even reach. Okay, the coast is clear.
Uh, I think there's a secret shop here. Yeah, there is. Uh, shh. <laughs> it's a secret shop. You, can, you actually can never visit this again. So we gotta buy everything we need here. Oh, physique's really useful. So which of these do we actually need? We don't need a steel blade or a silver blade. Killing Edge is really good. Killer Lance is really good. Killer Axe is really good. We need a Killer Bow. Barrier can really help train. We definitely want Physique. We definitely want Barrier. I don't think we need a Lockpick. Oh, you can visit again in Creature Campaign? We don't need a Hero Crest, do we? We don't need a Knight's Crest. We definitely don't need Orion's Bolt. I don't think we need any of these promotion items. You get them from both routes in this route split. So let's do the necessary shopping first. Physique, 1000%. Super useful. Will I pay this much for a barrier? Twenty-two fifty. Twenty-two fifty. It's so expensive. It's so expensive. It's like two killer weapons, just to increase your resistance. Your magic shall not save you. Yeah, I mean the final boss is a mage. We gotta do it. We'll get one. It's good for training. I wouldn't do that if we weren't using Lab Rochelle, but she's gonna be spamming barriers, so let's get a barrier staff. Only a thousand for a killer axe. Let's kill him twice. 1200 for a killer lance. Let's kill him twice. 1300 for a killing edge. Let's kill him twice! And then we have some funds left for our hand axes and javelins. I think that's what we want. So Erica's maps are gonna be a lot easier because we've got the- we've literally got a killer convoy. <laughs> oh, there's an enemy here. Will they even attack? They can't hurt me. Make sure we don't put our Pegasus there. Good hit rate. Ouch. A $5 microtransaction from Solomon Kearns. Thank you for the microtransaction. They did attack. You level up next next uh, next combat. Mm. Thank you for the microtransaction. Head researcher Cheese. Why do you continue to call the physique staff and not the physics staff? The interns must know. Oh, because I didn't know it was the physics staff. There's your answer. Turns out if you make mistakes, that actually is one of the internet strategies, right? You can just make mistakes. If you want to know something, say the wrong info, and people are much more eager to correct you rather than like offer helpful advice. Actual internet strategy, it's, it's real. Ah, oh, this guy's dead. If we miss one, we can get XP on Tana. Big Amelia level. Give me my strength. Give me my speed. Give me my defense. I'm a. I'll take speed and res. Okay, sure. Your magic shall not save you. What is Leon gonna do? What is Leon gonna do? We have 14 res. Okay, heavy spear, <laughs> and then we can heal. Is it Reblo or Libro? Good question. In Japanese, the physics staff apparently is called Libro. Maybe it's Ribro, who knows? Dorky. Oh boy. We need Renak here anyway, so may as well save the Dorky, I guess. Getting all that 
healing XP. Building these supports. Do we need Molder? I think Molder can just kind of leave. Tana does have one more move than Dusel. I guess we'll just stand here menacingly and build our supports. Plus 3.35 res above average for Amelia. We used a talisman though. Javelin. Oh. What a waste of a staff charge. Just run forward down mid for his sins. Oh, the heavy spear. Six damage times two. Gotta use the heavy spear. Ouch. It's more healing XP. Almost level 20, and then we can promote him with the Knight's Crest. <laughs> oh. Gotta heal. Gotta build those supports. These guys are just supporting. Uh, I don't know what Dusel's gonna do for the rest of the map. Okay, we can reach this chest, right? It's okay if we have a full inventory here, because we'll just go to the convoy. Gotta make sure our convoy is not full, but I think it's okay. Select which space to use picks on. I would like to use it on the chest. What do we give that to? If we're going to be using... Lab Rochelle as a combat unit, and she's okay at fighting when she's a mage knight. I think she definitely needs that. So, remind me, before we kill the guard, the Silent Emperor, we have to do convoy management, because we're going to get swapped over to Erica. Garrick? Garrick doesn't need HP, right? So let's see, we're going to move 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... Katana there. I, yeah, Lab Rochelle has to use L Fire to burn the beds. She's gonna be our anima magic user. I did hit record this time, yeah. Get ready for high octane thief transportation gameplay. Are you ready? Are you ready? Here we go. Not optimized. <laughs> I should have pressed B. Not optimized. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, minor errors. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> This definitely saved us a lot of time. Nyeroom. And now we can do it next turn. We did it! <laughs> Gotta heal this guy. Emperor of Regard will wait 80 turns. We'll wait patiently. But only for 80 turns. We can build our supports. Uh, let's... Hmm. Let's do this. Gimme that. Gimme that. 
So now Renak's stuff is going to be sent to the convoy. Let's make sure our convoy is... Oh, it's actually almost full. That's actually kind of a problem. Let's take stuff we don't need. Why do we have all these vulneraries? We're making space. I know this is riveting gameplay. What happened to door keys? We discarded them. Almost. What happened to door keys? I discarded them. Okay, there we go. That's probably enough space. This is a seas map, so we actually do have to get Ephraim up to the top. Probably fine. Convoy chains. Oh, Molder's over. <laughs> oh, yeah, Molder's over here. Let's move up. Pick. We did. We opened that door for free. Okay, Ford. Can you kill this? You can definitely kill this Luna Mage, right? It's a Luna Mage. Come on. Ah, one short. Gotta support. Just in case we get crit. Well, we got him this time. Hey, if we get hit, that's more healer XP. My healer XP! I guess we'll- I'm actually- I'm, I'm just gonna send my- my killing edge to the convoy. Erica can use that for sure. We're gonna waste one turn... ...to get this XP. Ford can kill the boss, send him north alone? Absolutely not. Ephraim on the move. Well, no. We're not even gonna rescue chain him. Do we- and we'll just use a door key on this instead of bringing Renak all the way up here. Renak's just gonna chill in the treasure room. It's probably where he wants to be anyway. And we're just- we're gonna stand outside- well, no, we're gonna get our supports. is fine. Riveting gameplay incoming. Uh-oh. Okay, we, well, um... Who's Ferasu? You think you can stand up to Franz the Five Star? He does die. Surprise magic men. By the way, if this were a game with ambush spawns... Ford, please. If this was a game with ambush spawns, those enemies would have appeared and then attacked. That's why people hate ambush spawns. They're super unfair. Thanks for the healer XP, I guess. Level eight. <laughs> level eight after all this. What's in the treasure chest? Do you want to buy more killer weapons? I think we're okay, right? 
I don't think we need more killer weapons. I guess we can do this. Hey, we did get paid 10,000 gold, you're right. Okay, let's make sure we do this correctly. Okay, there we go. <laughs> That's what we actually wanted to do. Royal Escort. Okay, it does work. You just have to not mess it up. More magic men! We do support each other from these ranges. Gotta hope Nosferatu doesn't hit, though. Nosferatu hits, I don't think he dies. No, he does still die, so it's actually fine. Hey, this will be level 24 -ed. You think you can set up to forward the focus? A good omen that we crit on our final level? Redemption? Redemption is a paladin spell, okay? And we're not a paladin, we're a cavalier. That's why we didn't learn redemption. Oh god, it's fine, okay? We'll get speed next level. We leveled him all the way up to 20. All the way up to 20. I think he started at level 5, right? 15 levels. 15 levels! For this. Ho ho ho! It's beginning to look a lot like Lindis. Oh, oh, horrible! <laughs> Build for tough. Oh my. Mecha was right. Mecha was right. He's still decently useful. He's just so disappointing. What was his base strength? I think his base strength was seven, right? This is a disaster. Oh, hey, we can uh, get healing XP. He's carried by being a cavalier, and his support with his brother really helps him. The best thing he does is buff his brother. I'd like to pick this chest. The Harmon! Restores items to new condition! Well, I mean, we may as well send that to Erica because it's not like we're going to use it here. I think in this Nintendo, in this Nintendo PC version, you actually get six charges. We can repair Hatchet by Gary Paulson, the Hatchet sequel. Is it time for the Hatchet sequel? I think you also get a ton of XP. We have B-Rank stabs. Do we Hammer the Hatchet? You definitely shouldn't. But the Hatchet is a main character, right? Do we... Do we have burn hatchet? They can't attack us through the door, right? No. Definitely Regileaf. We have and Regileaf for sure. We still have a lot of Regileaf charges. Once Regileaf is close to broken, we're gonna have it. Do we need Molder to heal us? We definitely want Tana levels. Hatchet is an important member of the team. Okay, we'll get the Hatchet sequel. Okay, more enemies from here, but now now we're now he's an XP thief. How many more of these are there?
Remember to convoy before the guard? Yeah. Thing is, most of our inventories aren't that good. It's just like a bunch of javelins. <laughs> Alright, Renak Gaming. He doesn't kill him. <laughs> he doesn't kill him. Renak, what? I guess we'll just steal the XP. If you get another Hermione on Erica's route, you can have infinite uses on every item. I don't think you can Hermione the Hermione. It's like you can't wish for more wishes. I guess we'll just move over here. I don't need to fight more dark mages. Do we buy him a knight's crest? How much speed does Vigard have? Okay. Some of you probably just figured out my plan, but I'm not going to say it. Alright. We're going to bust down this door. By using a key on it. This guy's really spooky. Look at this. This is so scary. Oh my goodness. That's so scary. But that means he deals a max of 29, because Luna has no might. Okay. Big XP on Tana. Big XP on Tana. We can't double him. So we'd have to weaken him. I don't think Amelia kills with a sword. And it has zero crit because we're so lucky. <laughs> this sword is so fun. Oh, we exactly died. I should have been more careful there. I guess it worked out. That was pretty scary. How much damage does this guy do? Oh, he's no Sferatu. That's fine. 39 attack, but... Look, we have... 14 rises, we're fine. Was there a shaman here? We're just re dyeing the carpet red. <laughs> here we go. Huge ton of XP, huge ton of XP. This is massive for the account. This changes everything. Once we get the strength level. All we need is a strength level, then we can take on one of Magnol's greatest challenges. Oh! Oh! Tana the Talented? Absolutely huge for the account. This changes everything. Really good. We'll probably get another level by killing this guy. We can feed that to Tana as well. Tana the terrifying. Okay, let's make sure nobody dies. Let's just heal this guy. I think we're okay. Nosferatu is super heavy. There's no way he doubles. And we used an Iron Lance, right? Yes, we're not weighed down by our Javelin. I think we're okay. Dussel's just chilling. I hope there's no, like, enemies from these staircases, but... Why would they put staircases there if not to have enemies, right? A lot of damage. It sucked. Hmm. A bolt of brilliance! Why would they have staircases there? If not to have reinforcements. Uh oh. I I think we're okay. We can ignore these priests, I think. Yeah. We can ignore the priests. This is a lot of nerds though. 
Okay, so Iron Sword also sets up a kill. We can heal Tana. And Tana has really good res. We're not really scared about her. That's bad. That's bad. <laughs> I guess we're not going to be training Tana. Okay, let's deal with this guy. Yeah, okay, RIP. <laughs> Do you think you can stand up to Ross the Ripped? Hey, Red Gem. Hey, Ross did get the Red Gem from that guy. <laughs> Money for Erica. Oh. No, we don't want to do that. We don't want to do that. We want to do it with uh, Lara Shell. I need a remedy. Okay, we need Lara Shell's healing salve. How do we do? 14 damage. Which is okay, right? Yeah, we can get hit twice and we don't die. So we should go to we should go to this tile. There we go. I think we're totally fine. Just in case. Don't tell Kaga. Very unfortunate that we got sucked there. Chests don't give a void, right? No. If this guy sucks us, what happens? Ah, uh, never mind. <laughs> you think you can send up to Franz the Five Star? It's fine. We can open this. Picked! The Guiding Ring! We definitely have to send that to Lin. Send that to Lin for sure. We don't have any other guiding... Well, eventually we need a Guiding Ring here, but we'll be okay. Anyone to heal? No, so let's just stand here. Ring, guide my path. Alright, emotional support, Dussel. That's fine, right? Hit zero, so I guess that's okay. Man, they massacred Luna in this game. It's so sad. It was probably a bit too strong, but... They destroyed it. Wow, they can't get enough of melee. That's a lot of damage. Uh, I thought... Well, never mind. I was gonna say, I thought... Lightning, or metal attracted lightning, but it doesn't, so I don't know what I'm th talking about. Okay, we can do a Tana training arc. Like, these enemies can't really hurt us. Okay, Tana training arc. We're gonna eat all... We don't double this guy. That's crazy. Can we weaken them? With Molder? We have Weapon Triangle Disadvantage. Oh no. Okay, here we go. Think Mulder needs the Body Ring? Ooh, that's good. Yeah, Am Amelia the Alluring, she's drawing the enemies, perfect. Okay, it looks like these reinforcements no longer spawn. All right, Renak, hop on, we're going for a ride. I guess Ford can come too. Let's wall him.
They can now attack Tana. But they could have attacked... Oh, but now she doesn't counter. There we go. And we'll just stand here menacingly. Supports? No. Amelia the Alluring! They can't resist wasting their turns against her. I think we do double both of the Dark Mages, so we just have to deal with the other... Anima Mage. What is this? They want to suck us. Come here, Tana! Sucked. You think you'd stand up to Tana the Tantalizing? The Princess of Frelia grows strong. The Princess of Frelia! Are we sure she's a Pegasus Knight? My Javelin. Well, now we don't counter, but that's okay. Really good levels. Unfortunately... That is with an energy ring, but still, 14 strength is good. She seems slow-ish? I guess. We still have 17 speed, though. I I'll take it. I say as I fail to double this enemy. We can show them the light, right? You don't die if we get crit, so I guess we'll do that. Okay, well... <laughs> Molder the Mighty decides to take the... And he touches... If I was that mage, I would be so tilted. Crit by 9 and missed at 80. 99 Slayer actually blessed. Mega Lucky... Mega Luck Molder. What? I will bring honor to my father and my kingdom. We didn't want him to do that, but sure. Yeah, okay, this guy's toast. We don't die, right? Yeah, 13 might, we're fine. Molder trying to switch class. I told you Bishop was a combat unit. I thought he was only effective against monsters. I guess man is the real monster. And we're just riding out of here. I guess Ford can come along. Solo Lab Rochelle. Now this gameplay, unfortunately, not going to be that riveting, but what can this guy do? Our Iron Lance is almost broken. Let's do it this way. This is better, right? And this way she can actually attack. Checking Tana averages, she's slightly less pretty much everywhere, but minus three on speed, really. So she naturally caps speed? I mean, even though, she, she, is she actually minus three on speed? It doesn't feel like it. I guess her con is total trash. Can you steal stats in this game? No. Oh yeah, I guess we are speed screwed, but it doesn't feel like that. Nice physique staff. Why don't you heal yourself? Oh, terrible. What level are we? 17. Who am I holding? Renak, right? Okay. I think this is okay. And I moved La Rochelle. One too far. I don't have a javelin. 
Well, now I do. Was Renak worse in the Japanese version? What made him so bad? Did people just not like him? Alright. I think this works. Well, it almost does. Inventory is full. Live Vigard reaction. this on a worthy cavalier or knight. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Ford is it? <laughs> uh, well, I've been monitoring your performance closely. I was actually recommended against hiring you for our forces, but perhaps against my better judgment I decided to. Uh, why do you think you're qualified for the rank of Paladin? Please tell us in your own words. Great night because my stats are atrocious. I need the help more than move. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Zero chance I'm doing that. No. I need to waste this crest instead of using it on Kyle. Well, there will be another crest for Kyle. We'll be okay. I help support budget Seth. That's probably the biggest thing I can say in Ford's favor. He supports Franz, who is actually good. Ford, my truck has a flat tire. I need a new mount. <laughs> the, promotion, the promotion makes him focus. Take pity on me, please. I can't let my brother down now that I'm a role model. You're right, you're right. I did like the A support. He doesn't want to let his brother down. We're not doing Great Knight. Great Knight sucks. Don't get duped by Dusel, okay? Dusel is good because he's Dusel. Great Knight is ass. We're going Paladin. He fights for his brother. He can't let his brother down. Uh, congratulations, Ford. I guess we grant you the rank of Paladin. Hey, he looks cool. Great color palette. Hooray! We have 11 strength! <laughs> Leveled him up to 20 to get 11 strength! Why is Great Knight bad in your opinion? I'm not sure if you're being serious, but I, I can't explain if you're being serious. Could have been higher if we went Great Knight. No, we need Paladin Pals. Paladin Pals for sure. This is lunatic mode, okay? We can't mess around. Even though we're using Ford, which I guess is messing around. Oh, I don't know anything about Fire Emblem, so you're curious about why too? Okay, so I will explain. Oh, but first our lab level. I want magic, I want speed, and they're both mine. <laughs> Ha ha ha! 
Research complete. So that's the good news. The bad news is Great Knight. So here's my non-meme answer. I am being serious here. So why is Great Knight bad? So what's the most important stat in the game? The most important stat by far is movement. In order to do something, you have to be somewhere. Cavaliers have seven movement. That's really good. Paladins have eight movement. That's really good. Great Knights have six movement. That's really bad. You'll notice that six is actually less than seven. So by promoting to Great Knight, you actually lose one movement. That's really bad. Cavaliers, as in all mounted units, take heavier terrain penalties. Now, when you're a Paladin, that doesn't matter that much. By heavier terrain penalties, I mean it costs you more movement points to move through them. So, for example, you can see here, Molder normally has six move. And he can, well, okay, it doesn't quite work because there's a wall in the way, and also we can just walk around the pillar, but in order to cross this pillar, I have to pay more movement. And mounted units are more heavily affected by that penalty. Because Paladins have a base movement of eight, even when paying that penalty, they're kind of okay. Great Knights cannot move through terrain to, to save their lives. They're all horrible at that. So even though they have the same base movement as an infantry class, they actually tend to have worse movement because they get slowed down by everything. So that's the negative of going Great Knight. Why would you go Great Knight? So if you do go Great Knight and you lose one movement, you do gain all three weapon types as opposed to just swords and lances and your promotion gain bonuses are slightly better like one or two points in like strength and defense so what do you gain by going great knight you gain an additional weapon type it is the best weapon type in axis but it doesn't really matter if you have one two range through javelins that's probably enough you don't actually need axes that much especially because you're going to be getting e-rank axes is an additional weapon type, which is not really worth that much, and plus one strength worth minus two movement, which you're going to be feeling every single turn. No. That's why Great Knight is bad. That's my actual non-meme explanation of why we did not go Great Knight. Great Knight also has a better strength cap? I guess, but the cap does not matter at all. The cap does not matter at all. Don't worry about stat caps. You're probably not going to reach them. And if you do, it doesn't matter. <laughs> like, it really only matters if you're doing, I guess, a fan hack where you're fighting enemies that are stronger than they would ever be in the base game. And even in our case, I don't think it matters. We're just gonna use the sacred weapons, which can compensate for that. You can't listen to Jet Black J. They think dancers are bad. You can't trust anything they say. Hey, we killed this guy. Okay, well, we'll get him on the second hit. We got him. Okay, I don't think we have to do anything with Franz. Franz can just chill back here. Or the failure, whatever, his inventory is fine. Dusel, we could send over the silver axe. Do we have any axe units on Erica's route? I don't think so. Whatever, we can just leave Dusel's inventory as it is. Ephraim's good because he has the Reggie Leaf, which doesn't help anybody else. We should probably send over our Restore Stabs. We might need those. We'll need at least one. So let's send over one Restore Staff. Killer Lance and Axe Reaver. We do have some... Maybe we can set over the Axe Reaver. Axe Reaver could be really useful. 
on Vanessa, right? Let's actually send over our Axe Reaver. Sword Slayer. We don't have axe unit. We don't have axe units, so we can't even use the sword slayer. I think Ross is fine. Amelia is also fine because her inventory is garbage. It's just that her stats by this point are good. Okay. I think we're set. In terms of inventory management. We have the body ring. We can use the body ring now, or we can use it on the other route. Do we give the body ring to Vanessa, or do we give it to Tana? We're like obsessed with Tana. Five con is so bad. If we give the body ring to Tana, we have it for the entirety of training her through Erikaru. That's going to be very useful. How much con does Vanessa have? It's pathetic. I think it's six or something. Our Vanessa literally has base speed. But I think we're going to use Tana later. I'd rather use Tana the Talented than Vanessa. Oh, but Vanessa supports Molder. We get more body rings? Oh yeah, we'll get another body ring, right? So let's give this one to Vanessa. Let's give it to Vanessa, and then Tana can use the other one. And it's in the convoy, so we don't have to worry about that. Okay. Oh, Body Ring of Flower isn't that good because it'll hurt their aid. Yeah, but I think we're still small enough, right? We'll see. I think the plus effective plus two speed is probably worth it. Who can we heal? We need XP. We heal Amelia. Yeah, we're going to be really big once we become a wyvern. It'll be hard to carry people. What does this guy have? Oh my goodness. This guy's a monster! He just has a spear. Okay. So his weapon's bad. That's fine. Okay. There's definitely some dialogues to get. So I think we're going to see the dialogues. I don't know who we're actually going to kill him with. Don't tell Kaga. Ephraim and Deuce love conversations? Okay. How much damage do we deal? We deal three and we get doubled? That's bad. He has 11 crit on us. That's crit. We have 37 hit with weapon triangle advantage. Well, we don't die unless we get crit. Guard. The Silent Emperor. Great, great boss convo. Your Majesty. Am I finished? Great boss convo. Majesty. It's too late, isn't it? Forgive me. Hey, we hit him. Okay, he didn't crit us. That's good. Hey, good XP. No, he's too big. Dusel is too big. Okay, that... Look at that. We can exactly rescue him. 
Because we didn't use the body ring. Ephraim has one for sure. Alright, we deal two damage. Regileaf. Oh, Regileaf does 25 damage. What is this hit rate? Vigard! Why did you invade Renee? Why did you kill my father? Vigard. The Silent Emperor. Great boss combos. Answer me, Vigard! So you really have lost hold of your senses, haven't you? Silent Emperor. Regili. And I think that'll actually get us level 20. Hey, no wasted XP. Uh oh. Ephraim. Why didn't you level strength or speed? Answer me. save you it's fine okay the final boss is a mage Leon quaking in his boots okay now for our actual boss killer <laughs> we double him <laughs> now this is gaming gotta train our axe rank Guard. The Silent Emperor. Great boss combos. No! Hey, we have five crit. That's a lot of XP. That's a lot of XP. I need the XP. My heal! Anyone else I can heal? These, uh... Dusel can be healed. But Ephraim didn't actually get hit. Oh, healing on the throne. We get the really cool boss battle music, though. Look at all of that XP. That's so good. We still have a lot of hand axe uses. Hammer's in the convoy, I think. Mend Dusel. Just doing it for the XP. <laughs> to build that support. This is a battle of attrition, okay? You think you can stand up to Amelia the Armored? 5% crit? Look at this. I think we, we do have to hit him twice, though. Because he does heal here. We got our mech fight. Did we get him? No! We have two more shots. Two more shots at him. We got him! We saved Renee and all of Magvel. The Silent Emperor. We did it. He can't, he's speechless, he died to Amelia. 
and we steal his strength for our own. His strength and his speed and his defense. Well, we got two out of three. That's pretty good. Siphoned by Amelia. <laughs> are, are we sure she's one star? Look at these stats. Forget about what we had to actually do to get here. Wow, we have 23 speed. Why do we use a speed wing on her? We're gonna cap our speed. <laughs> okay, last minute. Last minute Lara Shell training. I have no. I guess we'll just break this mend. I have no heal stabs. We did it, Patrick! We saved Magvel! We don't even- we can't even heal Amelia because she didn't get hit. Okay, everyone else is at full health. I guess we'll get the B support before we seize. Dusel can just wait over here. Tana can sit in the corner and watch this blossoming romance. B for Blossom. B for Barrier, okay? We paid big money for a second Barrier staff. We're gonna get our money's worth. Look at this XP. Look at that! I guess we can get Boulder XP, too. Get ready for riveting gameplay. Ah, uh, yeah. Gotta heal that 1 HP. For 6 XP. Oh, we can get the Hatchet sequel! Yeah, the Hatchet sequel for huge XP. We actually can do that. I guess we'll deposit the Restore. We can use Hermurn. Yeah, that's not it. Maximum value. Restores items to new conditions. Oh. Okay, it can't actually be in your inventory. Well, we know who has to hold it, right? Definitely not optimal. This is my favorite hatchet by Gary Paulson. I've had it since I was a kid. It's kind of useless in battle now, but I just keep it as a memento. Hello, Ross! Did you hear? S technology is incredible! We invented a sequel! It's an animation for Hermern. Hatchet 2, Ross's return! Look at the XP! Lab level? My magic! Yes! <laughs> Technology is incredible! Lightweight and easy to hit with! Hatchet! It's back! For might! <laughs> Definitely a worthwhile use of Hermurn. Good as new. Alright, back to the convoy with you. I need magic XP. I like hatchets. They're lightweight and easy to hit with. What do we do? I guess we'll just keep the hatchet. Oh, healer with molder. <laughs> Gotta get that XP. Oh no, she... Oh yeah, she did get it. She did get HP. Alright, so we're gonna get the Ephraim and uh, Lab Rochelle B support, and we're gonna get Amelia and Ross A, and then we're gonna seize, and then we'll move over to Erica's route.
Molder can just stand on this pillar. Good thing we paid for this barrier stack. <laughs> Weapon level increased. Wait, we're not gonna. Oh, it's already A. If we want her to get, we probably want her to use Excalibur, right? Is Excalibur that important? Who would be our other Anima Magic user? We'll see, we'll see. Maybe she won't be able to use Excalibur. Unfor unfortunately, we're gonna get S and Stabs. We already have S Stabs with Molder. Oh yeah, Ewan! Well, no, Ewan's gonna be our dark magic user, though. Because Ewan's obviously going summoner. Lead Latona. Oh, I guess we'll turn everything on that's not... I thought it would have them on by default. Yeah, we don't need S-Lite anyway. But S-Anima would be nice. We could early promote? You're insane. I'll never do that. I'll never do that. I know it's a pitfall. I want my 10 more levels. Which way are you going with Salah? I think we're going the bench with Salah. Not because he's bad, I just don't like him. He's perfectly fine. Lab level! It's so fast! My magic! Yes! My speed! <laughs> Research complete. What's the Demon King gonna do? What's wrong with level 15? It's not level 20. If I promote at level 15, that's five levels of stats that I just threw away. That's cash in the trash. We bought these barrier stabs for a reason. Maybe we should buy another one. Renak, you're not busy, are you? Renak, I got a mission for you. I guess he doesn't actually have to do it, right? <laughs> hey, look at this paladin movement. Yeah, <laughs> we're going on a shopping spree with Ford. He can afford anything. It's thematic. Please play riveting gameplay. Did I load? I think I got rid of it. Media source. Desktop. 
Live red reaction, Detective Pikachu graphics, riveting gameplay. Riveting. We can do stimulation, I think, if we need those. We might need stimulation. In case you don't think this uh, staff grind is exciting enough. Hey. Hey! You ever seen gameplay like this? Eyes over here. We're getting staff XP, okay? Barriers going up. I guess it makes sense to actually move La Rochelle and Ephraim. Uh oh. Stimulate! Overstimulated! Am I okay? I'm okay. Too much stimulation? <laughs> We're back. Okay, the thing is that we have to both buy it, and we have to put the member card back in the convoy. My barrier broke. I need barriers, Tad. There you go. No, that wasn't a special effect. The webcam was just freaking out. Alright. Secret Chopper Ford. I don't need a red gem. I'll take two barrier stacks. <laughs> now this is gaming. I guess we'll also get another physique. The actually useful staff. Not that barrier is useless, but... Oh! Lab level! My magic! My speed! <laughs> What is this? We have 10 defense. How do we have 10 def- I guess we're using mana shield. Break yourselves upon my body. On the front line of research, what are they gonna do? 10, 10 defense, 12 res. The barrier staff. I don't know this. I don't know if that's what they meant. I mean, there's other stats I'd rather have plus, plus four in, but it's, defense is fine. Defense is pretty useful. Oh, we got the support too. We got. We got to keep barriering. <laughs> yes, the levels. An updated riveting gameplay graphic. But the riveting gameplay graphic is is riveting, right? I play it here. There is riveting. It's it's Rosie the Riveter. We can do it. Not simulating enough? Is this not enough for you? We need more barriers. <laughs> Look, th these level ups are really fast. And it's free XP, not an XP thief. Wish we had a dancer, that would be nice. We're gonna get S rank stabs. <laughs> we could update research complete, yeah. I 
I don't think there's any way to reach level 20 and not be Essence Stabs. Maybe, oh, maybe we can't actually reach Essence Stabs because we're not promoted. Yeah, it's okay. So once we promote, we don't use Stabs. <laughs> once we promote, we just start shooting fire at them and then we get S rank Anima and then we, uh, and then we go ahead and go back to healing. So we're actually not gonna heal people. <laughs> That's our strategy. And then we can use Excalibur with Labrachelle. That's our strategy. We're the greatest tacticians in Magvel. That's why we're sitting here spamming barrier. Here's the lab level. Give me my magic. Give me my speed. <laughs> Evil quaking. What are they going to do? What are they going to do? Now, this is gameplay, okay? This is gameplay. save you sorcery negated what's the last boss gonna do she's low on skill it's fine we use magic R remember okay i don't know if people are honestly concerned about skill but remember how horrendous ross's skill was and remember that ross uses axes the least accurate weapon we still had pretty much no hit issues and we're going to be using magic, which I think the most accurate. So I'm not worried at all. Barriers going up. We're going Mage Knight over Valkyrie? Absolutely. There's no reason to go Valkyrie. Valkyrie's horrible. It's probably more thematic to go Valkyrie. It seems like what she would do, but no. Mage Knight's way better. Better stats and a way better magic type. The only reason you would go Valkyrie is if you were tricked by, I guess, light propaganda. Remember that light magic is not effective versus monsters. Molder the Boulder and his Slayer skill as a bishop, that's what's effective versus monsters. If light magic itself killed monsters, then I would probably go Valkyrie, yes. Let me guess you're promoting Garrick into Ranger too? Absolutely not. Unless you're talking to that guy. Alright, here's the lab level. These levels are really fast. We're paying to win. Our research funding. My speed! My res! What's the last boss gonna do? Not save you. Our stats are pretty good. I move. I'm moving the uh, the stimulation. That's not right. Okay, there we go, there we go. Finally blessed. Ford's back from a shopping trip. I think we can actually go... We can actually go to level 20. We have so many barriers. And this is why we bought barrier. Ross and Amelia are definitely a support by now. So we're multitasking here. We can actually promote... Ooh. We can promote Lab Rochelle. And then we can go into the desert map with her as a mage knight. She's not going to be that useful because it is a desert, but... Only six more levels. We can do it. Let's do it. What's the turn count? <laughs> it's just 64 turns. For those who are not familiar with Fire Emblem, you definitely should not do this. 
because she's a healer, she gains XP really slowly. So what you should definitely do is, as soon as she is able to promote at level 10, you should just promote her. <laughs> But we're doing this because it's fun. Barriers going up. Lab level coming up. Plus two on speed and average on ma magic, and we're invincible apparently. I don't think loot could get XP like this for free. Lab level? My magic, my speed. Yes! Yes! Your magic shall What's not Leon gonna do? We're too powerful, my webcam is dying. The Demon King can't stop me from getting 2020 before promotion. <laughs> Barriers going up. Let's add Dazla back. I think Dazla's not gonna be able to cut it on on Lunatic. He's just too slow. He's fine for hard mode, but on Lunatic he's just gonna get destroyed. Do we have enough barrier uses? So we're level 15. Do we need another barrier? Somebody can calculate that, right? I, I think we need one more barrier. Maybe not. Maybe we'll just barely make it. Oh! The lab level! My magic! Yes! <laughs> These are the best levels! Research complete. What is the Demon King gonna do? <laughs> Rouston is the holy country. What are they gonna do? Barriers going up. Her growths aren't even that much better than other characters. They're they're good, but they're not this good. We've actually been actually blessed. The skill does not matter at all. Magic doesn't miss. I'm not worried. I think we actually no, okay, we actually do have enough barriers. We're fine. I think we'll just barely get there. Heal with Molder. Molder doesn't need the XP. Molder doesn't need the XP. Let's let's conserve our resources, okay? There is not hoarding, and then there's just being wasteful. I say as I spam four barriers stacks. The lab level. Another winner. <laughs> <laughs> Why is the sad music playing? Research complete. What's the Demon King gonna do? Fifteen magic, eighteen speed, twenty-two luck. We have eleven defense. We're level seventeen troubadour with eleven defense. Break yourselves upon my body. Science is incredible! We need another barrier. <laughs> Are we sure she's two stars? More barriers! More barriers! <laughs> Look at this! Do we even need the rest of our army? Lady Labrachelle, 
How did you get so strong? Well, of course, I need them. <coughs> Lady Lab Rochelle, how'd you get so strong? Well, you gotta put your nose to the grindstone and put in the hours in the lab doing the research. Also, I sat near the throne for almost a hundred turns spamming barriers. And that's why I'm so good at using magic to vanquish evil. <laughs> barriers going up. I guess our only stat that's bad is skill, but that doesn't matter at all. I will be shocked if we miss a magic attack. <laughs> I'm not worried at all. Magic is super accurate. Skill sucks. Still better than Rez, though. If you use barrier on someone, it should raise their res permanently if you do enough of this. Okay. Our next lab level, level 18. <laughs> Sixteen magic, nineteen speed! You're too slow! Well, here's where all of our luck went. She stole all of it. Barriers going up. I think we do have enough barrier charges, right? Do I do I have to go buy more? <laughs> Lab Rochelle and Ross are the new Bartra and Dorcas. Who's our other support partner? I was just gonna do A with Ephraim, but she's gonna be melting foes on the front line now. Do we need another one? We're level 18. We're one short, aren't we? No, oh, we need another barrier staff! Lab level? <laughs> 17 magic! Oh, res plus seven. Alright, forward. Get back out there. Yep. Okay, we need one more barrier. On the move. We have plus three attack, plus two speed, plus four defense. <laughs> We're ballin'. Oh, can she support Tana? If she can support Tana, we'll just have her support with Tana. They're definitely going to use Tana, I think. She can't? Okay, never mind. I remember her supports being kind of... kind of bad. My barrier! She supports Erica, Josh... Oh, we can support her with Erica. Probably makes sense to support her with Erica, because who's Erica's other partner? And also because she's going to be married to her brother, right? They should be friends. They're going to be in-laws. Yeah, I don't know who La Rochelle is, but Lab Rochelle is... <laughs> Lab Rochelle's really good. Okay, we need one more barrier. We're doing Erica Seth for the A, so she has a B available for Lab Rochelle. We spent like... 
10k on barriers. <laughs> We can get Ephraim A and Erica B. Uh, Ephraim's already maxed out. Who's the A Tana gonna be? It might be no one. Renag crying in a corner. Alright, Ford, he made it. Okay, we banked that. I guess we'll, we may as well also take the guiding ring, right? We're gonna be using that now. <laughs> Five dollar microtransaction from Anna. Mm. Thank you, Anna, for the five dollar microtransaction under the pseudonym of Silver. Oh, Tonic and some more. Support Cormag? Okay, then that's what we're gonna do. Cormag's super good. Alright, Ford, we're gonna banish him. It's been a long time, so just in case. Don't tell Kaga. Alright, barriers going up. We're almost there. Like three more barriers, and we're gonna be done. Do we even have a fire tone? <laughs> I don't even think we can attack. The final lab level, here it comes. I hope you've been stimulated thus far. The final lab level. Well, how could it get any better than that, right? Your magic shall not save you. The final boss is a mage, what is he gonna do? Research complete. <laughs> okay, that's enough stimulation, I think. Wow. Level 20 Troubadour, Lab Rochelle, 17 magic. Nine skill, that's pretty bad, who cares. 19 speed, 24 luck, 11 defense, 11 defense troubadour. Break yourselves upon my body. 18 resistance. Actually ridiculous. I'm glad we went to level 20. Do we have any animatones? <laughs> well, we don't need a hand axe. I guess we'll take a fire zone. <laughs> Guiding ring. Use this on a worthy wielder of magic power and stabs. <laughs> Hello! Lab Rochelle here, leader of our glorious army. Now, normally, I'm the one interviewing the candidates to see if they're worthy, but if I'm evaluating myself, I think I can go ahead and give myself a passing grade. No complaints from the staff, I hope. If you have any complaints, do be sure to leave them in the complaint box. I do read them all. Thank you, as always, for your feedback. Level 1 Mage Knight plus 2 Magic! <laughs> we have 19 Magic! We can Kanto to the throne! Why didn't the map end? I thought that was our main lord! <laughs> Look at this! 
when we entered the throne room, did we know that this is what awaited us? This is the true treasure of Grotto. <laughs> Are we sure she's two stars? <laughs> what in the world? Okay, time. We can heal on the throne! My Molder XP. Time to support. <laughs> Ephraim, wait a minute. Yes. I've heard such interesting things about you from so many people. I thought it best to ask directly. You are a reckless man, are you not? It seems an attitude unbefitting a commander, wouldn't you say? <laughs> Don't speak to me. <laughs> I can't say that without laughing. Actually hilarious. Don't speak to me that words. <laughs> Am I actually I cry? I'm too hyped up on Lab Rochelle level ups. Don't speak to me that way. If I can save a life by taking a risk myself, I'll do it. Actually great commander. Remember how Ephraim doesn't say anything in Engage? So people who have only played Engage might assume that he was stalwart silent in his base game. No, he has a ton of good lines. Every this is why everyone likes Ephraim. He's both really strong and he's a a little bit generic, but I think a likable character. This is war, and war is risky. I have no problem with that. Oh dear. <laughs> I'll bet your body is just covered with scars under that armor, isn't it? Not for magic, though, because we just used barrier on him like 50 times. I can heal them all for you. Let me see them. Thanks. Let's see. Whoa! Well, she she did ask, right? I think this is actually okay. Oh! Oh! Oh my. What are you doing? I have to take my armor off if I'm going to show you the scar on my shoulder. <sighs> this is a difficult video for me to make. Difficult video for me to make. Cad! Beast! Pervert! Devil! I simply will not allow you to take advantage of me in my confused state! Conf what? Wait! Larissa, what about my scars? Please support. Uh-oh. <laughs> Cancelled. Can you cancel these stats, though? Maybe if your stats are even better. <laughs> She has 13 defense. Ephraim only has 12. Larchelle, in con in recognition of your contributions to this army, we've decided that this angelic robe should be yours to wield. Well, while I agree that I am angelic, it should be you, cad, devil, beast who ought to cover up. But I will accept. Well... I was not sure we were going to use the angelic robe on her, but given that she's definitely going to be on the front lines, because her stats are actually ridiculous, uh, we may as well give it to her, because she needs it, because her HP kind of sucks. But it's not her fault, just her class is bad HP. I hope we have an A support by now. Oh yeah, we do, okay. So hopefully this one will be a little less ridiculous. 
Hi, Ross. Is this friends? Hi, Ross. Hey, Amelia. I heard you're getting better. Yes, I'm getting there. I just killed the Emperor of Grotto. Well, it's a hard road to get to where we think we should be. Yep, that's true. As for me, my father was always the warrior in the family. I've always wanted to be just like him. I think I'm just finally starting to get close to that goal. My stats are about triple his right now. But anyways, how are your parents? Well, I don't talk about them much. Oh! Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to... No, no, it's fine. My father's been gone for as long as I can remember. I see. I was living with my mother, but she is no longer with me. I see. Sounds like you've had a rough life. Well, I'm sorry I brought up something painful. Um, uh, I got it! I'll be your big brother! No, Ross, no! Well, this is not fate. What in the world are you talking about? Your brother! And you'll be my sister, yeah! Now, this is the best idea I've had in a while! It doesn't matter that we're not blood relatives. Is this fate? The army's like a family, so we're like siblings! So it's decided then. You're my little sister from now on, so you're not alone anymore. You can call me Big Brother, okay? Um, this is all kind of sudden. I don't know if I'm ready to... Never mind all that! We're brother and sister from now on. Alright, sis? How old are you anyway? <laughs> huh? What's that got to do with it? You know, old enough to show you the ropes. Wait a minute, you're probably the same age as me. What? In fact, I'll bet I'm a little older. Ah, be quiet, I said I'm the big brother. It doesn't matter the exact day we're born, I'm the big brother. Any way you look at it, I'm the older one. <laughs> you're too funny. It's so cute when you get mad. <laughs> <sighs> Thanks for the laugh. <laughs> Is this not an apt description of using Amelia? Thanks for the laugh. Ha! Huh. When this war is over, I'll take you to my village. What? Haven't you been listening to anything? We're brother and sister now, remember? Uh, right. From now on, you and I are gonna share both joy and sorrow as a family, okay? If I didn't know better... I didn't know better. I think that you were proposing to me. <laughs> what? It's not what I'm talking about at all. You twisted my words up. Just forget it. Anyways, let's go. Let's go, Amelia. <laughs> Thanks. Big brother. <laughs> Ross, what was that? He bungled it. He bungled it so badly. The B support was so good. He set it up. He completely threw it away. Ross, what was that? That was horrible. Ross from Friends would have done better. <laughs> Ross the Rizless. I guess it worked. It's because he's got 24 strength. I'm, I'm betting it doesn't sound as bad in Japanese. Ah, oh, Onichan. Horrible. A hey, Amelia, are we sure? <laughs> Low skill, a high luck. I guess he got lucky last. He got lucky with the B support. Woman only care about one thing and it's con. He's got 13 of that. Ephraim only has 8 con. What is this? 13 con? Hey, Larcel! Wanna see my scars? Aw, you're so sweet. Hey, Larcel, wanna see my scars? Cad! Devil! Villain! Beast! Okay, let's finish this map. What? Is this? Card's corpse, it, it disintegrated. It must be some type of dark magic. 
Very astute, Seth. Regardless, the capital has been captured. Re Seth, you're not concerned? I'll lead a patrol through the castle. There may be enemy soldiers remaining. I'll go with you. Lie on me. Lie on? The lion? It's spelled with a, with a Y. That's Leon. Oh, it's Leon. Leon may be somewhere within the castle. Oh, we found him. Uh-oh. He doesn't look so good. Hello, Ephraim. I've been waiting for you. Looks like you've beaten my father. I thought you might. You really are powerful, aren't you? Leon! Is that really you? Leon, you must tell me! What's happened here in Grotto? I guess he's not interested in telling us. Why are you in this place? Your father, Emperor Vigard. Why didn't you stop him? Don't tell me you're caught up in this madness, too! Answer me, Leon! You always told me you wanted what your father wanted. Peace! I... Oh, wait, is this... No, he's still evil. I... I... Ah! <laughs> Let me tell you something, Ephraim. I've been waiting for this moment for a very, very long time. Sibling silence. I will make the world grotto. No. My plaything! I've been planning this my whole life. Why else would I befriend you and Erica? I needed to learn where and how to attack and destroy Rene. Thanks to the two of you, I learned all I needed to know. While you feigned, if I just know what feigned means, compassion for my weakness and scorned me in your hearts. What? Leon, you're wrong. We never... And then my chance arrived. I replaced my useless father, readied my tools, and set my plan in motion. I began by destroying Rene, and then I murdered your father. You lie, Leon! You could never- Shall I tell you a story? Would you like to hear of your father's last moments? You'll laugh, really. Your father's such a weakling, and yet he tried so hard. Leon! No more insults to my father, or I may forget myself. Oh, are you angry, Ephraim? But not even you can stop me now. The stones of Freli and Rene are dust, and Jehenna's is soon to follow, which leaves only two more. I will destroy them one at a time. I shall see my dream fulfilled. What? Ephraim, you're in my way. Therefore, <laughs> how bothersome. I truly do wish to be your opponent, but I'm not yet at full strength. Let's meet again, shall we? Assuming you live, of course. I'll grant you the honor of dying at my hand. Like father, like son, eh? <laughs> I guess he didn't laugh. Well, what are you really going to say to that, right? A lolger. Reporting in, sir! We found a cell in the back. There were captives. Oh, who's this? <laughs> Who is it? Ah! Has my execution been moved up on the schedule? Wait. You're not a grotto soldier. Who are you? I'm Ephraim of Rene. And who are you? That's an odd question for an executioner. My name is Noel. Until recently, I was one of Grotto's top researchers in arcane matters. Top researchers, you say? 
Research complete. We need more researchers. So why is it you're locked up in here? Shadowy silence? You need not answer if you do not wish to. Tell me, what is Leon attempting to do? I still have things I intend to ask him. You wish to speak to Prince Leon? You really don't know anything, do you? What do you mean? Is there something wrong with Leon? What do you know? Okay. Erica often gets flack for being the dumb one. And she does have the worst scene. Is there something wrong with Leon? My man Ephraim, you just met him. He was talking like an anime villain. He looked like this. I don't think Leon's okay, bro. <laughs> Shadowy silence? I'll tell you all I know, if you'd like. However, I think you will not thank me once you hear it. It all began one year ago. It was when the Emperor died. The Emperor's health worsened, and then he... Hold. What are you on about? One year ago? That's before Grotto's invasion of Rene began. And I just saw the Emperor. I killed him with my own hands. Uh, I know his body then dissolved into nothing, which was kind of weird, and we said that it might be dark magic, but I'm sure he was fine. Allow me to continue in the order in which everything occurred. Wow, Noel is really polite. <laughs> That's a very polite way of saying, uh, please let me finish. One year ago, the Emperor died of the illness that had plagued him. Listen, Ephraim. There's something about the plague that you should know. Oh no. We're too late. The Emperor has already been infected! He may look fine now, but it's only a matter of time before he turns... ...into the Demon King. That's not actually what happens. Prince Leon was devastated. He fell into an endless despair. An endless despair, you say? Where is it? An endless despair, you say? Some people say we have too many graphics. He felt unworthy to take the throne, unable to rule without his father. Sibling silence. He then began to look for a way to overturn his father's demise. He wanted to resurrect him. Wait. Resurrect him? Yes. Did I stutter? I said resurrect him. For those attuned to the dark arts, even death is not the final frontier. That's not what Noel said, he just said yes. As you know, the Stone of Grotto is possessed of unique powers. It was once used to seal away the Demon King, and it alone held the Dark One's soul. It burned within with the Demon King's rage, and we called it the Fire Emblem. Prince Leon and a team of mages skilled in ancient lore hoped to harness its energies. I remember the joy in Prince Leon's eyes when he spoke of using it to save lives. Leon. Prince Leon told us he intended to use the Fire Emblem to restore the Emperor. His death had been kept from the public, but rumors were beginning to fly. We knew we had to hurry before the people learned the truth of the Emperor's death. Prince Leon dedicated himself to research, skipping meals, for going sleep. And then, what happened? I wasn't there, so I did not witness it firsthand. By the time I arrived, the deed had already been done. The fire emblem had been shattered, split in two. One was a sacred stone, only for the Game Boy Advance, and the other. Uh oh. One year ago, it's Noel! Prince Leon! 
What's happened? Prince... Hello. It's you. What was your name again? Ah, yes. Noel. You're one of my researchers. I have glad tidings for you. My father is back. Long live the king of Grotto. The emperor? The silent emperor. Come, father. Open your eyes. The silent emperor. Your majesty! This is incredible! Prince Leon, what miracle is this? It cannot be! What... What is that stone? This? This is the Dark Stone. It bears even more power than any sacred stone. I extracted and condensed all of the magic bound within the Fire Emblem. The Dark Stone's power is what gave my father back the spark of life. Hmm. A bolt of brilliance! It's just like Frankenstein. Do you guys know that Frankenstein is actually the name of the doctor and not the monster? The Darkstone? Now that the Darkstone is mine, I have no need for this empty husk. Leon, sacred stone. What have you done? They're all in the way. The sacred stones, I mean. Four more remain, and they must all be destroyed. The only stone we need now is this dark stone of mine. Well, that's not ominous. Sibling silence. After that, His Majesty ordered the invasion of Rene as Prince Leon asked him to. Father McGregor grew concerned with Prince Leon's health. He tried several times to dissuade him from his path. Prince Leon executed him personally. I too was branded a traitor and arrested. My execution was scheduled for tomorrow. So thanks for saving me today, that was really convenient. <laughs> Leon, where is he now? I would that I knew. Prince Leon frightens me now. He is transformed. He is... Leon is my friend! This way, Prince Ephraim. I believe it's here. What is it? What is this place? This is the former resting place of the Stone of Grotto. The Fire Emblem. We've kept the sacred twins of Grotto here as well. If we're still lucky, they may, they may still be here. Sacred twins. Those are the ancient weapons once wielded by the founders of our nations. Let's see if I remember my studies. Emperor Grottos were the magic tome Gleipnir and Garm the Black Axe. That is correct. You know your history well. Yeah, it's something I learned long ago. From Leon. Shadowy silence. Well, let's see if they're still here, shall we? Prince Ephraim! Here. I found the sacred twin relics. 99 Hunter! <laughs> Good at tracking. And here they are. Yet, I don't understand. The sacred stone was destroyed, but these were left untouched? Why? Well, I think it's because Glepnir sucks. Glepnir is actually not effective against monsters. But Garm is probably the best weapon in the game, aside from... Ephraim's own PRF Sigmund. I know not. Perhaps... No. Never mind. It's an idle thought. Prince Ephraim, please take these relics with you. Is that alright? Yes. I want you to have them. And maybe. Maybe someone else wanted you to have them as well. He's being very, very vague here, but... Uh, for clarity, I do believe that what he means by someone else is... He means that... Although Leon is possessed by the Demon King at this point, spoilers, that's why he's acting giga evil. Uh, Leon is not entirely evil. The the good Leon is still in there. That's probably why he didn't destroy these relics. Thanks for Glepnir. <laughs> Thanks for Garm! Garm's really good. 
Prince Ephraim! You've come at a good time, soldier. I want you to take a message to Frelia. Actually, we've received dire news from Johanna! It's about Princess Erica and Prince Inez. They're under attack by Grotto forces, led by Tiger Eye and Moonstone. Erica, Kalik Tiger Eye, and Valter Moonstone. They're supposed to be the most powerful of Grotto's Imperial generals. And to have abandoned the capital and led the battle into Johanna. The Knights of Rouston have ridden to the Eastern Front to aid Frelia, but the enemy attacks have been brutal. I fear for their survival. We march for Johanna immediately. We will rescue Erica. But even if we leave now, we will not make it in time. We'll make it. Rest easy on that. Erica's my sister. That one will never lay down her blade. And I'm Erica's brother. There's no way I'll let my sister die. Cool chapter. So after chapter 14 is chapter 9. The Tower of Olney has appeared. Oh, okay. Chapter 9X. Hey, different music. Just got back. Is the Unbreakable Resolve quote Osric? Break yourselves back. upon my body. I think this is my favorite map theme from Sacred Stones. I like all the Sacred Stones map themes. So we're definitely gonna do Inventory Hell with uh with this song. Manage items. I'm a little worried. I'm not gonna lie, this army looks terrible. <laughs> We've got Seth. We've got base speed Vanessa. And <laughs> God, what is this? <laughs> Seth and friends. Alright, so we have... Very average Erica. We have 19 skill, by the way. Erica's okay, but I mean, she's Erica. That's the issue. Arthur can become a bishop. We have nothing else, so I guess we're going to use this guy. We do have six star Seth. We, I think we are going to have to actively use him because our other units are so bad. Vanessa has base speed. She's level seven with base speed. I'm very worried. Joshua actually got two very good levels and then a bad level, but Joshua is just Erica 2, and we didn't even need Erica 1. Loot, she says she's a prodigy. I don't see it. And Natasha can use a staff, so that's okay. Well, Kyle's not forward, so... That's our army. <laughs> Luckily, we do actually have blessings from our brother. We got all these items which we can use. So we're, we're just gonna load it up. Give me the Lance Reaver. Do we have any light tones? We do have, I guess we'll take two lightning tones. Seth. We'll take an iron sword, I guess. Definitely need javelins, right? We'll take a javelin. And an iron lance. Okay, we have to buy an iron lance. And for emergencies, the silver lance, right? So we have to buy an iron lance. Uh, I guess we also need to buy an iron lance for Vanessa. Slim lance. Definitely want to kill a lance. Definitely want a javelin. Definitely want an axe reaver. We gotta train Vanessa. Okay, we need an iron sword. Hey, we got the killing edge back. An iron blade. I guess we'll take the armor slayer. 
Why no vulnerabilities? We'll, we'll add them. Loot, I don't think we have any... I think we have Elf Fire, but we don't have regular fire. So we have to buy regular fire. Natasha needs healing staves. Kyle needs iron swords. Give him a javelin. Uh, probably give him a killer lance. And then just iron sword, iron lance. Enter the armory. Okay, we need some iron swords, so... We're kind of low on money. We need iron lances. They don't sell... Oh, they do sell iron lances. Iron lance for... We need three iron lances. And then we need, uh, fire for loot. Ephraim put us in debt. There's lots of stuff we can sell. And we need a heal as well. We don't have any heals. One fire is probably enough. Erica's maps are much easier, yeah. Overall. Okay, and we're broke. <laughs> Which is actually fine, right? If the gold is in your convoy, it's not actually doing anything. As far as I'm concerned, we, we already cleared the three hardest maps in the game, which were the Dusel Rescue, uh, Phantom Ship, obviously, and then that map we just did, uh, Grotto Keep, is really hard. The only reason we were able to clear that map first try was because we didn't get Mulder the Mad. Mulder dodged a 92 Berserk, otherwise we would have lost. Okay, so Seth needs the Iron Lance. Vanessa definitely needs an Iron Lance. The Slim Lance sucks, right? We don't need the Slim Lance. I'd rather take a Vulnery. Maybe it's a Vulnerary. Joshua needs an Iron Sword. Loot is fine. Does Loot even need a Vulnerary? She just dies, right? Natasha can take one because she can't heal herself, but she also just dies, so... We're just making convoy space. And Iron Sword, Iron Lance, and Vulnerary, because he probably will be off on his own a lot. Should we give Seth an Elixir? Let's give Seth an Elixir. Alright, I think we're ready. Will you beat the game tonight? No way. We still have to do all of Erica Root, and then the siblings join up, and then there's the end game. So no, we're probably going to finish it next week, but definitely not today. I'm guessing maybe two more maps today. Depends how long these Erica Root ones take, but I don't think they'll be that bad. It's Rouston. Erica chooses to travel by sea to the Theocracy of Rouston. Her search for a ship leads her to Port Kiris in Car- uh, what was it? Oh, Mincino, that's the Pokemon, right? In Mincino. Mincino is a young nation ruled by a council of merchants. And it's an ally of Frelia. Yes, great merchant. <laughs> Renak. Mincino Council Leader, Klimt, a staunch opponent of Grotta's imperialistic actions, has pledged Mincino's support to Frelia in this conflict. Who's this guy? Hang on. Prince Inez also intends to pass through Mincino on his way to Jehenna. Erica believes there is nothing to fear in Mincino, but she is wrong. 
Oh, he's gone. Chapter 9, Distant Blade. Does that mean we get 1-2 ranged swords? That would be nice. Grotto Keep. Brelia's sacred stone has been destroyed. And yet you still cannot locate the stone of Rene. I thought we killed this guy. Glenn, Walter, find the children of Rene. Find them and take from them the bracelets that they wear. Glenn, take Erica. Walter, take Ephraim. Find them. Conquer them. Yes, your majesty. <laughs> Erica, eh? She's a ripe little peach. And her brother Ephraim. He's better prey than I'd imagine. I can feel my blood rushing at the thought. This might be fun after all. Get out of here. Kalik, Reeve. Shatter the remaining sacred stones. Kalik, take Jehenna. Reeve, take Rouston. Go. Crush the sacred stones they house. <laughs> As you wish. I'll be making arrangements for Rouston's downfall immediately. Ah, why am I stuck with Jehenna? A curse in ill luck. I became a mercenary to escape that wretched place, and now I must go back? Get out of here. Do so. Go to Frelia. Take the Frelian army and punish Ephraim. Selina, remain in the capital. Soon I will have new orders for you. Yes, sire. Your Highness, it's actually Seth, no longer a hologram. We've reached Port Kiris. If we can find passage across the North Sea, we'll reach Ralston in ten days. It smells of the tides. This is a busy place, isn't it? It's a trade center. People of all nations pass through here. Do not become so enthralled with the sights and sounds that you forget your mission. I won't. I'm a mercenary by the name of... Erina. Er er wow. Yes. An ironclad gambit. They'll never find Erina. <laughs> Don't tell Vigard. <laughs> I'm traveling to Rouston to receive a commission. Let's look for a ship then. Erina. The docks are this way. Hmm? Is something amiss? No, nothing. <laughs> You're Erica, the princess of Renee, aren't you? Well, that was easy. Perception 100. What? Dastards! <laughs> Away with you! It's Bug, he's got compound eyes. He saw right through our brilliant disguise. Hey, no need to get personal. Hey, you know there's a pretty price on your pretty head. Hey, sorry, but I need that gold. Oh, he's a he's a warrior. Wow. <laughs> they didn't even comment about the disguise Arena. That didn't work. Where are our units? We don't have anybody. <laughs> Here's pirates. We don't have a thief, by the way. Binks? They change his name? What happened to Bug? This guy's 20 strength. Steel axe and steel bow. So we don't, we don't have to worry about this guy, because we, we can either attack him from two or from one. Ah, uh, Bug was FE7. Binks! Alright, let's see if there's any droppables. If there's any stealables, we can't steal them, so... It's too bad. Axe Reaver could be useful. The Ocean Seal! He drops it. Okay. I mean, these enemies don't seem that strong. None of these guys have... Okay, that guy's a hand axe. Two of them have hand axes. We can just let them come to us, right? Ooh, there's a sniper here. The steel bow. There's an iron axe, hand axe. This is not Marissa. Yes, we recruit. We recruited Amelia on Ephraim's side. 
How does that work? She's part of the map, right? Even on Ephraim Root. So in the vanilla game, you get every unit. They just join at different times. Uh, I was thinking, yeah, Axe Reaver Vanessa on the pirates. Except for they have these hand axes, which I kind of don't like. They're just going to come to us, right? I wish we... Oh, we do have a Lance Reaver. We can Lance Reaver these guys, because we, we don't have any axes. Let's, what about Lance Reaver Joshua? Let's do that, right? We can Reave him. Change our positioning. We definitely want Joshua at the front here. Mage is in the back. We can put Cavalry in the back, right? Because the Mage is a bad move. So Natasha's never reaching anyone. Alright, let's try it. I'm not that worried about this map. This map is kind of hard to get everything, so... I guess my question is... For the purposes of planning... Are there enemies that... Get these houses? Yes? Okay. So let's do this. We'll just have Vanessa get it. Because if Vanessa gets it from here, she can just canto back and not get shot. She can get both of these. So, Vanessa rescue mission. I'm not worried. As long as we know we have to rush for those. Really light on the story for this. Yeah. Good thing we transferred the Axe Reaver, right? Oh, he has a hand axe. That's fine. Prepare to be re- Okay, well, let's make sure we're not in range of this guy. We're not. If we go here. He can attack there, so we don't want to go there. We can't go there anyway. Reaved. Erica in the forest. I guess that's a tactical error. It's fine. Does she have equipped? Rapier? Let's make fire sweats. We should definitely equip fire in case we get attacked. We're gonna get doubled for sure if we have L fire. Look at this. L fire weight 10. Con 3. We literally have zero speed with L fire. Great prodigy. Stop reading Reddit and start lifting weights. And we'll, we'll have... Oh, we can um, build supports with uh, Seth. Natasha has to cower in the back. Arthur has to cower in the back, and I guess build support with loot. No, my animations! Reaved. Okay, well, we're starting right off with a great Joshua level. Give me my strength. Oh, he's a Myrmidon. Reaved? Reaved. Okay, we didn't miss any crits, though, so that's, that's okay. Remind me to turn animations on. We're gonna get shot here. Ouch. That's fine. Natasha XP. Reaved. Animations for everyone except Natasha. We care about Natasha. Okay. Lore relevant heal. We gotta stop these pirates, right? No, 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 no! <laughs> we don't even double them.
Ouch. Are we sure he's six stars? Gotta get the Erica support. So he actually will get the Erica support from here. Enemies, those sword guys can attack us, but like, that's fine. Like, I'm not that worried. XP on our unit of choice. Joshua is still so injured. Kyle with a lance can be here. Okay, loot is level 2. Ardor's level 5, so I guess we'll get the kill with loot. Oh no, what if we miss with our magic? Uh, I mean, we might, I guess. Well, we don't die if we miss. Oh, the pirate has a hand axe, you're right. A 19 attack. If we have two defense, we don't die. We have three. What's the pirate gonna do? Four armor slayer. Four uses. Let's see, is that guy... Can attack both. I don't want Joshua to get double attacked. I think he just sits here, right? Nobody can attack loot, right? We'll just move up one. If we move up one, I think we can suffer from success. So we're not gonna move him forward. Can we safely get that house? I think we can. We might actually get doubled by that Myrmidon though, because <laughs> our stats are so bad. Hey, we kill this guy. That's a lot of damage. What? Are we sure that... Are we sure this guy's four stars? What was that? Are we sure this guy's six... What? You think you can stand up to Sacred Sath? I guess we don't have to use another action to kill that guy. Wow, we can get crit. Dude, what if the Hand Axe guy kills us? Kyle? The Hand Axe. What in the- It's Lunatic! Prince Ephraim, lead us to glory! Ephraim's not here, you bonehead! Cavalier stocks on- <laughs> Ouch, okay. My Cavalier stocks. Well, that's unfortunate. I didn't expect that. It's a disaster. <laughs> I guess we gotta be more careful here. We give him the Lance Reaver. Kyle the killed. Okay, we actually are all set up. Did it save our... It did not. Good thing we remember this. Don't be so cavalier this time. Ah, oh, you got me. Okay. New strategy. New strategy. Good thing we got the Axe Reaver. What's the rush? We're just gonna save the house. 
Can this guy attack the forest? He actually can. We're gonna eat these Lolgers, okay? It's gonna be great. The only rush is that we have to save the houses. And Seth can do that. So we'll just let him do that. Nice four hit rate. Reaved. Hey, maybe our level up will be better this time. Or it actually might be the exact same. Oh, it's better. Oh, are we sure this guy's a Myrmidon? I think this guy's got holy blood. I think we gotta use this guy. Look at that, Reaved. That's... With halved speed, by the way. Halved base speed. Huge levels. Huge levels. We're not losing that. Don't tell Kaga. Okay, this guy's the killing edge, right? Ooh, that's scary. As long as we don't get reaved by him. Which I think is fine, because we can retreat one. I hope we have a spear equipped. I assume we do. I think we're totally okay. I don't think they can attack me. Oh, one can. We get reaved by one, and I think we do get doubled. I, that might kill us. So we might have to redo that action. These guys coming towards us? I think they are. We actually get doubled, which is crazy. Might need some Killing Edge crits on these incoming mercs. I guess we'll draw this guy out. I don't think we really need the forest to dodge him. Oh, you think you could stand up to Joshua the... Joshua of Jehenna? Jo Joshua the... I'm not sure. Okay, what what adjectives start with J? Why are you attacking me? Joshua the Jester, Joshua the Just. This is what I'm scared. Oh my! He doubles us for sure. Reaved. 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 I thought this might happen. It's no problem. We'll just drop next turn. Kaga doesn't know about our last level, so we're fine. I don't even think this pirate can reach us. Uh, nice water walking. Joshua's judgment. Good paladin armor set. Building supports. We'll put Kyle in the forest with an iron. I, that's it's water walking, not running. That's fair. Have you heard the tragedy of base speed, Vanessa? I have heard. RNG should be the same here, right? No. Well, it's not like we saved a. Lance Reaver used last time anyway. We just crit him to make him feel bad. That guy doesn't go to the village, does he? Just in case. We have one extra. 
What do you want? Give me a break. Leave us out of this stupid war of yours. We don't want anything to do with it. Or you're just another victim, like the rest of us here. And regardless, here, take this. Go do something about all this fighting, will you? Hi, right, thanks. Wait, we're in range of the archer. Oh. Oh, we're in range of the archer. We're gonna die. Okay, before I boast, are we in range of this guy? This is why they keep making Kanto remakes. No problem. No problem. Okay, we're pretty scared of this. Both reach there. Okay, one of them reaches the forest, so let's actually... Adjust the forest, right? Yeah, so let's actually do this. And this is no time to be stingy. Killing edge. <laughs> Gotta move Natasha, right? Yeah, now, now Natasha gets hit. Yeah, it's killing edge time. <laughs> We're not messing around. Wow. How many more turns before they get that village? You think you can stand up to Joshua's judgment? We're not messing around. Killed! <laughs> What in the world? How do you save that? Don't tell Kaga. Okay, new strategy. There's no way this guy gets- Okay, this is fine. New strategy. First, we're going to make sure he actually has the Iron Lance equipped. We're going to drop him here. And we're going to get out of here. And now, we, now we're fine. We don't want anyone on that forest. Nope. Okay, here we go. This time we did it. How are you supposed to do this without Vanessa and Seth? Killed? Not killed. You think you can set up to Joshua the Jester? I, I don't know why he's laughing this time. Well, killed is good, but... Okay, we, we actually don't want to get killed here. Are we sure this guy's six stars? Can we reach that? We might actually need the Silver Lance. I mean, we could just kill this guy, right? What if we just kill this guy? Yes, seven. Fourteen might. It's an exact kill of the Silver Lens, right?
Hotel Kaga. This time for sure. We're gonna equip the Silver Lance. <laughs> And then we're gonna drop him. This time for sure. Could also drop Seth closer? Yeah, it's possible. We need to. Because we have to save that other village with Vanessa in the next one. Killed? Killed on the first hit, please. Or the second hit. You think you can stand up to Joshua's judgment? Okay, we don't want to get killed. Yeah, we exactly kill him. Perfect. Okay. Calculated. Remember how we got one level up and we got strength? Isn't that nice? Oh, hey! It's our killing edge now. Guess we'll get rid of this iron sword. Our XP! That's a lot of enemies. Okay, I think we can pick up a nice kill here. We get doubled there. Then, like, both of our mages? I definitely want to feed this to one of our mages. Why don't I just use a javelin? How about that? Why take a counterattack? I don't think we kill this guy with our iron sword, right? Nope. And then we can feed the kill to one of our mages. I guess we'll give it to loot. Fed! Okay, definitely not Elfire. And if she misses, I guess we'll give it to R2. Oh, we got it. We got it. Level 3 mage. Oh, Joshua, you're injured. Let me help you. Feeling sick? Okay. Nine. Well, it doesn't matter that we can't reach the village because it's safe. Also, this guy's definitely dead, right? Oh, what is he going to do to us? You think you can stand up to Sacred Seth? Killed! <laughs> feeling sick? Yes, I'm feeling dead. Okay, I think we we finally solved this. What do you want? Give me a break. We're out of here. Let's lure this guy in. Iron sword's fine. We probably double. We're really fast. Gotta build those supports. We feel so much weaker without Ross and Amelia. He doesn't even attack. He's just trying to get the village. He's so scared. Nine damage. Ouch. We double? We don't double. Hello? I thought Erica was fast. Seth the Slayer, 99, everyone, uh oh. Uh, they might demote me from the greatest tactician in Magvel. This is pretty embarrassing. We. Kaga. This time for sure. This time for sure. Okay, lunatic mode pretty difficult. A nice thing is that we're not losing any level ups, right? Vanessa the Vanquished.
Aren't you glad you picked up the Monado during the tutorial? Yeah, yeah, all these terrible fates. I'm glad we avoided them all. What would we do without the Monado's guidance? We know how this goes, right? We kill him on the second hit. You think you can stand up to Joshua's judgment? We exactly kill the Myrmidon with our Silver Lance. We wouldn't be able to block Talon Arts, it's true. Okay, Killing Edge. I think the house gives us a void, so we can just camp in the house. Oof. Kaga's 74 years old. I don't think he cares if you use save states on a game he didn't help make. You don't even- you don't, you don't know that for sure. Don't tell Kaga. Okay, this time, we know that this guy just gets killed, right? He didn't get killed! My killing edge uses- oh, we get more XP though. Maybe equip another weapon instead of the Axe Reaver? Well, I mean, it's very easy to avoid dying here. We just canto not to there. <laughs> I don't like sand. It's coarse and it's rough. And it gets a Can you really blame me? Does that look like a tile you can stand on? Come on. That's not my fault. That's not my fault. That's not my fault, okay? We're fine. We're fine. Hey, maybe we'll kill this guy this time. Do we even need to attack this guy? Let's just wait. What are they gonna do? Okay, we javelin this guy? Look at that. Double attack him with our iron sword? Ouch. And then we get him with fire. We're definitely fine this time. This time for sure. Look at all that XP. Riveting? I'm glad you agree. It is riveting. First try, too. Building those supports. Joshua's definitely feeling sick, so we need to heal him. Wish we had a men's staff, our magic sucks. Look at that, that's so sad. You know what, let's, re let's reeve this guy. That's one star tactics. I don't know why I equipped a Lance Reaver. <laughs> that was a mistake. I'm so flustered. Two dollar microtransaction from silver. If all else fails, use fire. We do have fire tomes. Mm. Microtransaction. God, you think there's enough enemies? Attention! Mincino's men, mercenaries, will arrest the Princess of Renee shortly. Our duty here is nearly ended, and I expect no further hostilities. If you must fight, however, remember that the whole Empire fights with you. Uh, Commander? 
What should I do? Who are you? Sir, I'm awful, sir. <laughs> I'm new! I was only assigned to your command today! I wanted to fight for the Empire! I don't need your life story, fool! Recruits are in front! Grab a lance and move out! Yes, sir, yes, sir! This lance stabbed the enemy! I'm not afraid! I'm a citizen of Grotto! It's my duty to fight! And I'll fight my best! Okay, so I guess her official name is Amelia the Awful, right? Hey, and he drops it. That's nice. My, oh my, it's about time they left. I'm finally done getting ordered about without getting paid! Huh? Don't, don't mind me, I'm just talking to myself. Here, I want you to hold on to this for me. Don't tell Kaka. Oh, don't say a word about seeing me to Lady... Labrachelle, alright? Deal? Oh, you got a deal, I won't say anything. Thanks. All right, we're getting out of here, Seth. We're safe, right? Okay. We're, it's all right. The issue is these guys are coming for us. Okay, I know what we're doing, I know what we're doing. Very unfortunate I can't actually... Well, I can heal with Natasha, but it's not... Optimal, I guess. It's fine. Joshua... There... I can go here and heal? It's at least an action from her. On the forest. Equip the killing edge. Pocket dimension vulnerary. Iron Lance. Even if that guy doubles, it's not the end of the world. They're after us. Okay, that's good. 33% chance to kill them. You think you can stand up to Erina, the Eliminator? Wow. Erica's bad, but Erina's pretty good. These guys are coming for us. I'm kind of scared. Think there's enough enemies on this map? Oh, the magic. The magic! Oh! That's bad. Really scared here. <laughs> really scared. Seth, we need you. Okay, can we go there without dying? This guy's got a. Ha this guy does have a hand axe. We go here. We definitely die, right? We have the axe reaver. Good thing we have the axe reaver. I think with the axe reaver, they have to hit us with both hand axe hits. That's not gonna happen. So we have to survive this mess here. Do we just back up? Do we abandon the forest and just back up and then have Seth save us? This is a route map. I can see why people don't like this game. If you play this route first. Don't tell Kaga. What do we do here? We can reave that guy, but then we get attacked by that, so reaving him is a bad idea. I really want to kill this guy. Can Kyle do it? Almost certainly not, right? Nope. If we, if we kill this guy, that's really good. And we still have 20 HP. 
Kill him on the first- You think you can stand up to Joshua of Gehenna? That's really good. Okay, now that that guy got killed, that's a huge help. We die exactly, right? Uh, now I think we can heal. I don't think Natasha's in that much danger. Only the Lodger can reach her, and I don't think the Lodger can one-shot her. So I think that's fine. What's also fine is... Although we are low on in-game money, we did receive... A $500 microtransaction from... Pratical. Will we get an FE6 research run at some point to my favorite FE wishing all the blessed level ups? We used all of our blessings on Lab Rochelle. We're probably not gonna... If we do play FE6, it's probably not gonna be like this. It'll pro... Maybe it'll be an, an Iron Man. It'll be a Tin Man. Where... If Roy dies, the game isn't over, but... Someone else will probably have to die. But I don't think we're gonna, like, redo a tier list for FE6. We already did that. This mercenary can reach that spot. Thirty-six percent chance. Will Erina earn her paycheck? If you dodge, that also works. It's a disaster. It's a disaster. I can't reach, right? No. So we just have to kill this Lulger. I think we can attack from there. And Archer can attack from here. And then Ford can just... Or Kyle can block them off. And I think he's okay. Wow. Well, I didn't expect that. We have six attack speed. So that means this guy has two attack speed. <laughs> Lol. Be gone. Can we just kill this guy with Kyle? I think we're doing okay. Next turn, Seth is back, so we're gonna we're gonna be okay. Nobody dies in one round to this guy. Let's actually just do this. Let's actually do Iron Sword. I don't want to get hit by the axe, dude. Are we in a time paradox? We haven't redone- Why are you attacking me? Killed? Not killed. Archer may kill someone? I don't think the archer can reach anyone. Good thing we equipped the iron sword. We definitely double this guy, right? God, yes, there we go. Looking like a loot kill. Six damage. We could die. Now we can no longer die. Okay. I think the worst is behind us. Our, our Seth solo mission, you can ignore Vanessa. 
did succeed. We got both villages. And now we can regroup here at the start and begin pushing forward. First try. Don't tell Kaga. Okay, next step is to drop Seth in a position where we don't die. Okay, remember that Natasha's in range. I think we can... Okay, well this archer is here. This is kind of scary. If we drop Seth there, we're stuck there, so we'd have to kill the archer. Which we definitely can do, right? Let's do that later. <laughs> okay, these guys are weak. This guy's at full health. And he has a hand axe, so he definitely has to die. Natasha in this forest. Can I be targeted by this guy? So let's actually do that. The healing is so bad. Okay. He dies even without a crit. Yeah, so we have we have to kill him here. Killing him just saves the durability. Also, oh, we all, we get we get one shot. This guy doesn't though. Killed? Not killed. Dodged? Okay, that's fine. Well, killing him on that one doesn't do anything. Apologize with a good level. Apology not accepted. Your magic shall not save you. It's fine. The final boss is a mage. And his last level up was good. He's, he's mocking us. Five res. Is this just me, or are we getting a lot of HP and res levels? It happens a lot. Oh, we can box in the archer. You're right. And we don't have to worry about him. 11 damage. Please don't miss. Curse of Kaga. Can we one-shot this guy with lightning? We cannot. Lightning sucks. Please don't miss. I think we're still okay. We just attack from here. Iron Sword does work. It is a it is guaranteed. Good job, Erina. Now the guy's not boxed in. He doesn't one-shot anyone, right? There's no way, right? He's an archer. He has nine speed, he has an iron bow. I think we're okay. level. Well, he's better than Ford, right? Are we sure? Your magic shall not save you. At least we got resistance. Okay, let's just make sure that Vanessa doesn't get shot. That's what we're concerned about. This guy could also shoot us. Here is safe, right? Well, it's safe from the archer, which is what we care about. And we have the Axe Reaver. Really glad. If we didn't trade over the Axe Reaver, I don't think we could have done this.
Okay. We're finally all here. I think we're all right. I can't access the Discord. It won't let you in. Did you agree to the rules? You have to react to the uh, don't tell Kaga by the way. You have to you have to react to the rules with the Charizard emoji. Okay. This guy's got to die, right? You agree to everything and it still won't let you in? It should. Did you try to join previously? Because if you did, I might have banned you. I, I don't know your name. Okay, if we reeve this guy, surely we double him, right? We don't. Loot doesn't either. Just found the channel? Okay. Okay, doubling this guy. Can Agent Ash handle it? It didn't let you in either? But we do get new users, right? So some people are able to join. Maybe it's a Discord error, I'm sorry. Are, are you able to handle it, uh, Ash? If you can give him the certified fresh role, that's what you need to be able to talk. Okay, this is guaranteed. Guaranteed Vanessa kill. Can we- You think you can stand up to Vanessa the Vanquisher? I believe we can escape base speed Vanessa. We have like a 60% growth. I believe. Are you kidding me? This is what I get. Kaga's curse. Level 8 Vanessa with base speed was not on my cursed unit bingo board. Erica doubles this guy. I should enter the lottery? Ah. Uh, apparently trying to join the Discord is like a lottery. Well, Vanessa's losing, but we're, we're kinda winning. Thanks to the real gold sleazy for 10 uh, gifted memberships. Thank you for the 10 hit pin messel. It, it does lighten these dark times. <laughs> hey, loot can get a good level, right? Loot has 65% magic growth, so we're not concerned about her magic overall. We mostly want her speed, and her speed growth is bad, but speed would be nice. Well, it would be nice. It's fine, we'll get speed next level. You've got to sleep. I won't burn you. Good luck. A Natasha level? We don't care about her level ups at all, so whatever. Sure. Oh wow, a cleric. What strat- what stat did we get? Your magic shall not save you. What's Leon gonna do? I guess we could be attacked by a hand axe guy, but that's fine. And we'll just back up. Building supports! Natasha the Irresistible? Yes. Look at this! This is Jagan Gaming! And we don't double him so that we can feed the kill to our other units. Thanks! 
pirates with their amphibious assault. This is a lot of enemies. This is a lot of enemies. There's no way we deal 16 damage, right? Hellfire? It's pretty good. The issue is that we... This, is this guy have a head axe? He does not? Okay. Well, I mean, we could miss. That'd be pretty bad. It's not like the end of the world. Okay, good. Hellfire. Good thing we got that magic level, right? Erica is at full health. Not, and we, we do support Seth. It's a little risky. I think we'll be okay. Javelin? Javelin and then... Ironsword? Okay, we missed it. That's fine. I mean, this way we actually don't suffer from success. Because we can't even kill him. So that's actually good. And Josh was really fast. We are walling. And Vanessa can chuck javelins. I need to rescue drop loot back? No, I'm just, we're just gonna wall. As long as we don't suffer from success, we'll be okay. Let's have Natasha... Oh. I probably should've healed Kyle. He has a vulnerary, right? Whatever. It's not like vulnerabilities are worth anything. He just do that. The Canto. Aaron are being used to choke the point is bizarre. I mean, we're against this axe user, right? Choked. Twelve damage with the steel sword. Twelve damage. You think you can stand up to Joshua of Gehenna? That's bad. I don't think we can suffer from success, though, because that pirate attacks us. We don't care about that. Okay, this guy's just throwing his life away. Myrmidon activities. It's fine as long as that... Okay. Ouch. Well, I mean, I would like to give these Lolgers to other characters, but I don't want to deal with lances, so this is actually fine. <laughs> My XP! That's also fine. Oh, okay, we're actually getting kind of hurt. We do double him. Oh, he's, he's looking juicy. We do have an elixir on Seth as well. We, uh, are we sure this guy's six stars? That sniper can't reach us, can he? Six stars. Six stars, no problem. Alright, so will Elixir last in case we have to move this uh, wall up? Which I think we do. Javelin? That's a bad hit rate. Let's just use magic. Loot the legend? Can I have speed, please? What's she been reading on Reddit? What's she been reading on Reddit? She says she's a prodigy. She's, she's showing us she's, she's serious. Too slow! 
Loot the lucky. Loot the learned. That's good. Don't tell Kaga. Your reddit gold, loot. Thanks for the gold, kind stranger. Arena. Okay, well, we're kind of worried about this guy. That sniper is very scary. I want to kill that guy. We do kill him with a javelin, right? Yeah. Just elixir. It's just elixir. <laughs> this is too many enemies. Let's just wait for the enemies to come to us. Everyone is currently quite safe. Arena against this Lolger. Loot can get hand axed, but she doesn't die in one hit. 19 attack. Yeah, and we, we have a massive three defense, so we tank easy. This guy shoots us. Oh, we do kill him. We might suffer from success. The nice thing about loot having three con is that Arthur can rescue her. We do that. Oh no, we're fine, we're fine. Now we're fine. Wow, what a t what a strategy. There's so many enemies. We're still in the starting area. This is fine. This is not fine. Is it fine? Can I have strength? Oh, it's fine! Whoa! Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Now we just have to not die. Which I think is very possible. The nice thing about Erica being so weak is that she can't- Oh! Joshua of Johanna. The nice thing about Erica being so weak is that she can't suffer from success. Because <laughs> she doesn't succeed. Got Beishi bad to the Discord? Thank you! Can't add Jeremy Ross right now since they went to bed. They're just making it tense for us. We have the javelin. Okay, this is good. We're scared of this guy. Lucky dodge? Do we double? We don't double. But we do get a level up. Seth level up. Seth level up. Seth is the bat. Seth, level up! Look at this guy! What a monster! Actually huge. This is our last stand. Seth got all the good stats. Your magic shall not see. He even got resistance because we know that he's the best unit. He's gonna have to fight the Demon King! Can't add Jeremy Rosser now because they went to bed. We'll, we'll get him next time. Save us, Seth. Don't tell Kaga. This map is it's really hard, but we also sent a lot of our... We have some issues. So one big issue is that our Erica is horrend... Or our Erica's okay. Our Vanessa's horrendous. want to kill this guy. Kill this Lolger, right? This guy's really scary. He's 
off speed. We have to, there's no way we can double him. We could kill him? Erica getting smacked was really bad. Like, Natasha doesn't heal enough. I say as I heal her with Natasha. Loot can kill this guy. And then we can move Erica up one. She's okay against all of these non... One thing we could do is... This health is so sketchy. This health is so sketchy. We attack this guy. We can reliably kill him with the killing edge. And then... Seth Silverlance? Or Seth with the killer edge. And then Arthur, and I think that guy dies. That's one of our possible courses of action. We can also just sit here and heal Erica. We might just do that. I don't think moving Erica up is any more dangerous. How dangerous the enemy Amelia is? She's awful in the name. How much damage does the this guy do? He has 28 attack. We have 7 defense. We're okay. So we die in 2 shots, but... I think we just stay here. I think loot does get one shot. So loot can't stay there. Rescued. Do we initiate an attack on this guy? No. Do we try and kill- I mean, we can just kill this guy. Does that actually do anything, though? I think we kind of want him there because he's blocking a spot. Like, this is fine. What's this guy gonna do? Hello? How are we so unlucky? Well, I, I, there, there's her answer. I guess his luck finally ran out. What was that? We got hit by three, like, true hit? Like, 15% or so axe attacks. What in the world? Joshua the Jukes. Don't tell Kaga. We're back. What was that? Okay, let's do this. New plan. We're gonna javelin this guy. can heal him. Let's get rid of this archer. Good thing we bought these killing edges. So that we can not crit. use an elixir on Erica. <laughs> okay, this time we're fine, right? And then... Let's do 
dude. There's fire on this guy. Move Erica back? I'm not worried about Erica. I wasn't worried about Joshua either. This is why dodge tanking doesn't work, by the way. The ocean seal. team is truly the scrub squad and Seth. Send in Kyle. He gets like doubled by all these. Uh oh, it's awful. 10 damage from awful. You think you could stand up to Joshua of Jehenna? Well, awful's gone. Is it the Dawn Brigade? Well, this is fine. Okay. You think you could stand up to Joshua of Jehenna? We're, we're only scared of the... The sniper. The sniper hitting us is very bad. Wow, they hate this guy. You think you can stand up to Joshua of Jehan- Are killed! <laughs> if we get a good level, that means we're gonna get shot by the sniper. Okay, that means we survive the turn. I don't think any of our units could die at this point. I don't think we died with a sniper shot from there. I think it's close though. Yep, of course. I told you. Because we got a terrible level up, we didn't die. That's the price of progress. <laughs> Don't tell Kaga. Oh, vengeance. Just have to crit him once. Vengeance? You think you can stand up to Joshua of Gehenna? Well, that's a major threat out of the way. Cool. Maybe we can finally start advancing. Kyle, do something! You don't even double him! Ouch! Ugh. Okay. Eren of the Elite? We actually get the support here. I'm kind of scared of these mages. Yeah, we're just gonna silver lance this guy. I. We're not playing around. I don't want to deal with him. He's gone. There's no way we double this guy, right? No. I don't even know why I'm bothering to check this. I mean, we could crit them. That would be nice. We just need to make sure nobody here dies. We have the sword equipped. The only one who can hit this guy is the mage. Oh, he has oh he has L fire though. L fire is big. L fire is big. Kind of worried here. How much does Elfire do? 21 attack. 21 attack, and we have 
five res. That's a lot. How much res does this guy have? We have only two res. Very scary. Joshua of Gehenna. Might have to redo this. Well, that's fine. You think you can stand up to Joshua of Gehenna? Hey, maybe we'll get a res growth. Maybe we'll get nothing. Which means we're gonna dodge Alfire, right? I don't even think the mage can reach us. Now, please kill me. Kill me. So I can redo this. They're mocking me! Looks like my luck's finally run out, eh? It's fine, okay? We're probably gonna cap speed within tier 1. That's not what I'm concerned about. 11 strength at level 13? It's really not that bad. It's really not that bad. Ho ho ho! It's beginning to look a lot like Lindis. Ho oh, ho oh, horrible! <laughs> but I can't deny that these level ups have me worried. Okay, well now we should be fine. I don't want to kill that guy. Softening up this archer is good. You think you could stand up to Arena the Elite? Okay, well, I guess we'll take that kill. Let's just slice and dice this guy. Do we even survive after a heal? Our magic is so bad. Who gave her a staff license? When he dodges, does his sword bend? It looks a little silly. The Hellfire! Hey, we can give that to <laughs> Loot. Here you go, Loot. You don't die, right? She doesn't kill. She gets doubled by the... But they have to both hit, right? Just in case. Okay, loot. Loot the learned. How how fast are we? Oh! Oh! Are we sure that we're giving our Excalibur tome to the lab woman? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. She's a prodigy. She's going to tell us about it right now. Hmm. I wonder if Oh, I see. What are you doing, Loot? Oh! I was just observing this... Kamita beetle! You haven't changed at all, have you, Loot? What do you mean? You spent most of your time sequest... Do fighters know what sequestered means? Sequestered in your room, studying your books. Oh, Loot. Always lost in your books. On the rare occasion you went outside, you were paralyzed with fascination. Of course. There are so many fascinating things to be learned from nature. There are a great many books out there, and I have read most of them, of course. But I found that what is written can differ greatly from how things truly are. Take this Kamita Beetle, for example. 
I've been reading from the glossary of Philibrian entomology lately. According to the glossary, their wings fall off once they reach maturity. However, I have just found an adult beetle whose wings still work perfectly. Exceptions do exist to the rules my books outline. This is a rare specimen. I wonder, should we take it back with us? I hope this isn't another one of your pranks. My prank. You remember when I loaned you my copy of Lux Eterna? You replaced my bookmark with the tail of a sedgel lizard. You scared ten years off my life, I swear it. Did I do that? And, knowing full well that I have a mild fear of... Spiders. <laughs> Please don't scare Arter with audio emotes. No! He said he's scared of them. You got a small army of them and unleashed them in the chat. I thought that if I immersed you in the thing you feared, maybe you might be able to overcome your fear entirely. And I went to a lot of trouble trying to catch those spiders. <laughs> you don't know the catch rate on audios. Why would you do that? Well, I did get a bit of kick out of the experience myself. Why? Did it bother you? Yes! Oh, don't worry about it. At least you did it because you cared about me, right? I'll just accept it as the best gesture of kindness you can manage, loot. Speed wings for Ariados? Ever red flowers for Algernon? How about speed wings for Audios? <laughs> Are we feeling speed wings on loot? Who else is gonna use it? Vanessa! <laughs> you can't fix audios. Well, she's holding the speed wings. <laughs> Vanessa has 60% growth. You'll be fine. That's what I thought. Does this look fine to you? That was brutal. Nine speed. Hmm. Raises speed. As befitting a prodigy, right? Still 11 speed! 11 speed 3 con, weighed down by fire. You know who has 11 speed and terrible con? Uh oh. Alright, we're going shopping. We don't have any money. Alright, well, I don't know what, what I was thinking with this. We could go to the arena. I don't even know if we can get a level with Vanessa. She's so bad. Karen, dude, remember for 12 months. Or 11 months, thank you. Oh, it's an armory. Well, I don't think we- well, let's just see what's there. No window shopping! That's fine, we're, we're not missing anything. Okay, who are we- we gotta get Vanessa levels, okay? We gotta get Vanessa levels. We're 
We're just gonna be moving south. Vanessa's minus four on speed, but plus one in strength. I'd rather be plus zero in both. I guess we can heal Joshua. Definitely want to build up the Erica and Seth support, so we're going to need those. I guess Joshua, Natasha, I mean Natasha's going to be fielded for a long time because we need healing. Stand on the sand. All right, just get, get on the horse. You're way too slow. Oh, we can sell the ocean seal. That's true. Yeah, we're never going to use that. Are we going to promote coal? Whoa. Okay, we need to weaken those axe fighters, and then Vanessa can get a kill with the beloved axe reaver. We can have someone reach there, right? There's no way Joshua kills, right? There's no way. We actually can't reach there, never mind. Kyle can reach there. The iron sword? There's no way he doubles, right? This is a iron axe, yeah, we're fine. Okay, that guy does have a hand axe, but he can't reach Natasha, which is all we care about. Okay, we could have prodigy level magic coming up. Hello, geez, I finally made it. How's it going so far? They ask you how it's going. You have to say you're fine, but it's not fine. We got another level with no speed on Vanessa. Level 8 base level. I would recommend going back and watching... At the end of the last chapter, the final one for Ephraim Root, we hold up in the throne room... And we barriered up Lab Rochelle to level 20. And that's where all our luck went. I'd recommend watching that. It's riveting gameplay. No spoilers in the chat. It's definitely riveting gameplay. It went pretty well. <laughs> you could say that. Okay, this is fine. I guess we'll forego gaining supports for it to... It's fine. Okay. Our mission is to get Vanessa kills. Man, that hit rate's pretty good. When the stream ends, you'll return and watch it. Dude, this Kyle guy, I'm not so sure. Okay, the enemies did not move. That's actually really good. I think get... Joshua doubling this guy might actually kill him, right? He's too good. He's too good. Good thing that this guy is not too good. We deal 12. They have 11 left. Can we deal 11 with the Axe Reaver? We can. We do get doubled, but that's fine. We get chopped. We don't get chopped. That's good. Reaved? This is guaranteed. Lots of XP. Perfect! We can give the kill to someone else. Okay, loot. Rescued. Just pick up that other guy's horse. No problem. 
And we're even supported. Okay, that's a little scary. We no longer die. But if we miss, that's a huge problem, right? Somebody's gonna die. Well, we have true hit, right? We have true hit. Is Joshua gonna get stabbed? Is this guy vagina? No. These guys only have one range, so I think we can just do this. But now I can't. Oh, I can. Look at this luring. Look at this luring. And we can heal. Great. It's your lucky day. Base speed Vanessa at level A is a 0.1 chance. Don't worry, okay? Our lucky day is coming up. It's coming up. Let's get Erica down here. Lady Luck's about to smile on us. Reeved? That's a lot of damage. We definitely double him, right? Yeah. Perfect. Juicy, juicy Vanessa kill right there. The other one gonna move? The other one is not. So juicy. I don't think this is a level, but it's coming up. We don't get XP. Be oh, and actually, hey, that's perfect. Wow, that'll be useful. This guy just has an Iron Lance. Oh, Natasha level? Yeah, it's, 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 it's about what I expected. Sure, it's not like her stats matter. So what's the use of getting upset? If she just sucks up all the bad luck, we'll be fine. Wait. Feeling sick? Yeah. They chose not to attack Vanessa. They recognize she's the threat. Do we double this guy? XP thief. Ten magic. I mean, we have good res, right? I don't think we double them with the Javelin, but I doubt we get doubled, right? There's no way. I should check. Seven speed. So we'd have to go down to three. And we lose six, so we're okay. More great healing from our favorite cleric, Natasha. Erica and Seth supports? Seth in the front? Totally carried by Seth this map, of course. I miss Lavarachelle, me too. We'll see her again next week. Alright. damage. 11 damage with a good hit rate. Ouch. Good thing we checked. Okay, and we can use the more accurate. This healing is so sad. Hey, at least we actually maxed out Vanessa's 18 health. Speed level? I think we do get a level from this, right? We do. Here's our speed level. It's been so long. It's been so long. Uh, uh. It's 5.5.
fine, guys. It's fine. We'll get speed next level. We didn't say that the level before that. Or the level before that. Or the level before that. Or the level before that. Level 9 Pegasus Knight with base speed. Did you guys know that low con and high speed is better than low speed and high con? It's true. You might not believe it, but it's true. It's a disaster. It's a disaster. Are we get in range of any of these guys? We can get in range of at least one, right? You know that Seth doesn't double, so... Iron Lance? Isn't the strength pretty bad, too? Everything is bad. I think we were plus one for strength. But I don't think so anymore. This is an unmitigated disaster. At least Bartra was really strong. We might have to put Vanessa out of her misery. I think we can kill this guy with our Iron Lance, though. Okay, that's good. Don't tell Kaga. Okay, if we put Vanessa here... Oh, there's an archer, right? We can't do that anyway. So we'd have to rescue her, but that's fine. We do get an exact kill. Now, of course, we do get doubled by this mercenary using a steel sword, but that's fine. Don't worry about that part. Can we take that? Wow, we actually, we actually can. She's so small. It, for some reason, doesn't count the size of her horse, which I think is really weird. Gonna drop a Pegasus on this wall. <laughs> Why wow, that guy's so strong? I wanna lure the archers, but I think that Seth doubles and kills them, which is not good. Loot can get attacked by both if she goes there, and she doesn't survive both. I guess no counter no counter Seth is maybe what we want to do. Stuff we gotta do for our base speed Vanessa. Five stars, by the way. 1999 macro transaction from Prometheus. We need Thank you more for the macro gold. transaction in these trying times. That is a 0 0.06 chance you are officially less lucky than Bartra. <laughs> or more lucky, depending on how you look at it. Also, please destroy all mobile phones. You have to type this on mobile, and the autocorrect is god awful. Whatever you say, man. I'm in a vulnerable state, okay? I agree with your suggestion. I don't know if it's related to Vanessa having no speed, but I'll take any excuse I can. Ready to work. Try that again. Ready to work. I sacrifice five Patreons. And I cast. The Wrath of Arceus. Destroy all video games wherever they are. Destroy mobile games twice. Maybe. Once each and every mobile device has been scoured from this earth, we can finally type messages correctly and maybe hit a speed growth on our Pegasus Knight. Maybe. I have my doubts though. Anyone need healing? Seth does be too far away. It's a disaster. It's a disaster. That's fun. Okay, baited. Did you see that? How much damage did that guy do?
Break yourselves upon my body! Looks like we're fine. Only seven enemies left. There's no way we double this guy, right? Of course not. So we have to deal at least 18 damage. That works, right? Ah, oh, Aaron of the Elite Mercenary, feeding kills to our lowly Pegasus Knights. Wish I had my Slim Lance. Okay, so whoever goes here can actually be attacked. I think we're okay. Seth definitely doubles, right? Yeah. Does Joshua kill? He doesn't. Okay, good. Oh, but then he gets attacked by the mercenary. Well, that's why he's not going to die to one mercenary. Maybe I should have thought of that before I moved him, though. Oh, the mercenary can also reach this spot. But loot's not gonna be on that spot. Yeah, if she misses, that's a real problem. But we, we have ways around that problem. And there's no problem. Loot the learned? Speed? Loot the languid. That's fine. We'll get speed next level. 65% magic growth. We got a good stat. It's better than HP. Loot the lagging. Where's her tail? I think we just... Wait. We Can we heal Seth? Yes. And nobody does. At least she's as fast as a Pegasus Knight. Hey, these are manipulated results, okay? We gave her a speed wing. Joshua definitely doubles this goober, right? Ouch. I think we can hit him with light and then a lance. Maybe even fire. Okay, wow. The prodigy. Are we in range of the archer? We are, but I think that's okay. We have nine speed. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Just in case. Okay. My iron lights. All right. Uh, guaranteed kill. We don't even get doubled by this guy. Are we really that slow? Coming up. So this guy shoots us. And then we get him with... Vanessa. You coward! Why don't you attack me? Okay. Maybe they're tied to the boss. What if I wait in ambush in the forest? Actually does attack us. I think we can deal 12 with like the killer lance. Okay, those archers definitely don't move. Otherwise they would have moved there, right? That is a kill. die if we miss. We die if we miss. We didn't miss, though. Are we finally free? I've suffered long enough. Have mercy. Have mercy! Why are we here? Just to suffer? Level 10. 
Level 10. Let's hear it for level 10 with no speed. Possessed by the spirit of Bartra, he was housed within the Darkstone, and Leon unleashed him. Now all of Magvel is destined to live in space speed hell. I don't trust this. I, I don't... I don't trust anything. Vanessa gets the speed wing, right? We already used it on loot. Bartra needs to lend her the wheelchair. Are we sure she's on a Pegasus? Okay, time for expert strategies. It'd be funny if the ROM hack somehow broke her speed growth. I don't think that's it. I really don't think these guys move. So we're gonna be doing sick rescue drops, okay? That's our plan here. We can leave these guys here so they can build support. Vanessa is so small that Arthur can... I think Arthur can carry her. Yeah, because he has six con. So just need Arthur, like, here, I guess. There is no hope for Vanessa. It's looking extremely grim. Alright, time for hit and run tactics. Getting 10 XP each time. Can't believe we gotta do this. And we'll get him next turn. And we're building supports the entire time. I guess Joshua and Natasha? That's like canon, right? Can't even double Steel Bow Archer. Maybe if we had our trusty Slim Lance. out of there. And the cycle begins anew. She would need to hit every speed level until 20 to be average? Hey, her hitting every speed level on the way to 20 is more likely than her missing every speed level so far. So I believe it can happen. Okay, we'll get a level from the other archer. Nero. And the cycle begins anew. Exciting map, by the way, right? <laughs> What are your thoughts on GBA Myrmidons dabbing before they attack? I don't know what that means. Alright, take. Drop. And the cycle begins anew. Wait, that's not right. <laughs> okay. I don't think we get a- we- we do get a level if we kill them. If that's not- okay, rescue. Take. Drop, and the cycle begins anew. Again. 
We are getting some supports, though. How's this one? Hey, we got it! Killer Lance is a kill. Iron Lance is not. I guess we'll just get the kill one turn earlier, right? Hashtag pray for Vanessa. It's because it's because I don't believe that she can grow speed. It's my fault. So if I believe that she can, then she will. I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe. Ah, yes! We're free! And the victorious music starts. You're too slow! Wild speed. Of course, our stats are absolute garbage, but hey, we no longer have base speed at level 11. Small victories. Now we're only minus 4 speed. Take... Drop. And the cycle begins anew. Binks has the Steel Axe, which means that we want to get him to shoot someone first. We'll just get him to shoot Seth. I've reached new lows today, be proud. Should I be proud? I feel more like this guy. Bombs? You want it? It's yours, my friend. Blast! This ain't right. These guys are too tough. 5,000 gold ain't nearly enough for this. That's a lot of damage. Hey, he missed. Hey, we deal two damage. It's a lot of XP. That's a lot of XP. Mm. I've got a microtransaction from Blue Crimson 217. Good thing we have Cormag coming up. Wait, what's that? Cormag only shows up at near the end of Erica Root? I think it's chapter 13 in this. So. It's not looking good. Vanessa's our only flyer for a very long time. Cormag's obviously much better. He's better in the base game too, but uh... This is gonna take a while. At least the boss doesn't heal. I know what we need in situations like this. Hey. Hey! Pay attention to the gameplay, it's on screen, okay? Well, Seth can just leave. Rescue. Take. Drop. And the cycle begins anew. Thanks for the good times this weekend. Thanks! What's the stream idea? Alright, Binks, take this! This is real sad. This is real sad. I don't think we're gonna do this. We'll get one more level, okay? We'll go until our next speed level. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. Rescue. Take, drop, 
the cycle begins anew. Oh, you meant the stream we're currently doing? Did we have a special idea for this stream? It's just a Fire Emblem playthrough, right? Unfortunately, it's extremely cursed, but that's not part of the plan. <laughs> Rescue. Take. Drop. And the cycle begins anew. Just give me another speed level, please. Two more turns of this, I think. Take. Drop. And the cycle begins anew. Two more levels of this. Yep, we'll get a next level. Rescue. A take. Draw. And the cycle begins anew. Save state just in case of a mistake. Who do you think I am? I'm the greatest tactician in Magval, okay? I don't need save states. I've never used a single one. And here's my speed level up in recognition of my prowess. My prowess! <laughs> Fine, okay, we'll get speed next level. It's fine, we'll get speed next level. We did get strength, that's good. Five dollar microtransaction from Blue Crimson 217. Thank you for the microtransaction. Mm. That whoosh between turns is your tactics ranking going down the toilet? Look, man. This, these are lunatic tactics, okay? Lunatic tactics, they're better. If we do this, we have less of a chance of messing up. Because we can't accidentally rescue loot, I don't think. Oh no, we still can, never mind, that didn't do anything. Well, we're going till we get our next speed level. It's coming up, don't worry. Oh, now we deal three damage to this guy. It's not that bad. That's only like seven more of these. You guys ever played RuneScape? This is nothing. This is nothing. Have we recruited, have we even recruited the guy in the thumbnail yet? We might not reach him today. He'll be here tomorrow. He'll be here next time. The cycle begins in there. Maybe Tower of Volney is better than this. You think you can stand up to Vanessa the Vanquisher? We, we might actually kill him. He's just standing there. I guess warriors aren't that smart. Take. Drop. And the cycle begins anew. Just like farming for a defender at the Warriors Guild? That only took me like... Five hours. Okay, let's- let's break up the monotony a little bit. We don't need to be stimulated during this conversation, right? I don't think so. I need support. <laughs> Great support conversation. Ha! Ah! What do you think? Your sword arm is magnificent, my lady. I do believe you have achieved average strength. You've improved yet again. Thank you. It's only because I know my brother will scold me if I do not practice every day. But I still am nowhere near your level of skill, Seth. True? My lady, I hardly think. Perhaps next time, you could spar with me and help me learn some technique? The basics I've learned from my brother all apply to skills with the spear. If I could learn the sword techniques of the Knights of Rene, perhaps from someone with A-rank swords, then perhaps I could be even stronger. I would be of greater help to you on the battlefield. Yes, but Princess Erica, I think you should stay away from the front lines. This guy knows his tactics. 
You're of the royal family of Renee. Please leave the fighting to me. Still, how can I just watch from afar while others risk their lives for me? I cannot rely on you always. I must learn to protect myself. So please, continue to observe as I practice. Princess Erica. I guess he's observing. He's just standing there. Observing. Oh, back to the actual gameplay. Oh. Friendship forged, I guess. Well, back to the actual gameplay. A hey, 91 hit rate's pretty good. Joshua support's probably ready. Oh, our weapon level increased. Perfect. Rescue. Is this even boss abuse? It's not like he's healing. We just don't do any damage. This is a very legitimate boss kill. RuneScape players love this level of play. We're actually just gonna kill the boss. He only dies in a couple more turns. Let's just kill the boss. Good thing we got that strength level. Legitimate. Excuse me. What are those quotations about as the cycle begins anew? This is very legitimate. We're facing him in one-on-one -on -one combat. I ignore all the rest of our army. The only one who has engaged him in combat is Vanessa and Seth, just to get him to equip the bow. I guarantee you, somebody playing this game for the first time would not be able to implement these high-level tactics that we're performing right now. It's my deep knowledge of Fire Emblem mechanics that allows me to take advantageous encounters like this. Think a noob could do this? I think not. Take. Draw. And the cycle begins anew. I think we get a level here? Can we get a second speed level? I actually don't need strength. Nobody has ever said this about Vanessa. I just need speed. Fine, we'll get speed next level. I, like, I can't, I can't even play this graphic. Ho, ho, ho! It's beginning to look a lot like Lindis. Oh, oh, horrible! <laughs> it, it's not, it's not even looking like Lindis. Because Lin actually is fast. I think, I think it's over. I think we just bench her. This is, we can't recover from this. The cycle begins anew. There's like several stages of grief, right? We're in denial. Maybe we've just passed denial. Make her a Falconite? You can't get me, bro. Are the levels purely RNG? They're RNG, but they're based on each character's hidden growth rates. So it's not purely RNG, certain characters have better chances of growing certain stance, stats. Vanessa's one of the fastest characters in the game. The fact that we have only gotten one level of speed since base is unbelievably bad. As the cycle begins anew. You can break the cycle by letting someone else get the kill? No, we can break the cycle by using a different weapon. If we recognize that hoarding is a pitfall, we'll be rewarded 
for our foresight. Bad move, by the way. And we'll be we'll get strength and speed. We'll get strength and speed, and we'll crit him. Okay, well we'll get strength and speed. That part can still come true. That stinking Pablo, he lied to me. He said Vanessa was five stars. Did Pablo lie? Is Vanessa five stars? I think Pablo lied to you, man. I wouldn't trust Pablo. <laughs> it's fine. We'll get speed next level, guys. <laughs> At least we got skill. <laughs> This is a disaster. This is the worst Vanessa I've ever seen. It's over. There's nothing we can do. She's a taxi. Your Highness, are you well? No. I'm definitely not. I'm feeling sick. I need someone to crit me on classic mode uh, in Minecraft. Yes, I believe so. Who are these men? They don't appear to be Grotto Imperial troops. Judging by their crude swordplay, I'd say they're mercenaries. We can expect more of them in the area too, I think. Wait here. W wait I give up! I don't want to fight anymore, we were just doing a job. Who hired you? I may be nothing but a hired blade, but I have my honor. I won't say a word. Wow, this guy's real noble. I admire your professionalism. I guess we have no use for you. No, wait! I'll talk! Mincino! It was Pablo of the Mincino Council of Elders. Councilman Pablo? That doesn't make any sense. Mincino and Freli are allies. Why would they target me? I don't know. Could be they've decided Grotto's going to win. They want to be on the winning side. Some of the others opposed Pablo, but I heard he'd had them all silenced but quick, and considering the low proc rate of silencer, his assassins must be great. That's all I know, I swear it. I trust you. Wow, great graphics for the Game Boy Advance. I believe you. Go. Look at that movement speed. He's out of there. Can we hire that guy? We were careless. We should have seen this coming. Mincino's a young and ambitious nation ruled by power-hungry merchants. And Grotto grows more powerful with every passing day. So it's no surprise Mincino's merchant lords would throw in with Grotto now. Wait. Prince Inez. Prince Inez was to pass through Mincino on his way to Gehenna. If Mincino has betrayed us, then he ran headlong to enemy her Headlong Rush? Well, I thought he was a sniper. Why is he using Headlong Rush? Maybe it's Thousand Arrows. Princess Erica, a generic Pegasus Knight. Vanessa, is that you? I bring dire tidings. We're not getting any speed level ups on Vanessa. I know you. You were a messenger riding with Prince Inez. Yes, and I have news of him. Prince Inez is in danger. Mincino's merchant army struck and cut through half our men. The prince is trapped in a siege. He has no means of escape and... No more! I understand. Return to Freli and deliver your message. What of Prince Inez? Leave him to us. The prince's troubles should burden you no more. We will see him to safety. Hey, you! Have Lady uh, Larchell and her man Sir Stubblechin gone yet? Aren't you? Yes, they no longer appear to be in the city. Woo! I'm finally free! And no more getting bossed around by that witless ninny. <laughs> Thanks! I owe you one. You take this. Now that I'm free again, I think I'm just gonna wander about for a while. What a strange relationship they have. Lady Erica, I think we ought to be leaving soon. Yes, we must hurry to Prince Inez's side. Hey, thanks. <laughs> What a nice guy. Are we sure he's two stars?
Revolt at Mincino. All right, last map for today. Oh boy. Renak the Rewarding. Well, we have an Angelic Robe. And we have a Draco Shield to use. Probably use those. This is ungodly. So who needs an angelic robe? Normally, I would use it on Vanessa. She's beyond help. It's over. She's not getting anything. Draco shield on Joshua? But the Joshua doesn't get hit. Angelic Robe on loot could mean that loot doesn't get one shot, which is very valuable. I think Angelic Robe on loot, Draco Shield on Seth. I think that's what we're gonna do. Or Kyle. Kyle could all Kyle could also really use the Draco Shield. That would help him a lot. But I don't want to feel like I have to use Kyle. I don't think Seth needs it. Shield on Kyle is double value since he gets doubled more often. Ironclad logic. Alright, sure. Uh, loot, I think, does get the... Loot does get the Angelic Robe because that helps her avoid getting one shot. Which might happen otherwise. Draco shield on Kyle. Sure. I right, pretend you didn't see that trade there. Loot, I hope you're doing well. I haven't forgotten that prank you pulled with the spiders, but... A rough-looking man gave me this rather regal-looking robe. I think it would suit you quite well. Now don't get a big head over this stuff, but I'll see you on the battlefield. Hmm. A robe like this quite suits a prodigy such as myself. I guess the guy who gave it to me isn't so isn't so bad either. Twenty-seven HP. Now we die in two hits, which is a very big upgrade from dying in one hit. I don't even think there's any dialogue for Kyle using this. Kyle is so boring. So what does he say when he uses a dragon shield? Nothing. Plus two defense. Do we have to change any items? I don't think so. Inventory is good on Erica. We have lightning tomes for days. Seth's fine. Loot's fine. Joshua's fine. I mean, Vanessa's inventory is fine. You can't buy heals in the next arena map? We do have two heals here. Oof. Mincino has betrayed Frelia and joined forces with Grotto. Oh. Gotta make sure to get the accurate portraits. Mincino's troops stopped Prince Inez, blocking his way to Gehenna. With soldiers occupying the road forward and back, he is trapped in a hopeless situation. 
Erica rushes to the prince's aid. Terrace Plateau. Is this Terrace Plateau? General Glenn of the Grotto Imperial Army, also known as the Sunstone. Yes. Your orders. Capture the leader of the rebel Ardi, Armin Mincino. Capture Erica. Erica? You mean the Princess of Rene? Erica invaded Mincino. She massacred the citizens of Port Kiris. Then she fled south. Glenn, go crush the rebels who brought ruin to Mincino. Understood, sire! Now, who's this guy? I guess this is also. This is also sibling silence. What did the Emperor say, brother? I've been ordered to kill the Princess of Rene. Poor Mag, I want you to remain here in the capital. I'll go alone. If that's what you want, brother, so be it. But you seem troubled. But tell me you're concerned about fighting the Princess of a ruined land. I was never able to slip anything past you, little brother. You're right. This duty falls heavily on my shoulders, more than any other. Tell me, brother, do you know this princess? Yes. When Renee and Grotto were still close, I met the girl. I met Erica only once. We spoke briefly, but I felt she was a woman of great kindness. I cannot bring myself to believe Princess Erica is evil. I cannot. However, rumors of Irina the mercenary and her brutality are widespread. Glenn, the Emperor has ordered... There's the rub, Cormac. That's it exactly. Rubbed! <laughs> People say we have too many graphics. Desktop, live red reaction, is it here? It actually is. Guess we can play that again. There's the rub, Cormag. That's it exactly. Rubbed. <laughs> we'll say we have too many graphics. His Majesty has never spoken a falsehood in all the time I've served him. And as a servant of the Empire, I am duty bound to obey his orders. I can see no reason to think Princess Erica's heart is any less gentle now. Who's this guy? What are these cowardly mutterings? Is it because you three generals are weak that we others must work so hard? And yet you get the honor of killing the girl. How I long to do your duty for you. Grr! Falter, you treacherous swine! What's this? Is this how you speak toward your peer knights of the realm? Lest you've forgotten, I too am a general, the same rank as you. You wretch! You were cast out from the army for mistreating civilians. What lies have you told to receive pardon and reinstatement at the same time? Our beloved Emperor felt my skills were needed, and his word is law. His Majesty has earned my sincerest and most undying gratitude. And then we have you three, Dusel, Selina, and you. The three of you have proven to be unreliable time and time again. We were brought in to plug the holes, don't you see? You ought to thank me, Glenn! Falter, if you dare insult my brother further! Come now, Cormag, and what would you do to me if I did? Would you fight me? Here? Would you show such disloyalty to the Emperor? Sibling silence. Peace, Cormag. We are His Majesty's men. We will honor his commands. Mark my words, Falter. Your crimes I neither forgotten nor forgiven. Hm. Oh, okay. Prince Ines, what do you say? Can you continue? Oh. So I don't know who this guy is. Gotta make sure we have the accurate portraits.
Yes, of course. Do you believe this is enough to make me give up? Oh. I guess we're not giving up, right? So it should be this. I'm surprised you, you mercenaries haven't turned and fled, though. Nah! You see, Garrick's Mercenaries takes its name from me, Garrick. I'm the chief here. If I quit while our employers still fought on, they'd want a new name, you follow me? So, what's the plan? Same as before. We remain surrounded. They're not gonna allow us simply to walk out of here. I sent a messenger off with news of our plight. However... Even on the wings of a Pegasus Knight, Frelia is days away. We can expect no help from them. Yeah, so we tighten our belts and survive, is that it? Or would you rather quit this place and uh, rest in comfort? Surrender. I'm the Prince of Frelia. I don't know the meaning of the word. Do princes know what surrender means? The fate of the world rides on my shoulders, and I'll make it to Jehenna. Even if I have to crawl there to do it. Now, that makes me feel better. If you're so determined, we may all live a little while longer. Uh, hey, Chief? Prince? Hey, what is it, Tethys? Uh, I've got bad news. And then I've got worse news. What's the bad news? We've no more weapons in reserve. What you're holding is what we've got. Once those are gone, there won't be much fight left in us. That is bad news. Well, what's the worst news? They've begun to move. They're going to attack again. Looks like they're sending up a whole lot of them this time. Sato silence. Right. You two. You're done here. Discharged. Fired. Whatever. You can surrender or flee. The choice is yours. And what a nice guy. What? I'm the one they're after. Throw down your weapons and you'll walk away alive. I don't need you here. You'll only be in my way. What a nice guy! Who knows? Okay, maybe not. <laughs> Who knows? You filthy cell swords will probably sell me out anyway. Hold on there. That's not true and you know it. Peace, Tethys. Peace, Cormag. Peace, Tethys. Hey, Prince, what are you gonna do? I'm going to get out of here on my own. I'll break to the south and escape into the mountains. That ain't gonna be easy. How do you plan on doing that? I'm not telling you. I have no idea when you'll decide to betray me. Go on. Get out of here. I'd rather do this alone. It sounds like you're trying to make sure you're the only one who dies. Sato silence. Fool. I have no intention of dying. But there can be no false hope of reinforcements riding in to save the day. You and I are not the same. You're a commoner. And I'm Frelly as This guy is insufferable. What? We of noble birth do not shirk the duties to which we are born. Did mercenaries know what shirk means? <laughs> That's commoner silence. What are you waiting for? You may go. Well played, my lord. <laughs> I've always loved the melodrama of martyrdom. <laughs> There's no way I can abandon you after that fine performance. <laughs> I'm staying with you to the end. Can we hire this guy? He's good. To the... What are you saying? You dare ignore the orders of the one who's paying your wages? Is this power harassment? <laughs> Screw the rules, I have money. Tethys, I want you to go and surrender. Give my regards to Ewan and Marissa. Don't be ridiculous, I'm not going anywhere. Now would the two of you kindly stop acting like such... men? And you, you've already fired us, you can't order us to leave now. You can't fire us, I quit. Unbelievable. And you people call yourselves mercenaries? I thought you fought for money, not for duty. 
Yeah, that's one of the rules. Guess we're lousy mercenaries, right? Now let's get thinking. We still need a plan to get us all out of here alive. You're supposed to be a good tactician, so I figure I won't die easily. Tell us what to do, Prince. We'll follow your orders. Hm. Very well. I'll see what I can do to avoid getting us filled with arrows. Ah. Say, Prince. If, by some miracle, uh, aid were to come, from what direction would it arrive? From the north. But there's little or no hope of that. Even if Frelia were to send us aid, they would not arrive until... This may be good news. Uh, then again, it may be more bad news. There, on that northern mountain path, someone's coming. Man, she's got good eyesight. Okay, Kaiba's not invited to this conversation. Prince Inez! Princess Erica, the prince is surrounded by the mercenary armies of Mincino. He looks vastly outnumbered. I doubt he can hold out much longer. I can see that. Let's hurry! Okay, I think I missed a microtransaction. I'm sorry. Uh, $5 microtransaction from Blue Crimson 217. I was too immersed in the Inez, in the Inez dialogue. Thank you for the $5 microtransaction. Mm. I will not take this Minchino- Oh, sorry. I will not take this Chinchino- Oh. This is Minchino, that's a different story. Slander away. I mean, I would also slander Minchino. Minchino's terrible. Now, what do we do here? There's an arena. That's a lot of enemies. That's a lot of- Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? You and his next map, I think. So we get four units this map. Look at this guy. Sniper. White gem. The hero crest. The goddess icon. Wow. It's Pablo. It's Pablo. Look at this guy. He told me Vanessa was five stars. A guiding ring. All right, let's check for stealables. Not that it matters because we don't have a thief anyway. Well, R.I.P. Red Gem. Yeah, that's it. There is an arena here. What about Draco shield on Garrick? Draco shield on Garrick's a good idea, right? I saved, right? Just in case. Just. Okay. okay. Let's do Draco Shield Garrick. I guess it's a dragon shield. Is there drama in the chat? We can skip all this this time. We can also sell the ocean seal, it's not, we're gonna use that. 
Hey, I mean, we are using all of our units. Not a single one undeployed, but that's kind of a problem. Oh, just wrong opinions? Okay. Alright, how's our formation? This is kind of scary. Cell swords. Can't move Erica's position, that's very bad. Ah, hating on dancers, okay. Well, we gotta rescue these guys. That's opportunity number one. These guys just come from the bottom. Seth Emblem. Probably fine. Player phase. Well, I guess we'll just move Erica down. She does have a support with Seth. Can we kill that mage? We cannot. let Seth tank all these guys with the javelin? I think. I don't think they can kill him. Seth the sluggish? You can get the Natasha support, because he never actually got that. Hey, I've been hearing good things about you lately. Everyone's real happy you've been helping to heal them. Really? That's nice to hear. I do what little I can, but I'm glad if I've been helpful. Oh, you have been, rest assured. You don't just mend flesh, your smile eases all our pain. So, I may have lost our bet, but everything seems to have turned out for the best, right? Joshua, I just do what I can to help and stay out of everyone's way. I'm just saying, you saved a lot of lives out there. You've got other healers, I know, but you're more than that. You're special. I may be the most cynical of our lot, but even I can see that. Joshua, you're far too kind. Don't be so humble. You deserve the praise. If you say so. Well, I do. So keep it up. I'll do what I can. Nice smile. It's kind of boring. <laughs> T support with Natasha. What's his Riz stat? It's not that bad. Nice smile. Oh, you're so sweet. Oh, supported? Good thing we spammed all those end turns. <laughs> Friendship forged, by the way. Are you tired, Arter? Huh? Oh, no, I'm... You're right, I am tired. How could you tell, Loot? I was trying my best not to show it. Oh, come on. There's no one better than me at spotting things like this. I can tell you're mentally exhausted. I don't know what I expected, but... I had no idea war would be like this. One battle after another. Overwhelming odds. And monsters? In this day and age, we're fighting monsters from the legends and epics? I know how much is at stake, but sometimes I get so tired. When you're tired, there's nothing better than a good meal and a long sleep. And if you look at page 900 of De Flores Mystic Myst Mysticus, grass types, there's a special herb that, once decocted into a potion, will help relax your muscles. I believe our lead researcher, Lab Rochelle, has done lots of work on concocting such a serum. Look for the Parfina flower and reduce it into a thick syrup before drinking. Oh, and I hear music helps you sleep. If you like, I can hum something for you. Thank you. However, I, I think I'll pass on your offer. Delightful though your humming must be. You must be tired as well. Take care of yourself and rest when you can. I will. In fact, maybe I'll just hum to myself instead. Will you be all right? I'm fine. I feel quite refreshed, in fact. This is an RPG, a role-playing game, so it's important to play along. 
Cheers. Refreshed. <laughs> I'm fine. I feel quite refreshed, in fact. Thanks to this green tea. <laughs> Suddenly, I'm not so tired. <laughs> refreshed? How so? Was it some new kind of magic? Well, no, actually. <laughs> it's very aromatic. Oh, and it's full of antioxidants, it says. Thanks to our sponsor, Asahi Green Tea. Look at this. It's the biorhythm curve from Fire Emblem 9. <laughs> and now I'm at max biorhythm. Only with Asahi Green Tea. <laughs> Refreshed. Perhaps from a certain point of view. Every, your every word has nurtured my soul. That's a bit creepy, Arthur. Hmm. I'm not sure I get it, but as long as you're feeling better. Alright, you bungled it at the end, Arthur. That was a little creepy, but good try, I guess. Better than Ross. Ross disastrous. I guess Kyle with an Iron Lance there? Oh, he can get axed. Natasha can also get axed. That's crazy. Well, we don't want that. Rescued. Okay, and now Natasha is not supporting Joshua, so great tactics by me. <laughs> My plan to get rid of Klimit has yielded some unexpected fruit. The head of Frelia's Prince Inez will make a fine gift to Grotto. Lord Pablo, Prince Inez and his men have taken refuge in a mountain stronghold. Do we have your permission to finish them off? Yes. Flush the prince out and cut him down. We'll find Klimt after, or later, and roast his old bones as well. <laughs> I don't like this Pablo guy. Lord Klimt, Pablo's troops are moving toward the stronghold. It looks like they're planning on chasing down Prince Inez and his men. Pablo, you mad, reckless imbecile. If Prince Inez dies here, the bond between Mincino and Frelia is sundered forever. Do fighters know what sunder means? They actually might, because warriors in World of Warcraft use sunder armor. Mincino will be nothing more than a normal type. Pay. Vassal. Do fighters know what vassal means? Paying tribute to Grotto. We must find some way to aid Prince Inez. Wait, my Lord Klimt. Pablo is after you as well, if you reveal yourself here. Ah, uh, may fortune keep you safe, Prince Inez. <laughs> hey, good luck, Prince Inez. I'm just gonna hide here. Okay, this is looking like the Seth we know. We didn't use the Draco shield on him, by the way. <laughs> Are we sure this guy's five stars? It looks like six to me. Yeah, this is the Erica we know. Oh! Hey, she actually dodged. Are you kidding? We didn't, we didn't double him? Hello? Maniac? Uh oh. And then. Oh! Joshua the Juker? Don't tell me you're using your silver bow, bro. And axe. So genuine question, uh, so genuine question, cheese, because I was doing the game last night with family. Does the root stop at chapter 14, then you, the, you didn't choose to chapter 15? Then main one take over, you choose the beginning? Do you mean in the base game, or in the version we're playing? Okay, so how do we deal with this? Loot? With L5, that's a lot of damage. There's 14. Leaves him with 8. 
Does Arter do eight? Does nine. Supported! Fun stream, lots of laughs, takes zer, zer, error, error, care. Thanks, Dukester. Good night. You're going to sleep on the ground? Both of you are going to sleep? If two of you are leaving, it's over, okay? Thank you for watching so far, but your jobs aren't done. This is the end. For all of you. Damn it! If my interns abandon me, I'll never complete my research. The beds must be burned before the interns fall asleep. Isn't that a bit much, sir? Burn down to their frames! No one goes to sleep until our research is complete. Damn it! If my interns abandon me, I'll never raid all four units we recruit this chapter. Thanks for watching. I think in this hack, it's actually forced. So it's actually forced Ephraim root. So you do Ephraim root up to where they would converge, and then it flips back to Erica root. You play through Erica root, and then the rest of the game is Sigma Leon, which means it's from Ephraim's perspective. Which is probably better, because, I mean, Ephraim's better. Does that answer your question? There are better places to sleep than on the ground, you know. Magic? Well, that's annoying. At least our weapon level increased. We have an advantage against swords! This is so sad. This is so sad. Do we kill this guy? We want to kill the mage, right? Can we kill this guy with... Well, that kills him. Let's just do it. You think you can defeat... Uh, uh, Erica the Elusive? Sorry. I... Is it brain fart? We crit him. Killed. We do... We don't kill the Iron Sword. I don't want to use two charges, bro. Does our C support with Natasha let us kill the Iron Sword? I don't think so. With the Iron Sword, we would need... We'd only need one more damage. If we get one damage from our support... Is there anyone we can actually heal? No. So we might be a bit damaged, but... It's a disaster. It's a disaster. Let's just kill him. We could dodge. Josh with a juker? Not juked. Well, we have 22 health. We didn't use an angelic robe on this guy, right? He has a lot of health. Just gonna hide in this forest. We don't even need our javelin, right? Joshua the jobber? <laughs> I mean, he did kill them. He didn't crit either one, and he got hit, so... That wasn't even that unlikely of an outcome, but I'm a bit disappointed. Do we even care about those bandits? Joshua the Jobber. If we get crit, we definitely get doubled by this guy, right? For sure. Oh, yeah. Ouch. Well, okay, I'm pretty sure, even on Maniac Mode, Garrett can take on those Lolgers, so that's not a problem. Garrick, no, don't go out there! Inez, no, don't go out there! Okay, this is now a rescue mission.
We can at least attack with Erica before rescuing. Fire does 14. L fire did, wow, that's a lot of damage, but it doesn't actually kill them. Fire. Then we have to deal eight damage. We do deal eight. And we can hack from that mountain so we don't get hit. Okay. We do have to hit both of these, but we do have the true hit system. It's a good hit rate. Erica is at full health. We can get rid of this guy. 40% chance to get rid of him. I think it's worth it. You think you can stand up to Erica the Eviscerator? That's good. Nice threat out of the way. Princess, we ride! I'm not scared of this archer. Arthur cannot reach. I think it's okay to heal Kyle. I think we can block off Natasha. I also don't think Natasha dies in one hit. I mean, she might die in one hit to this guy. So, first of all, let's see. Okay, we are in support range. Can we kill this guy? 35% chance. And then how's our... We'd have to deal 14 damage with a javelin. We have 13 health, by the way. And we do. But that hit rate is terrible. I'm stunned. Terrible hit rates. Archer, unfortunately, cannot reach. Okay, so... Plan A... I, I really doubt these guys move, right? There's no way they do. There's no way they do. So plan A is just kill this guy. 35% chance. Not killed. Plan B is javelin this guy. Okay, and plan C is probably die, so let's just see how this goes. It's a disaster. I don't think we die, though, like, because we're one short of dying on Joshua. And I don't think that Axe Fighter's gonna hit us. Nice Slim Sword. You think you can stand up to Joshua the Jobber? Apparently you can. Are we sure this guy's the heir of Gehenna? Tethys, what are you doing? I hope Garrick has healing AI. There's no way we die here. Okay, you think you can strike Joshua the Juker? Okay, there's no way that... This is fine. There's no way that Tethys gets one shot by the Lolger, right? There's no way. Okay, good job, Garrick. We don't have elixirs because we're just a humble mercenary band. Oh, look at that, Inez. Okay, I think we're safe here. Don't tell Kaga. Okay. And Marissa's over there. One health Joshua. At least we got those... Those sick health level ups, right? We definitely need to heal Joshua. Lose 
loot. Okay, Kyle has full health. We do have the Iron Sword. He has a terrible hit rate. That's good. Kyle level? How good is Kyle? We should have given him the Draco Shield. That's pretty good. I've forgotten what good levels look like. I can't believe it. Let's do this before we forget. We do have to drop. If we drop Erica, she's not really in any danger, right? No. Let's just do that. Alre literally already better than Ford, and he's only level 10, with 10 fewer level ups. Okay, gotta kill the Cell Sword. Loot can reach this Axe Fighter. I think she can actually deal 21 damage. Iron Lance is an exact kill. Do we die to anything by going there? No. So we can do that. Hey, good accuracy. Uh, we have a lot of skill. That means we've got good stats, right? Does Joshua have a vulnerary? He does. These guys have really bad stats. We definitely deal 21 damage, right? There's no way we don't. Uh oh. Loot the loser? We have a B support. We have a B support. Friendship. No, my friends! We don't get doubled if we use fire, right? Okay. Does Natasha get one shot? I don't think anybody gets one shot. Arthur has nine speed. This is actually fine, right? We're actually fine. We would have to get hit twice. It's impossible to die. It's impossible to die. We're fine. Who's this? Hey! You're up! You're getting paid a lot more than us common soldiers. How come your portrait looks so much cooler? Time you earned your gold! I hear you. Where do I start killing? Th that way! The Frelian troops! Don't point that blade in our direction! I'll do what I can. No promises. Good day. So that's Marissa, the Crimson Flash of Garrick's mercenaries. She's a beauty! <laughs> but I'll keep my distance and keep my head. Not forgiven. Not forgiven. Killed. Ugh, horrible. Why does this guy have a killer axe? Let's just kill this guy. What's he gonna do to us? I guess if he hits us, we die. You think you can strike Joshua the Juker? Okay, now he dies to loot. Well, he's definitely a Myrmidon. Great strength stat. Why didn't we heal with Natasha first? We did. She just really sucks. Like, you can barely even tell that we healed. 
She's so bad. Unless that was the joke, that her heal did nothing. Oh, hey, the killer axe. Cool. For all of our axe users. Magic is everything. Okay, I don't actually think we're in range of anyone, so we can do this. Natasha heals by carrying around vulnerabilities and just handing it out to people. I think she starts with a men's staff. She really needs it. Does Kyle do anything? Kyle definitely wants to stand in front of loot. For sure. With Iron Lance. Supports? We're friends. Let's actually drop here. We're fine with... Erica being Erica the Exposed, because it's just axe fighters. This is. Oh, they do move! Ouch! Okay, we can't suffer from success. Good thing we have one HP left. Look at all these axe fighters. But they don't even destroy the. Uh oh. Inez the Oka. Well, this is fine. We still have a killing edge, right? We don't even need it, but I guess we'll get rid of this guy. Great crit rate. Hey, our weapon level increased. Okay, Mar Marissa's on the move. Marissa the mobile. Not seven damage. When we recruit... What's his face? Garrick's healing up. When we recruit Inez, do we recruit everyone else as well? Or do we have to talk to them individually? My XP! You have to talk to them all? That's so annoying. So that takes all of their actions. We don't actually get any actions then. Prince Inez, are you well? Let's make sure we have the correct portrait. Erica, is that you? We've come to aid you! You must be exhausted. Please fall back and rest. We'll take care of these dogs. I cannot allow that. I will not run and hide while a woman protects- Excuse me? And I just said that out loud. <sighs> this is a difficult video for me to make. We really need a misogyny graphic. It comes up a lot. We will continue to fight. You can join us. If that's how you want it, let's go then. Oh, let's go Kaiba. Erica, a moment. Prince? I would give you my thanks. You, the Princess of Rene, came to my aid. I am in your debt. Well, here's a question for you. If Kaiba is so rich, then how can he be in anyone's debt? Let's talk about Inez. The dude with the most Sigma ma The dude with the most Sigma stance in the game. Head of Kaiba Corps. Well, he's a sniper. I don't really know what you want me to say about him. He's another one of Sacred Stones' perfectly okay units. Look at these stats. They're perfectly okay. They're actually pretty good. Unfortunately, he's a sniper. <laughs> so what is he gonna do? I'll tell you what he's gonna do. 
he's gonna kill one unit on player phase. That's not useless, but I could definitely think of some more useful things that other units could do. Nice thing about Inez is that he does come with a silver bow and A rank bows, which means that the S rank bow, Nidhogg, a great villain from the Nice thing about Inez is that he does come with a silver bow and the bow rank to use it. He has A rank bows and the S rank bow, Nidhogg, fun villain from Final Fantasy XIV, the underrated and yet somehow overly popular MMORPG with a generous free trial. Nidhogg may as well be his personal weapon. Who else is going to use it? Namie? Ranger Garrick? Lol, no, Inez is going to use it. And if you give him Nidhogg, yeah, he's pretty good with it against monsters probably shouldn't be plural against one monster a turn on player phase I don't know if this guy has a character arc, but he definitely doesn't have a growth arc. You'll notice that none of the numbers in the tens digit is a five. Lots of fours, though. They're not that bad. Bases over growths. He's got good bases. So his mediocre growths aren't that big of a deal. What is a big deal is this. Sniper sucks. But don't worry. I was gonna say, even though he has a lot of skill, he kind of doesn't. 13's kind of low for a sniper, so... It's actually good! That means his subpar skill is patched up by Sure Shot! Whoa! I was gonna say that... I was gonna say that... Uh, that's probably fine. Maybe we don't have to do a retake. Just, uh... Inez can't use axes, but just to hammer home how useless Sure Shot is. Sure Shot is the skill of snipers. I don't know what the activation chance is. I don't think it actually matters. If Sure Shot activates, you will guaranteed hit your attack. It's not very good. And just to be firm and explicit, YouTube don't ban me, about why it's not good. Usually you don't even take shots where you have bad hit rates. So Sure Shot, ironically, is a very unreliable way to patch accuracy on shots that we're probably going to hit anyway. Extremely bad. Apparently the activation rate is the same as Pearson Great Shield, as in equal to your level. So he currently has a 1% chance to sure shot the opponent. Sounds like a sure shot to me. The screenshot is so strange. It's literally just him saying I'm the Prince of Frelia in both Japanese and English. Why? What are you smiling about? What are you smiling about? What are you smiling about? Wow, great support list. Actually, great support list. Garrick's a good support. Vanessa, normal Vanessa is a good support. Normal Tanessa's a good Wow, great support list. Pretty much all these units are at least usable. Some of them are, on average, really good, as long as you're not doing our playthrough. Ugh.
sure shot. More like Sir Skit. I don't know if that actually makes any sense. Inez. Inez, you're a second-rate pre-promote with a third-rate class. Two stars. Pretty far from the bullseye. Okay, that's a review of Inez. Everyone okay with that? Have Inez recruit Tethys so she can dance, refresh Inez, and then talk to Garrick. I mean, we can just talk to Garrick with Inez? And then have Garrick talk to Tethys. Not one star? No. Some people are questioning why not one star. And the reason why not one star is because he deals three times the damage with his bow. Whereas if he was in FE7, he would only deal two times the damage, and then he'd be way worse, but... You can shoot some gargoyles, two stars. Let's talk to Garrick. Reinforcements have arrived, Garrick. I don't know why I'm telling you this, because I started right next to you. Reinforcements have arrived, Garrick. I don't know why I'm telling you this, because... You're actually closer to Erica than I am. Gotta make sure to use the correct sprites. Lucky us, eh? Good thing we held out as long as we did. That was your doing. Thank you. Hey, don't let your guard down now, Prince. There's still enemies to fight. It'd be such a shame to die now. I agree completely. Let's go. Let's go, Garrick! Let's go, Garrick! Garrick! The Gherkin! I always think of Gherkin pickles, which I don't really like. Although I do like pickles overall. Uh, anyway... I'm not gonna hold Gherkin sins against Garrick. Introducing Garrick, the gallant. That's a little more flattering. Garrick is a member of the Ogma archetype, also known as the Good Mercenary. Look at these stats. They're good. <laughs> I can see why they hired this guy. This guy, Garrick is the most pre-promoted, unpromoted unit of all time. Garrick is the most unpromoted, pre-promote of all- <laughs> Garrick is the most flexible, pre-promote of all time? He's not pre-promoted. Well, how do we say this? In Sacred Stones, they really wanted to show off the split ev- I was gonna say split evolutions. In Sacred Stones, they really wanted to show off the split promotion mechanic. So they let you build your own pre-promote with Garrick. He is a base class, but he is level 10, and he comes with a hero crest. So you can choose your own path. You can stay unpromoted, gain a few more levels to beef up his stats even further, or, if you need the immediate power boost, you can go ahead and cash in the Hero Crest and ascend right away. There's merits to both. Garrick, as you can see by these beefy numbers, is perfectly viable unpromoted. He's really strong. He can... He can very reliably chop down some goons. But he can only do that at one range. 
you want to do it at two, maybe consider becoming heroic. That's not right. Bro, where where is Effie Wiki? I found it. We've tossed around a couple When it comes to Garrick's stats, he's definitely a shower. And and not a grower, because yeah, I don't know about these. If you look at the tens place, you'll notice there's not a single five. Lagging? What's going on? Hang on. Okay, I showed Garrick's growths and the stream started breaking. Garrick's growths are too big for the stream. Okay, there we go. When it comes to Garrick's... When it comes to Garrick's stats, he's definitely a shower and... Not a grower, because... These growths are... They're kind of suspicious. If you look in the... The tens place, you'll notice that there's not a single five. Bases are better than growths, but I, I would like some better growths than this. This 30% speed is especially suspicious. Very good candidate for the speed wings that you just got in the previous chapter. Garrick has a very balanced promotion choice. I know there's ranger haters out there, I'm actually one of them. <laughs> but... Garrick's choice here fixes one of his major issues. If you go hero, you get more speed, which you really want. And the juiciest part of becoming a hero, of course, is hand axes. Garrick is huge. He has 13 con, 15 after becoming heroic, which means that he has no issues using axes. However, that does cap him out at 6 move, and because he's so beefy, it's really hard to actually... Hmm. Let's see. Garrick's promotion choice is really balanced. Whichever way you go, you're gonna fix one of his weaknesses. You can't quite have it all. If you choose the hero path, you will get more speed, which you really like, and more importantly than that, you get those axes. And Garrick is huge. He's got 13 con at base, and after he becomes heroic, that becomes 15. So he has no issues using axes, doesn't lose any speed from that. However, that does cap him out at 6 move, and because he's so beefy, it's really hard to ferry him around with mounted units, especially after those mounted units promote. If you go Ranger, then you do get a horsey, however... If you go Ranger, then you do get a pony, but it's definitely not the Pony Express, right? Remember that Magvel mounts are kinda lame. He only gets 7 movement, and he does get bows, so then he can attack at 1, or 2 range. That's what you meant by 1-2 range, right? There's merits... There's merits to both choices, but I, personally, me, Cheese, the greatest tactician in Magvel, I always, always go hero. It just feels kinda wrong to me to make this guy a ranger. He's clearly supposed to be a hero. He's my hero.
But if you decide to go Ranger, I'm not gonna say you're wrong. And hey, Ike, the protagonist of the next game and member of Grail's Mercenaries, he starts as a Ranger, even though he's a mercenary and he doesn't have a horse. It just gets really confusing. Although we're not raiding based on lunatic mode, we've been struggling with combat on lunatic mode against these insane enemies, so we're definitely going hero. What are you smiling about? Must be his great stats. Support list is alright. He could mentor Ross in our playthrough. That's actually what we might do. Ooh. This Tethys support. Tethys has fire affinity. That's really good, but... If she's next to Garrick, she's a couple tiles away from getting chopped, so maybe we won't do that, but I'm considering it. We haven't settled on a title for Garrick yet. It's definitely not going to be Garrick the Gherkin because his title should be positive. Maybe... We haven't settled on a title for Garrick yet. It definitely shouldn't be Garrick the Gherkin because I want it to be positive. I don't know about Garrick the Great, but... Garrick the Good. Four stars. Garrick the Glorious? You guys really like Garrick. I like him too. What do you call that thing on his head? Is it just a headband? A question I do have for all you viewers. What what is he wearing on his head? I'm you might be able to tell because I wear like Hello Kitty pajamas all the time. I'm not exactly keyed into the fashion. Question for the viewers: What exactly is he wearing on his head, and what purpose does it serve? I'm not exactly out there fighting in the desert like Garrick the Desert Tiger. His official title. Maybe maybe it's an icy hot pack. <laughs> it's his Naruto headband. All right. I'm not sure if that's true, but I believe it. Garrick's pretty good. Garrick the good. Looks like a sleep mask, maybe. He puts it over his eyes. Maybe it's a sleep mask, you're right. Garrick? It could be a sleep mask, could be a blindfold. Garrick has the world record blindfolded FE8 speedrun. Hand axes only. Oh, if he gets hit by a sleep mage, then the eye mask actually goes over his eyes. There it is. If you're tired, you should get some rest. Pretty good unit overall. Alright, well we know what we gotta do here. Talk to Tethys! Nice alliteration! Hey Tethys, it looks like help is on the way. Really? Perhaps faith is a good thing. I will bring honor to my father and my kingdom. Perhaps the same could be said of all religions. 
I've never had much before, but perhaps good things do happen to good people. Good things? <laughs> I like the sound of that. What do you suppose might come my way? <laughs> I wonder. Oh. What are you what are you implying, Tethys? It's Tethys! You can probably tell from her sprite. Tethys is a dancer. Her stats are atrocious. <laughs> Absolute bottom of the bin. Rotten to the core. She's probably the worst dancer in the series, because her availability is kind of bad. And a lot of dancers do something extra, right? They have some sort of special buff, like the uh, Elib. A lot of dancers bring something extra, right? The Elib dancers from FE7, they had special buffs they could use. I guess she's sort of tied with the other Elib dancers, either Elfin or the other one. Because they also do nothing but dance. Horrible mobility. Horrible mobility. She doesn't even get six moves. She's stuck at five. So once all of your infantry promotes, she's going to be perpetually lagging behind. And all she does is refresh one unit at a time. Why not just bring another good unit instead of Tethys? Worst dancer in the series. Five stars. You really can't go wrong with a dancer, but she is still the worst dancer in the series, I think. Five stars. One for each point of movement. Here's her growths, if you care. I don't know why she has a strength growth. I don't even know why she has base strength. Here's her growths, if you care. Why does she have a strength growth? Nils, I think, also had a strength growth. But he didn't have any base strength. But she has one. I guess she gets stronger from all the dancing? At the very least, 70% speed and 80% luck. She's not getting doubled. And she's very dodgy, so if she ever does get attacked, it's probably only once, and she'll probably dodge it, but if she gets hit, she's definitely dead. Supports Garrick, but you probably don't want her near where Garrick is fighting. Supports Ewan. Why are you using Ewan? <laughs> I ask, even though we're definitely going to use Ewan. Her personal fire affinity is the best in the game, though, so... If you're willing to take the risks, having Tethys near where the fighting is happening, you get big buffs! And hey, enemies will attack her because she's so easy to kill! So that's Tethys. Kind of late availability. Very bad movement. Can't fight at all. Sounds pretty bad to me. You can't convince me to rate a dancer lower than 5 stars. I can't explain how useful they are. You just have to watch it. But I'll give my... But I'll give my two-sentence summary. A dancer is a copy of your best unit. But it's better than that. 
because your best unit changes depending on the situation. And Tethys can copy whoever that is by giving them another action. Five stars. I'm going over two sentences, okay? Are you tryharding? You should use Tethys, because then you can refresh your unit that kills everything. Are you memeing it up by using all of the trainees? Then you should use Tethys, because then you can refresh your useless trainee, and they can be useless twice. Five stars. How do we kill this guy? What do we have here? We have a steel blade. Did Seth kill this guy? He cannot. I thought he was good. Well, we, we actually just want to retreat to the north, right? Garrick recruits Marissa, who's coming up here. But we probably just want to rejoin our forces up here. Guess we can do this. I don't think we actually double this guy. We don't. Garrick kill? XP. The steel blade. The steel blade. Ah. Guess we'll turn on Inez's. Are you betting you're just going to change to not be Seth in any situation? Well, maybe Seth is not there. Alright, what do we do here? Look at all these axe users. Alright, who's... Okay, Joshua is on the brink of death. I'm not scared of getting hit twice. But then that guy kills me. What if we just back up? Eleven. Norland's just fourteen. There's no way we can kill that guy. You can hold here, I guess. Kill the Lolger. Loot level? Get off a of Reddit loot. Uh. Your magic save you. Sorcery killed my stream. It's fine, the final boss is a mage. Okay, we desperately need to... Do we have a... Okay, we do have a vulnerary. This is so sad. We, we gotta staunch the bleeding somehow. Any of these guys have two range? Two of them do. That's very scary. get one shot 24 attack that's with the iron axe though he's 23 attack there's no way we have four defense yeah we have two so she just dies oh.
Kyle does have a sword, yeah, so we're just gonna do that. Just equip the sword, because we don't care about these guys hitting us. We care about the bandits hitting us. What's that guy's range? And then we can get the Natasha support. Our units are total losers. We need Garrick. <laughs> Five damage is fine. I wish we had the men staff. I can't believe how much trouble we're having just keeping Joshua alive. It's because the enemies keep hitting him and we, we can't heal him enough. Marissa's on the move. Okay, Marissa moves first. That's actually very annoying. Nice hit rate. That's fine. Surprised they didn't attack Kyle. Oh, that guy can walk over the mountain. Are you kidding me? Garrick the Gord! I really want Garrick up at the front lines. But like, there's, there's no way I can reach. It's gonna take forever. Like, we go there? It's gonna take forever. It's gonna take like three turns. I don't think we have three turns. We're in huge trouble. Like, what are we supposed to do? I guess we can use this vulnerary. Look how far away we are. Oh, hey, how'd Garrett get here? Is there any other unit that would have let us do that? Five stars. If you think dancers are bad, you're bad! Ah, we can use our two-star unit here. The good thing about archers is they don't take counterattacks. Get him, Kaiba. Yeah, okay, I guess a Sage with Warch Staff could do that too, sure. <laughs> you got me there. I should have promoted him to Ranger for the extra move. We're still in huge trouble, by the way. Okay, loot. This guy can cross the mountain, right? Ooh, that's scary. Reeved? So sad. This guy only has 10 speed. So if he crosses the mountain, he can't get that far. So it's basically that he can attack loot. And loot doesn't die in one shot. So I think we actually are okay. If we L fire this guy to kill him, that's really bad. Because we're with L fire, our speed sucks. Let's just do this. We need triage on Joshua. This is the best you can do, Vanessa. Stop getting in our way. Yes, Arter, the number one take drop unit in Sacred Stones. I think it's fine to kill this guy, which means he doesn't get to hit us. Is 
Does Kyle do anything? I don't think so. I would do that if we one-shot him, but no, I'm just gonna keep this equipped. I don't think loot can die here. I hope not. That's kind of scary. Okay, she's fine. This guy's in a mountain, by the way. That's why his avoid is crazy. It's even better than a mountain. It's a peak. I think it's 40 avoid. Absolutely disgusting. Marissa's on the move. That's fine. Why are they attacking Joshua? These bandits aren't known for their intelligence. Erica the escapee. Uh, we can't actually shoot anyone. Refreshed. Okay, Garrick is doing alright. It's time for Garrick Gaming. How's this guy do? Steel Blade. Erica could reach. Erica doubles, right? She does. I mean, that's fine. Gotta deal with all these bandits. Reaving this guy's gotta be pretty good, right? That is pretty good. I don't think anyone else can even reach us. We're not scared of any swords. Reeve? You think you can send up to Vanessa the Vanquisher? Very helpful. How is our accuracy here? It's pretty good, right? It's pretty good. We can heal Joshua. We are slowly advancing. Would you rather have Garrick here, or... I guess we'd rather have Garrick here. Oh! I thought the Steel Blade weighed you down! I guess it does. <laughs> Garrick the Gashed. <laughs> He's... He really loves axes. He wants to use hand axes so much he keeps getting hit by them. Come on, Garrick. I don't think he dies, though. I think he's still okay. We can just have Joshua chop this dude? Gets rid of him. Kyle kill? Does this guy have a hand axe? He does not. We can do this. We can put Joshua here. Nobody come from the south, right? We can put Joshua here. Sick Archer kills? We don't get one shot. Sick Archer kills. Don't tell Kaga. Oh, huge XP gauge. We're so low level. Level six. Hello? Hello? I don't feel very lucky. What was that? Fine, we'll get speed next level. Curse of Kaga. The light has forsaken us. Well, we can move Tethys up here.
Okay. Come on, Garrick. Garrick! What in the world? Face tanking master. Come on, bro. You live on the battlefield. You know this day will come. Garrick the Goner. Are you kidding me? Garrick the Ghost. Okay, hopefully viewers at home agree. I didn't exactly make a tactical error there, right? He got clobbered by ridiculously bad accuracy. Yes, that's why you shouldn't use the steel the steel blade. It's so unreliable. Hang on. Okay, there we go. Well, we have to accept this horrible level, right? We don't want to abuse Kaga's protection. Okay, n we apparently have to save Garrick now. Not a steel blade. That's probably fun. Okay, now he chooses to attack Erica. Hello? The bandits of Mincino. They've all got the best glasses money can buy. What is happening? You think you can strike Josh with a juker? This guy's attacking Seth for some reason. There's no way he doubles us, right? Okay, that's fine. This guy's attacking Seth for some reason. There's no way he doubles us, right? Okay, we're fine. Steel bow. Javelin. Okay. Yeah, Eric is almost dead. These guys are still all stuck in the mountains. I think we can actually kill these guys and move up. That's the plan, at least. Hathis can't really reach anyone. Seth of Steelix? What do we do here? Garrick in the forest? Because Garrick has to talk to Marissa, and I don't think he kills Marissa in one hit. So yeah, he's gonna be at weapon triangle disadvantage, but... Okay, he needs, a, he needs like an iron sword for that. And we used our vulnerary because he took so much damage. Maybe Erica does this. Erica really needs to be healed, though. I don't want her to die to the archer. We can do. We can do this.
Eric of the Armory. I forgot to give Garrick the Vulnery. That's my mistake. <laughs> well, I did have a plan. I didn't execute it, but I did have a plan. Kyle, you can do this, right? Kyle the Courageous? And speed's an important stat, but forgive me for not celebrating that one. Okay, Kaiba can actually reach a lot of things. That's good. Okay. Roasted. Loot level. I want magic. I want speed. I got skill. get speed next level. She's so skilled, guys. I... Lab Rochelle stole all of our level ups. Since then, it's been nothing but tragedy. Well, who else are we gonna dance for? If Arthur kills this guy, we can wall off, right? He's fine. Loot Lilithargy, you've cracked the code? That's because I don't love loot. Let's not mess around, right? This guy, let's just kill him. We only have one killing edge use. One star tactics. <laughs> one is all we need, right? One is all we need. One is all we need. We needed more than one. It's a disaster. It's a disaster! Do we deal 16 damage if we reeve? Can't even reach him. Kyle over here. Should have used Inez. Seth can kill this guy, right? That's good. Inez can choke. The I think someone's gonna die. This was di a disastrous turn. Oh, wait. That's good. You... You Renean slugs! Can't you do anything right? Just leave it to me. To get hit by a 34% chance. <laughs> it's a disaster! Everything's going south. Some of it was my fault. <laughs> Some of it. Can we reeve this guy? We can reeve him. We have to kill this guy. Can we deal 14 damage? 
We can. Okay. This guy can attack us. There's no way the Lalger doubles us. There is no way. Reeved. Speed level. Let there be light, please. It's not fair. What did I do to deserve this? Your magic shall not save you. At least we got resistance. Fine. We'll get speed next level. Level 15. 12 speed. At least we got one speed level. I don't trust you. You think you can stand up to Kyle the Conqueror? I don't know any adjectives that start with K. Okay, none of these guys die, right? Inez is okay, Kyle is okay. Vanessa is not okay, but she's not gonna die in one round of combat, right? I, I, like, I don't even think it's possible. Natasha level? How good is this? This is pretty good. Too bad it's on Natasha. Sure, bro. Why did he do that? Why didn't you attack Inez, the archer? Kyle the killer, I guess. Oh, hey, we actually need that. That is a very high hit rate. Oh, he has a Slim Lance. Imagine getting doubled while having a Slim Lance. No, not the Eye Mask! Not the Eye Mask! We, we do have a Restore Staff. Oh, Kyle the Keen. Keen is a bad ability, though. Okay, if we just put Joshua in the forest, like, what are they gonna do to us? Nothing, right? Where can these guys move? Over there, but we're gonna block them? With Joshua there. We are one tile away. We are one tile away. I mean, this is fine. We can get the XP! The headband must be safety goggles from the spore. Okay, somebody needs healing. Seth actually needs healing. Oh, Garrick needs healing. Garrick mocked. 777 microtransaction from Prometheus. And 777 is a lucky number, right? Mm. Thanks for the microtransaction. Wow, just wow. Never seen luck this bad. Your growth through all of FE7 and now all of FE8 were, with few exceptions, miserable. How inconvenient. I agree. There is some light in the darkness, though. After the stream, be sure to watch the Lab Rochelle training arc. I think, on average, we're actually okay. However, Erica's route is in dire strait. Erica, I bring dire tidings. Your units are horrible. <laughs> Okay, we need the Restore Staff. We can use the Restore Staff, right? Okay, that's good. Let's take Mend as well. This girl needs help. 
We have to use mend here. We're so bad. So how do we do this? We have to get... We have to get... We need Joshua at least one tile up so he can reach the forest. There's a couple ways we can do that. I think probably the biggest is like rescue him. Then move him here. And then we can rescue drop him. But that takes three actions. Doesn't that seem like such a huge waste? I don't want to do that. Is there like another way we could do We just need to get Joshua two more movements. I guess we'll just move him closer to the forest. Oh, hey, we made it. Exactly what we wanted. What a good unit. We have an 82 hit rate on this guy. He's in a he's on a peak. I think we're okay here. Loot is level eight. Arthur is only level six. I guess Arthur can do this. Uh, he almost dies, and he doesn't even kill the enemy. That's not good. Free XP. These robes. <laughs> okay, I guess we could miss. That would be very bad. We did not miss. Okay, what we're worried about is killing Marissa. I think we're fine. The worst is behind us. Well, I mean, that's not true. We are going to review Marissa, but I think we can chill for a little while. Teth is the tactical. We might need Boster's Tower, but Erica's maps overall are quite easy. The issue is just that our units are horrible. Garrick is just standing there getting stabbed and chipped by axes. Meanwhile, Joshua's fighting for his life in the forest. Fighting off every bandit in Mincino. Garrick, don't just stand there! Move out of the way! This guy use Ingrain? I know he's in the forest. Joshua? Mercy, please. No mercy. No mercy. No mercy! <laughs> oh, we can run them out of ballista shots. Not the eye mask. Not the eye mask! Not the eye mask. He's really fast. He's really fast. Ho ho ho! It's beginning to look a lot like Lindis. Ho ho horrible! <laughs> Lin's also really fast. I guess we'll attack this. I mean... Axe Reaver will have a really good hit here. Does that put us in range of the Ballista? It does not. What about this one? It does, so we're not going to do that. Forget it. Do we do Assassin or Swordmaster Joshua? 
It's actually a choice. Okay, Garrick. Try hitting your enemy. Okay. First Garrick level. Garrick the Good, Garrick the Great, Garrick the... Garrick the... Your magic shall not save you. Garrick the Resistant. It's not just me, right? It's not just confirmation bias? Our units just have a zillion res. Why? We did get strength, that's nice. I don't know if we actually want to move up here. Do we need healing? Seth needs healing. At least I won't die to Shadow Shot, I guess that's true. So we want to heal Seth, but we only have one healer. Oh. Hey, we have two healers now. How convenient. It's so easy. What's this guy doing? We can just shoot this guy, right? We can. Can we javelin him? If we javelin him, we're in range. There's no way, right? What's our con here? Con 5? Okay. Oh, okay. Arter is on death's door. Isn't loot a sage? Looks like a level 8 mage to me. Assassin only gives Joshua plus one res while losing plus two HP, plus one strength, plus one con from Swordmaster. The only reason I'm considering Assassin is because enemies are really strong. So some of, the, some of them we might actually need to assassinate. Also, it's more hype. But I agree that overall it's much worse. And of course, on a normal playthrough, you would never do it. I guess I'll just move Inez over here. We're gonna have loot shoot this guy, I think. Oh, that's true. We would go Mage Knight as well. Mage Knight gets staves, right? Eric, don't just stand there. You have to dodge. Garrick the Grounded. Joshua the Juker. The Eye Mask. The Eye Mask. Garrick the Gusuri Nemuru. That means he's asleep. Good thing we brought a restore staff. Garrick the Groggy. Marissa can't even reach us, right? Yeah. Even if we kill this guy, I don't think Marissa can reach us. Refreshed. I wish we had another healer. Oh, we do! Wow, how convenient. Okay, he doesn't need healing yet. Let's just heal this guy. Gotta use the men's staff. Even on Arter. Natasha might get sniped by who? These guys can't go anywhere. Uh-oh. Did you destroy someone, Solomon Kearns? 
There's no way we die to one ballista shot, right? There's no way. I'm not even gonna check. There's no way we die to one shot. We've got the angelic rogue. There's no way we die, but just in case. No, nobody's destroyed, okay. That guy only shoots one space. That guy can't reach, okay. Magic in the mountains? Magic in the mountains! Okay, good archer level. I mean, I said that in advance, maybe I shouldn't have. Yeah. Your magic shall not save you. Good thing I made a new resistance emote. What's going on? Hey, we're in support range. Nice chip XP. We can kill with Elfire. Arthur the average? I wish he was average. We're just standing around here. It's fine at 99 Slayer. He'll be great. I mean, Molder looked pretty moldy at the beginning too, right? You think you can stand up to Joshua of Gehenna? Gotta save those Iron Sword uses. Garrick, oh, okay. Good dodge. Garrick, don't just stand there. Okay. How much ammo do they have? Okay, not Garrick the Grounded. Good hit rate. Oh! Garrick the Gallant! Thanks for critting when it didn't matter, but that did look cool. What a show off. Did nothing, but sure. Okay, I think if we have three magic, this heals him to full. What a healer. Garrick the Gratuitous. Garrick the Gatlade. He's got sharpness. Although sharpness only boosts by 50%, and that was more than 50%. Good shot. Elfire does kill this guy. But then I'm gonna get shot by the Ballista, so let's just use fire. More chip XP. Is Marissa gonna move up? I actually don't think she will. If we leave Natasha here, this guy will shoot her. This guy has 20 attack. We do have two defense, so we don't die, okay? So this is intentional. Ouch. He dodged anyway. Okay. Do you know this guy has four stars? Four star growths. Four star growths. We want speed. It's fine. We'll get speed next level. Your crest is right here, we could use it. Garrick the Geriatric, come on man, what was that? Right, Seth. Okay. 
terrible hit rate. You can miss one. Didn't miss either. Why did he just stand there? Is he stupid? A torch! Now we're saved! Probably wondering why I did that. So, Garrick can recruit Marissa. But, I mean, he already used his action. I, I think Garrick is the only one who can recruit Marissa. Maybe Erica can as well, but she's nowhere there. So, how do we get to Marissa, even though we already used her action? Oh. How convenient. Let's talk to Marissa! Is that you, Marissa? Chief. What a mess! Looks like the guild bungled. What's wrong with your stats, girl? They're usually diligent about making sure this sort of thing doesn't happen. But here we are, two people of the same troop, working for oppo opposite sides. What should we do? Aye, well, that's a good question. As a mercenary, your loyalty should always lie with the person paying your wages. You decide. We can cross blades if you want, but I'd rather you retreat. Have you seen my bases? You don't stand a chance, girl. Of course, if you betray your employer, you'll soil your sterling name. Soiled it. Come on, Chief. What would you like me to do? Well, that's easy. I'd like you to come over and join my side. Right. Done. Oh. Hold on, is that it? Just like that? You know what this will do to your reputation, right? Uh-huh. And that's the conversation. There's no way it's that easy. There's no way it's that easy. She's still beholden to the Mincino cartel, okay? There's no way it's that easy. But she is a blue unit now. Are we really gonna trust her? I trust you. Incredible graphics for the GBA. That guy was definitely as buff as Garrick, although I don't think Marissa was wearing that much armor. And her hair color was completely wrong. She's not blonde, she has pink hair. Marissa! I'd say Marissa the mediocre, but that's way too generous. Marissa the Myrmidon. That tells you about everything. Worse stats than Joshua. Way later than Joshua. Foot locked, sword locked, in Fire Emblem 8. Let's get this out of the way. <laughs> Do that again because it lagged. There's a very strong argument for Marissa being the worst unit in the game. I might actually subscribe to that argument, just like you should subscribe to this channel. Her only possible competition is Amelia the Awful and Ewan the... What's an insult that starts with E? Egregious? Excruciating? Egregious, okay. The only possible competition for worst unit in the game is either Amelia the Awful or you and the Egregious. But if you train Amelia, you at least do get another paladin, the second best class in the game. 
if you train Yuan, you do get a summoner who can actually fight, which is more valuable than Noel, because Noel can't fight at all, even though it's still not worth it. If you train Marissa, you get memes! But you know what? She loses in meme factor to both Amelia and Ewan anyway! Marissa the Miserable! At least her growths are good, right? Nope! Well, she's a Myrmidon. This number is a three. No! Well, she's a Myrmidon. This is a... This is a three! 30% 30 strength growth. With a seven base. It's chapter 10, by the way. Marissa the Malnourished. She is really fast, and she is... Same promo options as Joshua. Swordmaster is overall better, you get better stats, and you get the crit bonus, as opposed to Assassin, which gets Lockpick Utility, and Silencer Utility. Silencer is a 50% chance that your crits insta-kill the opponent. If you're gonna use Marissa and you're gonna go for Max Meme, you gotta go Assassin. I don't even think her vanilla crits as Swordmaster will kill. May as well gamble with Silencer. Despite... Despite the... F Despite the overwhelming awful factor, she's really popular. I wonder why. I figured out why. And yes, of course there's a bunny outfit. Look at this. Skill set. Skill set. You think there's anything here? Oh. Okay, there's actually way more than I thought. Mobile games must be destroyed. She doesn't have any skills. Her support partners include some winners like Garrick, but Marissa herself is a loser, and also the ice affinity is kind of bad, so... I think you should just leave her alone. <laughs> Have you heard the way she talks? I don't want to talk to her either. Have you heard the way she talks? I wouldn't want to talk to her either.
Someone just brought up. Why is her name the Crimson Flash anyway? Her hair is not even red. It's like lavender. Marissa the Lavender Loser. Did I miss a microtransaction? I did, sorry. I was too busy raging at these terrible stats. Mm. $5 microtransaction from Solomon Kearns. Marissa is truly one of the Sacred Stones units of all times. No hard mode bonuses, absolutely Boster's Tower bait. Why must they do this? Paid review of Marissa. <laughs> Not even the paid review is positive. We didn't mention it. Marissa, as a sword lock unit and a famous mercenary who apparently has a reputation to lose, she's got to be a saint with swords, right? These swords. Dusel has triple A. Marissa has single D, not even double D. Why do people like her? Am I allowed to say that? Uh-oh. This is a difficult video for me to make. Best thing about Marissa, it's not even attached to her, it's the Shamshir. The Shamshir in this game is really good, but you have to be of the Myrmidon class to use it, so just give it to Joshua and then send Marissa to the bench. I think in this game, Shamshir is just strictly better than Killing Edge, which is nice. Is that true? 8 might 75 hit, 35 crit. Oh, we broke ours. Where are Killing Edges? Nah, Killing Edge has more might. Not strictly better. Maybe the sham sure is a warning. This unit's a sham. Sham, wow, more like sham. That's the end. Don't use Marissa. <laughs> well, there's a Marissa review. No complaints about one star, right? Horrible. Maybe Eric can can Erica use the Shamshir? Let's find out. I'll take that. My Kanto. Okay. Are these tactics? Oh, hey, look at that. Erica can actually use the Shamshir. You've already got one force applied ter- Oh, Erica actually can use the Shamshir. You've already got one force deployed terrible sword unit. May as well make it Erica and not double up with Marissa. Loot will die to the next ballista shot, right? We're retreating. We already got Joshua. Do we really need more sorties? Uh-oh. Uh-oh! 
And we've got an unarmed Marissa. <laughs> it's Garrick's better promotion? Why would you troll on the internet? Steel, but it doesn't even have a sword. Okay, loot level? She's a prodigy. She's a prodigy! Finally! That's a good level. Oh, even better at Anima. And a Lance Reaver, perfect for loot. Surround the Ranger and grind Marissa. Are we using Marissa? We already have Joshua and we have Erica. We have zero axe units. We can put Garrick there, but he can't counter, so what's the point? We need Garrick. We need hero Garrick. Tethys level! Oh, perfect! What are mages gonna do against us now? Save you. Yeah, we might need Boster's Tower next stream to get Hero Garrick. Supported. Nez is just standing here. We do have Seth, but Seth can't do literally everything. There's a steel ball on the Pegasi? Don't worry, we'll get it with our thief. Oh, one of those is a Falco Knight, right? You can tell because they've got uh, gilded armor. I hope we don't double them, but they weigh themselves down with the Javelin. Seth is too good. Seth is too good. I actually didn't want to double them. He's gonna kill all of them. My XP! No, stop stealing my XP! Miss! Are we sure this guy's six stars? My XP! Hey, weapon level increased. That's S Lances. My XP. No! We can arena grind a Garrick this map. Maybe he's strong enough to win. Steel Lance, Steel Lance. We could give Garrick the Zanbato, but... He's gonna, like, die. <laughs> Okay, Seth, now we need you over here. Eric of the Armory. The Zanbato. There you go. I don't think anyone can reach that other tile, right? Two rune swords, we can't even use them! Okay, somebody needs healing, right? I'm sure. We did heal loot. Pegasi coming from the bottom left, that's fine. What is Zanbato in Japanese? I don't know. I'm assuming it's also Zanbato. Seth can use rune swords, finally! One, two ranged swords! Gotta get that XP. Maybe I should have danced Eric because she gives swords to Marissa. Marissa's so bad. 
I don't think we have a horse slayer, but Killer Lance can maybe do something. means horse slaying sword does it oh yeah that does mean horse slaying sword ouch okay setting up these kills good job Seth that ranger's kind of scary Okay, this is actually really scary. Maybe we shouldn't have done this. A little too late now. Don't tell Kaga. Might need to use Inez. Well, this is a Falconite, right? Oh, Falconite with a Steel Lance. Get him, Kaiba! <laughs> Alright, problem solved. Don't use your Zombato on my social night! Okay, Zombato versus the Ranger. 24 damage is a lot. Okay, Silver Lance and Zombato. We have to hit this. Uh... Okay, that's good. Seth level! He's got good good growths. He's got good growths! Why does our pre-promote Superstar Paladin get the best level ups out of all of our units? Six stars. It's not fair. Welcome to Sacred Seth. The Zambato. The Zambato! This unit's really weak, which means we can kill it with Vanessa. We did it. Loot here does... Do we double? We do double. No, no, we don't double Delphire. I'm scared of these cell swords there. We do have the rapier. rapier. The ra That's a lot of damage, though. Are we in range of Pegasus Knights? Just the one, right? Yeah, just the one. I suspect that won't actually be a problem. Especially because we didn't get hit. It's not what I suspected, but... Very helpful. Erica the Elite? Doubling with fire does not kill. And we are in Arthur's support range. And attack with Arthur. And then attack with loot from over there. That's good. Really good hit rate. Looking like a prodigy. We definitely should have given the speed wings to Garrick, though. We're pretty exposed here. <laughs> Shooting down these flyers is child's play. I can't believe I lost to a child! not good. No, I... I meant to rescue loot. 
It's a disaster. It's a disaster. <laughs> okay, is Loot gonna die? She gets attacked by two. None of them have two range. Okay, some... Some tactical errors there. Great cleric level, thanks. Marissa can pick her up. I probably should have done a take drop with Marissa. I mean, we have 12 speed. We have the angelic robe. And they're gonna attack Tethys. It's not hopeless. Oh, just keep her there by loot. No way to get a Lance Reaver on her, right? Wait, no! Loot has the Lance Reaver. Reaved? Are we sure she's one star? Crimson Flash! Are you kidding me? Tethys Tank! Good thing we got Tethys Tank! Good thing we got Tethys Tank! How'd you get hit twice? No problem. I mean, a lot of problems, but nobody died. Oh, God. Don't tell Kaga. All right, Garrick. Can you get him? Oh, the Slim Lance. Javelin, 10 damage. A steel blade? That's a terrible hit rate. Boss, got this weapon for you. Reaved! Okay, good hit rate with fire. Can we get a... Arter. How much damage does Arter do? Why? You have to deal 22 damage. Double 11? It's double 10, that's not good enough. Double 11? It's a double 11! Erica the Elusive? Training all of our units! sword. Okay, leaves him on five. Crit does not kill us. Ouch.
we can use our javelin to strike this enemy. Okay. Now we got this guy. I don't think the rapier is effective against horses. Refresh. Is this the Don- is it the Don Brigade? Nah, it's just a Pegasus Knight. Ouch. You think you could strike Erica the Elusive? You did, but you can't stand up to Erica the Eviscerator. Okay. We're surviving. I think we're almost done with the map. What level is Vanessa? 15 with one speed level up. Yeah, thanks for your contribution, Inez. He he did do the most important job, which was one-shotting the Falco Knight, but I wanted a little bit more. Okay, they're out of shots. That one's not out of shots, though. Fun fact, my Vanessa capped speed at level 12. That's not a fun fact. How dare you? I need the door key. What happened to door keys? Expert gaming here. What I probably should have done is just gotten it out of supply and traded to a mounted unit. We could then open the door, but whatever, it's fine. My brain is goo. Steel sword. 19 health. There's no way we die, right? We'll feed it to loot next level. Joshua, Kyle, Vanessa. We need any of these guys? What happened to door keys? I dropped them, my supply got full. Ah! <laughs> Gotta make sure that nobody valuable gets shot by the ballista. We don't get doubled, right? Free kill? Let's just give it to Garrick. Well, no, Garrick's gonna get a lot of a lot of kills. Get him, loot. Loot level? Loot the learned? Yeah, we're level ten. I've never seen this many blank level ups in my life. I can't believe we wasted the speed wings on this chick. Do chicks even have wings? I guess they do, they just can't fly yet. Loot the lazy, what is this? Right, we'll get speed next level. Can't believe we wasted the speed wing on loot. How many more shots does this guy have? He didn't use any, okay. That guy can go up to there. We definitely need to heal Seth. Prodigy, more like Poodigy! A Vanessa leveling 13 times without a speed level is a point zero zero six seven tenths. Out of 10 million Vanessas, 
ours is one of only 67 to have 12 speed. That's so bad. I guess we got really lucky. More loot levels? Maybe. We're raising all these units, but they're so bad. Loot is actually pretty slow. That's one of her issues. Oh, he's actually getting off the ballista. Wow, what an honor. stand on the house for the avoid boost I don't know if we're going to Boster's Tower I'd rather not we might just for to get hero Garrick though although I, he looks pretty heroic to me how heroic is he not Garrick the... Thirty percent speed growth, so... He actually does need speed. It's fine. We definitely should have given him the speed wing. Huge mistake not to. Longbow! You can give it to Inez! <laughs> Alright, what's this guy? He's a sage. He's got 16 speed. A light magic specialized sage. He's got a divine. Base 12. How big is Pablo, though? Pablo's only 7, so he loses 5? So he only has 11 speed, so we have 15 speed we can double him. Wish I had a speed wing. Why do we give it to loot? People like loot, I wonder why. Pablo the Pipsqueak. Alright, we're gonna do Garrick the Gladiator, though. In this house. I've heard that Prince Inez of Frelia is a fantastic tactician. Grotto took Renee with no trouble, but Frelia still has yet to fall. They say it's because Prince Inez has spies reporting every move the Empire makes. At the same time, all enemy spies in Frelia are exposed and executed swiftly. That means that none of Frelia's secrets are ever reported back to the Empire. I've never met Prince Inez, but he doesn't sound like a man you'd want as an enemy. I don't mind. Wouldn't be scared of this guy. You see him against that Pegasus knight? He was pretty embarrassing. It's not C's, is it? No, it is C's. So we do have to actually move Eric up. Vanessa, at least you can visit this house, right? You know, we have no king in the Republic of Mincino. We're governed instead by a council of elders. It's a lot better than any stuffy old monarchy, I can tell you that. You see, anyone can be a leader in Mincino if he's old enough. Of course, maybe that's why the country's in such a mess right now. Uh oh. What happens if Inez enters the house? I assume it's the same. It's not like they know what Inez looks like. But I mean, we can test it. We've got some turns. A 
Elder Pablo used his fortune to build his own private army. Now he's using it to wrest control of Mincino from the council's hands. Please, help Lord Klimt so that he can help us. Alright. Garrick the Gladiator. We need money. Well, Marina. Are you not entertained? Never mind. We need more gold. <laughs> we do have a graphic for that. We need more gold. We need more gold. This guy's got a silver or a white gem, but we can't sell it. Whoops. Whatever. Let's finish this. Hey, we got more gold. <laughs> Can't use it in the arena, but... Big thanks to Prometheus for the... Gracious gift of convenience. 20 hit pin missile! Must have skill like, thank you! <laughs> if only we could use it in the arena. Let's just kill him. Let's use our killing edge. Gotta get the Natasha support. There's no way this guy moves, right? There's no way. There's no way. Inez in the house? Let's see if he still says he never met him. I've never met Prince Inez, but he doesn't sound like a man you'd want as an enemy. Duly noted. If I meet him, I'll let him know you said that. Hopefully, we can get out of here next turn. Okay, is this it for Pablo? I'm here to kill you, Pablo. Not even a crit does it, and I take 20 damage, and I... This is really bad. I don't know. Five dollar microtransaction from Dull Paul. Thank you for the microtransaction. Mm. Why do Pauls keep dying in the FE stream? Well, this isn't Paul, it's Pablo. Just dance him? What if he dies? How does Erica do? Eric with the Shamshir. Also does not kill him. It has a better crit rate because of the Shamshir. Seth's support? With the B Seth support. That's a lot better. Now he does die with the crit. And we can't be crit. So one crit kills him, and we have to hit both. That's a lot better. That's a lot better. A lot better.
No one can withstand the might of Grotto! Logic dictates we join now or be subjugated later. I made the rational decision! The only decision! You missed? You think you can stand up to Erica the Eviscerator? Nice logic, nerd. Ah! No! I cannot die when there is such wealth to be had. You greedy geezer. This is the end for you. We need more gold! I hope the gold was worth it. R retreat mercenaries to me. Pablo the Perished. Strength? Oh! I mean, it's the stat we need most. I'll take it. Hey, Guiding Ring. I've been defeated, but I can't afford to fall here? Why is he so stingy? We did it! I found you, Erica! Seems you're as skilled as reports say. This is going to be fun. Yes, yes, yes. I do so love strong women. Not woke! Shall we attack General Volter? No. We'll pass on dessert for now. Okay, definitely not woke. Allow them to escape. We're leaving. Prince Inez, are you well? It's gonna say something arrogant, right? Huh. As if... As if those Minchino slugs could touch me. Oh. Maybe we don't need Kaiba. Erica. Sorry for troubling you. No, it was no trouble. Oh, Prince Inez, thank goodness you're unharmed. Who are you? Oh, where are my manners? I'm a member of Mincino's Council of Elders. My name is Klimt. Council member? Oh. So you're one of the traitors who ordered... Peace, please. I have no intention of opposing you or quarreling with you. I too have been marked for death by Pablo. What is this all about? It's a shameful tale. Carcino is- oh sorry, Mincino is a nation divided. As you know, Mincino has no king but is ruled by a council. But now the council has broken apart into factions, mired in discord. Link in the description, please join if you're able to. Factions? You're saying that the whole of Mincino has not betrayed Frelia? Correct. The moderate factions prefer to preserve our alliance with Frelia. Filthy moderates. If you're not with me, then you're my enemy. Pablo's factions wish to endear us to Grotto, to surrender us to their armies. Once Pablo realized he couldn't ply us with bribes, he began to have us assassinated. I learned the word ply from Golden Sun. It's a, uh, the water healing spell. Those of us who remain have taken refuge underground. We oppose him where we can. If you hadn't shown up, I'm not certain I would still be breathing. I do recall enemy troops combing this area when I arrived. They were searching for you, is that it? Pablo has usurped- Do fighters know what usurped means? Usurped rule of the council. We had no choice but to hide. Not all of Mincino's council has gone over to Grotto's side, though. You must believe me. The whole of Mincino does not believe as Pablo does. I see. Lord Klimt, I understand the hardships you've endured. I'm pleased to hear all of Mincino is not our foe. I will depart for Frelia to explain our circumstance to the king. I think it is best if you return to Frelia as well. Pablo has considerable wealth, and he commands a vast mercenary force. I'm sure he'll send more of them this way as soon as he is able. Gotta move, gotta move this. The uh, Prince Inez! Tethys and I are staying with you. Is that gonna work? Yes, I would appreciate the help. Starting now, you've got a new contract. Though, the pay's double. For the president of Kaiba Corps. No price is too great. The two of you hadn't stayed with me back there. Would not have survived, it's true. Garrick, Tethys, thank you. 
Well, that's not Sigma at all. You have my gratitude. Tell me something, Prince. Do you get, uh, hit on the head during that last skirmish? That's unkind. My neck is not so stiff that I cannot show gratitude. I would ask for your continued support in the days ahead. We both ask for your help. We've got a deal. Let's keep each other alive. Although, let's be real. I'm the one who's going to be carrying you guys. Ah, there you are, sister. Uh-oh. Bonds of blood. One is five stars. One is one star. <laughs> they have the same hair color, so they're related. Ewan, how is it? What are you doing here? I told you to wait in the inn and behave yourself, didn't I? Yeah, but you always run off and disappear. It's not fair. It's not fair. How many times have we said that this stream? I want to have adventures too. You are such an imp. I am not out here running about having fun, you know. I know. That's why I came to see you. I can help. Untrue. My teacher finally got around to teaching me some magic. Check this out. <laughs> hey, knock it off. You shouldn't be using magic here. Well, I just thought maybe I could help you work is all. I can protect you now, sis. Come on, take me with you. I don't want to stay in that inn anymore. Oh. All right. I'll go and speak to the chief and Princess Erica. Don't wander off while I'm gone. Yahoo! It's definitely how we said it, right? Princess Erica, Prince Inez. I think we should follow the advice we've been given and return to Frelia. Continuing on through Mincino like this is too great a risk to your safety. The peril is self-evident. However, I have to reach Jehenna, and the only way is through Mincino. If I don't hurry, nations will fall, one after another, to Grotto's hunger. Inez is right, and the road to Rouston leads me through both Mincino and Jehenna. However, pressing on will only invite more mercenary attacks. Hey, I've got an answer! I know a way that leads over the mountains straight to Jehenna. Want me to guide you? And who might you be? You and shush! You know better than to interrupt people when they're talking. I'm so sorry. Please let me take my brother out of the way. Yes, please do. Come on, Ewan. Let's go. Let's go, Ewan. No, 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 wait, please. Do you really know a route through the mountains? That's what I said. At the top of that mountain, there's a village named Carpeen. There's a passage that leads right behind to the rest of the Greek forces. Hmm, I don't know what I'm talking about. Sorry. That's where my teacher lives. I'm sure he'll lead you through if you ask him nicely. What is your teacher's name? My teacher? Oh, his name's Sala. Sala. I've heard that name on the lips of Frelia's spy network lately. He's a powerful wielder of magic who has been fighting bandits and monsters. The spies mentioned something about a Care Palin, if I mention. If I remember. What do you think? Hmm. If my spies are accurate, this Sala is someone we can trust. Very well, Ewan. Will you take us to meet your teacher? Are you sure we can do this, Ewan? <laughs> Not a problem! All right, everyone, see if you can keep up. Hey, you don't have celerity. Where are you going? That's a different red-haired mage. If you know your Fire Emblem lore, then you know what I'm talking about. Chapter 10. Chapter 10, Revolt at Karchi... I got it this time. Chapter 10, Revolt at Minchino. More like revolting units at Minchino. Oh, that was horrible. Creeping darkness. What a sad stream. <laughs> well, I don't mean that. Overall, I had fun. I hope you did too. However, our level ups are ass. Ah, uh, yes, Celerity Boots. <laughs> oh, boy. Alright. So, we're going to take stock of our current units. We're gonna go over the sacred spreadsheet, the pinned comment. Then, we will go ahead and... conclude for today. So, I believe... 
the remainder of the playthrough, probably three more streams is what I'm thinking. Finish Erica Root. Then a major training arc. Probably including Tower of Alni, Maybe. And then the final stream will be... Uh, finishing the game? I don't think we're gonna do Lagdu Ruins. Finishing the game, and then... The tier list. So that's the plan. Three more streams, probably. Because we're moving, uh... We don't exactly have the greatest speed on this stream. <laughs> I don't even think we messed around that much, aside from the barrier boosting. Like, these last levels... The one and these two in Minchino, we just tried to play them, but our units are so terrible that it takes forever. Speaking of our units being terrible... Erica's actually okay. Very average Erica. Wouldn't expect to have 13 strength. Pretty good. Arthur has not been looking good, but we're not too invested. Seth is our hero. Six stars for sure. His level ups have also been great. All three of them. We don't talk about Vanessa. The stuff of nightmares. The Demon King's minions are among us. I can't believe how bad our Vanessa is. Good for content, I guess. One speed level. Horrible. Our Joshua is also kind of okay, but he's, he's looking a little noodle army, but it's not that bad. I, I don't know why we use the speed wing on loot. People really like loot. I don't, but like, she's okay. Who cares about Natasha? Kyle is definitely one of the units in our army. He's okay. Good bases. Too bad he's a sniper. I see great things in Garrick's future, okay? Great things in Garrick's future. Probably gonna need to get Hero Garrick for the next map. Five star dancing. One star unit. I, I don't know what else I can say about Marissa. So bad. Like, I don't know if we can afford to mess around with Marissa, okay? Not messing with Marissa. The Fartra sequel is on the dock? Oh no. Okay. Well, let's see what's up. First, be sure to smash that like button to help increase the reach of the stream. And thanks as always. There's always a light in the darkness. We can buy torches. Can we buy torches? Maybe we can't buy any torches. We can buy torches, thanks to the mighty Patreons. Thanks to all the Patreons for making this, uh, I guess you could call it content, content possible. Be sure to evolve into a mighty Patreon using the link in the description. And I guess if you're having trouble joining the Discord, I think it's a bug, but maybe we can help you during one of the streams. Let's troubleshooting. All right, time to open the sacred spreadsheet. Sacred spreadsheet is open. And... I'm looking for the... option that says RuneScape. I found RuneScape. Okay, here we go. That's... <laughs> What's going on here? The consequences of going to bed before the stream is over. Burned intern. These interns have so many weapon proficiencies. They've used pink slips, they've used computers, now they can wield fire extinguishers. So many skills. I hope they have better than D rank and fire extinguishers. We did rate some new units today. Marissa. 
Marissa from Toho is an FE8? I have no idea what that means, I'm sorry. I've never played Toho. Garrick and Tethys. Now we can describe him as Giga Chad and Giga Stacy. He's got great stats, comes at level 2 with a hero crest. True! Dancer to 5 star. True! <laughs> Why'd you bring a dancer to use a unit that can fight? Untrue! What is this? Quick reminder that there was a Fire Emblem anime. Oh, that's the one under this. What does this say? ASMR to help you sleep. I beat you up until you become unconscious. Okay. We're looking for new- Oh, Minchino! No! Buff Erica? There's no actual... Art of Erica with a Minchino, right? Somebody made this? Let's go Minchino? Okay, Alyo, the viewer, made this. You also made the... Lab Rochelle, right? Well, well done. Let's go Minchino. Why did you choose Minchino, though? Terrible Pokemon. Her corner here. Now Renak has a hat. <laughs> he didn't have one before. This is the same hat the interns have. Renak the reluctant intern. <laughs> well, we're not paying him, it's true. We do have the Regileaf. Tap. It's awful. Don't speak to me that way. <laughs> it's Binks the warrior. Renak, it's time for your 131st skirmish without pay. Yes, Larcha. Beat it, nerds, you're fired! <laughs> There is a Kaiba portrait, wow. I've never met Prince and Esby, doesn't sound like a man you'd want as an enemy. Screenshotted. What is this? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hopefully not demonetized. Dodged. That's the dangers of doing this on stream. I hope we're safe. We are only able to do this because people do play by the rules, so... Whoever that bad actor was, I would ask that you don't try that again. I think we're safe, though. Fire Emblem Kaiba portrait. I think we dodged demonetization, though. Uh-oh. The sequel to Fartra. I th we have to update the slow emote, right? It's now ha it now has to be Vanessa. You even gave them a Pegasus. Vanessa the Vanquished. It's not fair. Okay, come on, guys. Come on, guys. Hopefully we dodge demonetization, but hey, look, it's loot. If you don't play along, I'm gonna have to actually lock the spreadsheet before we look at it, and people are gonna have to look through it beforehand. We're just asking you guys to play along nicely. Otherwise, we're gonna have to be more strict. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is that meme, right? 99% of units quit just before they obtain wild speed. <laughs> she's not even- oh no, she's walking back. So sad. The Speed Wars. <laughs> Refreshed. How so? Is it some new kind of magic? It's the Lemonade guy, he's back, our favorite unit. It's not fair. <laughs> Refreshed. An error occurred. Uh oh. I think we have to wait for all the pictures to load. Error. <laughs> Tap. We're still on Magvel memes. I think we've seen everything on Magvel memes, right? 
Uh oh. Arthur and the swarm of audios. No. How could they do this to him? Thanks for the help, loot. Adios, Arthur. I've seen your level ups. Terrible. Mages of Magvel. There's new comments on Inez and Marissa to the right. Okay. Inez and Marissa. They're over here, right? GB Archer out of 5. Sure Shot Hype. Fake Kaiba out of 5. Not the best ratings. And Marissa. Marissa. Sounds very good. 7 base strength and 30% growth. Kaiba from Walmart. Costco Kaiba. As if those third-rate mercenaries with their fourth-rate weapons could best me. What a sham sheer. I don't know if I can actually censor the VOD because it's too long. They don't let you edit VODs if they're too long. Prince Inez, are you well? Oh, er Ephraim is also involved here. I'm Erica, and I'm Ephraim, the Renee twins. Never forget. Goodbye, RIP Ephraim, cancelled. I'm not sure what scene this is from, but maybe the guy just says Erica. I cut the seal. Ready, go. Kimi ni smile. Astari yume. Wow. Great song. Emblem of the Sacred Stones, Erica. Light affinity. Hopefully the VOD isn't taken down. Hopefully not. But we'll see if YouTube, uh, if YouTube d deigns that it must be deleted. Sheet 9. Hang on here. Sharp FE moment. I don't think there's anything on sheet 8 or 9. I'm just gonna delete those, okay? People are just adding sheets. Too many sheets! Stop adding sheets! Are all these sheets for different characters? Oh, okay, it's an accident, okay. I've changed the editing privileges. You should still be able to see, but you can't uh, edit anything at the moment. There's one just called Bofadies. But there's nothing on it. Hopefully somebody just added a bunch of sheets by mistake. I could see it happening. Trust was our first mistake. Well, it wasn't a mistake for a while. Unfortunate. We made it a long time. We've done a lot of excels with nobody doing anything like this. Very unfortunate. Trust no one. Isn't that what Fire Emblem taught us? Okay, we're back. Here's Seth. The, the Seth hologram. 
That's how he talked to us on Ephraim Root. I know Seth got me. He he saved our lives. How would we have done the Erica maps we did without Seth? It was definitely correct to send Seth with Erica. We would have been we would have been uh, cooked without him. Amelia. We got some Amelia action today from this. From the ace support. Oh no. Ross, what are you doing? Fumbled. Sibling zoned. He did it to himself. You might build your Amelia? Sure. We'll look at it next time. The War arch Archives. I don't know if there's anything... There weren't any new wars today. And here's Charizard. Still our hero. Nice scarf. The Dancer Wars? The Dancer Wars happen every time. But it's not really a war, because we know we're right. We got the new Minchino. Oh, this is new. Ah, oh, Renek! <laughs> Somebody made this as well, right? The Renek Fox. She's not paying him. This isn't fair. Oh no. RIP to anti mage. Foul sorceries is gone. Check the bottom of memes? Okay. We'll meet Sally next time. You drew that one too? Excited to see the colored version. Oh. We, we knew these guys were here. How did the Demon King get here? Oh no, he's joined... The true villains. The true villains. Where did the Demon King go? Okay, I don't know where the Demon King went, but... Scary. Oh, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I don't know where he went, because nobody else can actually edit it, but... I guess we defeated the Demon King. That was easy. Good thing we had all that res. Send me emails at importedcheese at gmail.com. Well, unfortunate that we were unable to review the spreadsheet without incident, so we'll have to be more strict from now on. Probably before the review, we'll have to lock it and have... The dedicated interns review it and make sure it's safe. Thank you everybody who played along for as long as we managed to make it without incident. But we will have to be more strict going forward. Sad. Nothing but repeated tragedies. Magvel truly is a land without light. I trusted you. How could you do this to me? And he never becomes a blue unit. He stabs him right after that. Don't watch the rest of the video. He stays red. 
It's the price of betrayal. Uh, the price of betrayal might also be 776. <laughs> wow, Kaga's greatest game. 776 uh, microtransactions from Prometheus. Thank you for the mm. 776 micro microtransaction. I mean, getting trolls like this just means you're finally a big YouTuber. We'll be getting 100,000 subscribers in no time. Thank you for the optimism. We'll see. Hopefully I can just trim it out of the VOD, but it's so long that I might not be able to. We'll just hope that YouTube doesn't, like, destroy it. It would be unfortunate. Alright. I think that is it for today. Thank you everybody for joining. Next week we'll probably do three more? I don't know who would be on the thumbnails, but we'll we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. We will get you in tomorrow. Or next time. We will get you in next time. And I guess just to uh Yeah, I don't think the bots will pick up on it, so hopefully we're okay. So just to reiterate our plan, it's probably going to be Remainder of Erica Root, then Remainder of the game. The game is actually not very long after the twins reunite. It's like four or five more maps. And then probably last stream will be Tower of Volney and... Tower of Volney and the finale, and then the tier list. So we'll do the same thing we did at the end of FE7, where we just review all of the... All of the units, not necessarily based on how they performed in our run, but we'll be giving our thoughts on them. We'll probably do Tower of Only. I don't know if we'll do Lagdo Ruins or Lagdo Ruins. I'm not sure. The Super Dungeon. We'll see. Just because it'll take a long time. And I've seen the, I've seen Mecha's playthrough of the Lagdo Ruins. It's nuts on Lunatic. We. It just might be too difficult. But we'll see. That's the plan next week. However, mark your calendars for tomorrow. Because remember, although the Fire Emblem streams do actually do very well, thank you all for watching, I do hope you enjoy. Despite the misery of Magvel, I think we actually are having a good time. Remember, of course, this is not a Fire Emblem channel, right? This is a Pokemon channel. So, of course, we have to play the best Pokemon game, Pokemon Channel. I'll see you tomorrow. Keep in mind that I live in the future, okay? So there's a very specific reason why I'm choosing to do the greatest Pokemon game, Pokemon Channel, tomorrow. You might find the way we play the game a bit confusing. But, uh, given the date, I think it's gonna make a lot of sense. It's gonna be great, okay? I'll see you there. I love Pokemon. <laughs>This was a disaster, and you're still here, so I guess it's alright. Alright. 
How long did we go today? T almost 10 hours exactly. What a casual. I guess last question for you guys. We do need three more Magvel thumbnails. So I'm thinking... Obviously, Larshell and Science, right? Science. Shadows. Because we are going to have Mulder respec into Shadow. Science. Shadows. Demons? I don't know. Or maybe the last one can actually just be friends. We'll see. Don't have to decide on that now. But I'm taking suggestions. Science is definitely one. Because remember, they've all been like... So it was siblings, axes, lances, magic. Science, shadows. The last one might actually just be friends. Friends with all the trainees, and that'll be the last one. I think, though... If we do that, this is a mild commission. We had them all in their training arcs, right? They were all in their small forms? Oh, maybe light. But if we have the three powerful trainees, maybe they can be united and that can be... friends. That's telling a story through the thumbnails. Could also be light, though. We'll see. My only hesitant, my only hesitancy about the chads is that usually the chads are at like one angle, so they can't quite all line up. We already have Chad Ross. That's true. Some powerful form of the trainees, where all three of them can fit. Maybe buff teams. There's plenty of time to decide. We can even discuss it tomorrow during... Totri. We can even discuss it tomorrow during Pokemon Channel, which is going to be very exciting. Trainee Hydreigon versus the Demon King. The Demon King doesn't stand a chance. Well, we've seen how horribly Lab Rochelle mistreats Renak, forcing him to go to the ends of the earth and put his life on the line for not even low pay, literally no pay. That's illegal, okay? That's abuse. I would never do that to you guys. I treat the interns well, okay? Even though they never work on the first time I actually try to use them. Or the second time. Or the third time. I pet one intern. Why are you poking me again? Poke, poke, poke. Is that all you do? <laughs> And I cast one with nothing, which for one cheese man at instant speed allows you to discard all viewers. Wait, why would you ever play this? <laughs>